Hello, and good to see you, chat. Thanks so much for being here, everybody. I hope you came with a clean ass. What am I saying that for? All right, it's it's finger family. Um, we're gonna get uh, we're gonna get fingered here, guys. Um, I don't know how you feel about that, but not in the physical way where there's like a finger inside your body. You're gonna get mentally fingered, which. Feels similar, actually. Um, there's some crossover. You're going to get mentally, mentally, mentally fingered. Um, we're going to finger your mind. That's not better. Hey, doozies, thanks for nine months. Uh, and Colgan, what's up? Also, Sam, thank you. Navashield, thank you. Infected, nay, hey, thank you. Uh, love him, thank you. T. Gyokoro Abhores, guys, thanks so much. I, I think we still have a little backlog of, of, of resubs, which uh, is, again, just a really overwhelming uh, feeling. Guys, thank you so much. Um, yeah, no, I didn't see the Mario movie yet. Uh, make room for fingers, guys. Go poop if you gotta. It's coming. T. Gyokoro, you, you, you like? How we've never watched the single... Well, we did watch one Finger Family video. What was that? Last The last time I streamed this? But, like, generally, we're not actually looking at the Finger Family, like, song videos. Like, that's a really specific thing. I don't know how I ended up calling it this. I think I was just wrong. And then we just ran with it. You know what I'm saying? Like... F uh, FXAID, Sparkles, McChunk, Colostomy Bagel. Thank you so much, bud. <laughs> A classic. Mirot, uh, Light. Oh, Draymond's? Who, who's that? Uh, thank you, Draymond's. Bl Blepony. Uh, Danny, Vincent, Tio. Hey, uh, Gummy Worms. Guys, thank you so much. Um, it's finger adjacent. Yeah, that's the answer. Um, Somehow I started using Finger Family. As, people keep pointing this out too, but I, I somehow started use, using um, Finger Family as like just a catch-all for, I guess, like algorithm bait. And I don't know, like I should have got corrected a lot earlier because now I'm just everybody knows what Finger Family means when on this Twitch channel, you know, and it doesn't mean. What it's supposed to mean. Uh, Lumpy, thanks for seven months. Appreciate it. What is the cum... The cum rag on the floor. It's a cum rag. Guys, I'm on a lot of drugs right now. I think I have to, um... I have to be right back, guys, okay? Um, I'm on, like, muscle relaxers and, like, steroids and stuff. And it's making me... Yeah, for the neck. And it's making me, like, a little bit woozy. So I think I gotta... I, I gotta be right back, okay? Yeah. All right, or maybe I just gotta work through this. Um, oh. Yeah, fuck. Oh, this doesn't feel good at all. Oh, no, it's not like vomit. It's like a head thing where I feel really dizzy suddenly. Oh, panic attack feeling? No, it, it, it's like... Just... Maybe, but I'm not really panicked right now. Like, it's not... Vertigo? It's more like a vertigo-type feeling, you know? Mike's been sucking too much penis. Thanks, Dr. Chat. Wow, this feels bad. Why is this happening? Fuck. Um... I get that when I eat tiramisu. Why would tiramisu specifically do... Oh, espresso. Well, there's your problem. You blasted like 500 milligrams of caffeine to the dickhole. Uh, Al Manax, thanks for four months. Yes, yeah, it's, it's a jizz rag. Um, Hedgy, thanks for uh, a full year. My God, thank you so much, guys. It's not unusual with first time meds. I started a course of something called uh, methylprednisone. Methylprednisolone. Because it was supposed to uh, make the swelling go down and the, ne the neck is supposed to make like 
I don't know, the, the, it's to, to make the inflammation go down, which makes the, hopefully, like, the disc that's fucking with my nerves will, like, go back into my spine. Or something. Prednisone. It's a, it's a steroid, guys. I'm gonna get fucking slow. Guys, I'm gonna get jacked from this, guys. I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna be like fucking hulking out over here, dude. Pregnizone? Wow, Mike is pregnant. Mike is pregnant, pregnant in that. Uh, you have a pinched nerve. I, I don't know what it is because the doctors refuse to give me a, um, an MRI. So I, I, are you leaned back in your chair? Yes, I'm trying to not hold my head in certain positions to like exacerbate the problem. You know what I'm thinking though? I, I, I definitely need one of those, uh, Herman Miller chairs, dude, because... I don't think I don't think this chair that I'm sitting in right now is doing me any favors in the way of like spine health, you know, like it's not really I mean, I mean, I think it was maybe more ergonomic when I bought it, but now it's like the ass is caving in, you know what I mean? Uh, ballet Parker uh, parking. Thanks for nine months. Welcome back, King Chupa review when I still haven't seen Chupa or the Mario movie, so. Um, hey, Lindsay, they said that the prednisone can cause menstrual irregularities, so you may get irregularly kicked out of the house for a week. <laughs> oh, let's hope not. Um, yeah, like, I just want... And, and, and someone in chat, hey, Lexi, they said, did you try pouring honey and lemon on yourself? Like, just pour it, like, on my back? Like, just put, like, pour it on my neck? Mike, sorry to hear about your fucking bulging discs. Pour some, uh... Did you try pouring honey with lemon? Like, take, just take a, a, a tea and, and lemon shower. The meme, of course, is that chat... Apparently believes, like, if somebody gets shot, they'll shove a lemon in the bullet hole. Um... Because again, they're like, they're like, oh, dude, you know, drink tea with honey and lemon. Drink tea with honey and lemon. My vocal cords are like ham like fucking hamburger meat. And they're like, oh, yeah, have some tea. No, dude. No, dude. Um. So we're going <laughs> to. Mike, have you tried going to a chiropractor? Yeah. I might, I might go to a chiropractor, but like, it's that fucking song again. Shut up! Um, no, not, he, he's not really a chiropractor. He's, he's more like, a, again, he's like a sports medicine guy. I told you guys about this. And then you said I, that I got scammed. I didn't get scammed, okay? No, he didn't even just like... I don't even think he did anything to me. Like, he just fucking, like, he looked at the MRIs and he was like, here's what I think. You know? It wasn't like... And I was like, alright, I, I, I like your, uh, uh, opinion because in your opinion, I don't get spinal surgery. Guys, why do I have a feeling I look like the mayor of Whoville again? Yeah, but I, I feel like the sports medicine and the chiropractic have, like, a, a kind of a crossover. I don't know how to explain it. I, I am going to go to physical therapy. Limes. Somebody said Limes has a Herman Miller. Yes, but I have an important question. Did Limes buy it new because they're, like, $2,000, guys? The mind palace door swung open. She did. I told you about my fear, right? That I buy a new Herman Miller so I can take advantage of the warranty. And because, you know what'll happen? Because I bought one, because I bought one, the company will shutter. Like they'll just shut down. Like like somebody, you know, like they'll find out that you know, I, I I don't know the board of directors was was like, I don't know, selling drugs to kids or something, and then they'll just shut down the whole company. Like I, I something horrible will happen, and I'll be I I won't be able to take advantage of that warranty. A century-old company will go bankrupt over you. Yes. Is that really that outrageous to believe that? Especially if you've been watching these streams for a while and you know what my life is like. Guys, thank you for the scam train, by the way. really appreciate it. 
selling chairs since 1908 until Jabroni Mike buys one. Oh, fuck. I'm just going to go buy a Herman Miller, bro. I, why do I keep wanting to call Her Herman Miller Warby Parker? Like, what is... I, that's glasses. Why am I? Why am I doing? Why am I doing that? I, I stopped myself every time, but the tem it, it, the temptation is there. Same type of name, I, I guess. It's like I got somebody's name, and it has four syllables. I don't know. Um, yeah, his luck is that bad. It, it is though. Herman killed Mil Miller and got canceled on Twitter. Um, hey, Stella, the company I work for has, uh, everybody who in the office has a, a Herman Miller. Yeah, but again, they're so expensive. Like, how are these companies affording to buy hundreds of them? It's nuts. Uh, Fry and Mavel, guys, thanks for the resubs. Um, guys, oh, I definitely want to buy it as, a, you know, use it as a tax write-off, absolutely. Lobster, right? Hey, thanks for five months, man. You're the best. Stop it. You're my favorite lobster. Um, you know what I need, guys? It became clear while I was doing my taxes this year. I need a business credit card. You know, like how people have credit cards that they only use for like work shit. I need one of those. I need one of those. But I heard that like I didn't see the Zelda trailer. I heard that some of them have, like, points. So if you use the credit card enough times, you can, like, I don't know, you get, like, free plane tickets or some shit. And I'm trying to figure out, like, which... Who's got the best fucking system for that? Like, like what, what, what credit card company should I use for that, dude? What do you think? Cost calls, somebody said. This guy puts, like, like... F f like hotel rooms and business lunches on a fucking Costco card. Well, we're, yo, it, it's fine as long as the business lunches are the dollar hot dog and pizza slice at Costco. They're taking like potential clients for dollar hot dogs. Wait, no, dollar fifty hot dogs. Those rule. I love the pizza. That pizza, dude. Really. Walmart card. Can I get one real answer? Yeah, I'm looking just one. American I see a lot of people saying American Express. Who is getting the best reward points? Meme edit needed. <laughs> Who's getting the best reward points? Comment below. Vote below. Jabladder, thanks for uh 45 months, man. You pronounce Costco weird. That's what your mom said when I nodded inside of her at Costco. I gotta stop saying things like that. It's not nice. Amex. Yeah. I'm gonna buy an Amex. I'm gonna put a Warby Park. Fuck! I'm gonna put a Hermit Miller... Her, Hermit... Hermit Miller chair on it. Okay? That's why she doesn't... She doesn't shop there anymore. Yo, I bent her over one of the free sample uh, tables. You know what I mean? And I fucking, I, I pounded out her pussy over a fucking tray of spinach quiches. Bro, it was wild. In full fucking public view of everyone. Michael. Beat that pussy up. Beat that pussy up. Beat that pussy up. You know what I'm talking about, those spinach quiche, quiches? Quiches. Wisp, no, Wisp said, Michael, I think you should do reaction content for Zelda while it is a hot topic. All right, good idea. You know what? Uh, I did not watch the trailer. I saw some kerfuffle on Twitter. I saw people gooning over Cronando. Um, I'll watch it right now. I haven't seen it. I'll watch it right now. Can I get a link to this bitch? Um, Cronando had fat tits? What? Let me see these tits, bro. My buddy Eric is gooning over Cronendo. Okay. 
Cornando's got fat, meaty tits, guys. Cornando's fat tits. All right, hold on a second. Fuck. Hold on. Hey, Dry Crow. Thanks for uh, the reset, buddy. Also, Micah. Oh, thank you for the uh, the reset, Micah. Um, Herman Miller's have a 10-year warranty. Oh, d d no, no, no. Hold on, because I was told it was a lifetime warranty. Hobo. That, that's how you justify a $2,000 chair. Some people buy Herman Miller's cheap and then turn in the warranty for a brand new one. Okay, okay. Let me ask you a question because because that did occur to me. Hey, programs. Uh, what's up? Thanks for five months. Hold on, because... I, I was thinking, like, if you buy a used one, you can't get a warranty on it. Like, they're, they're not going to honor a warranty on a used chair. Right? Like, no way. Why would they do that? Or here's what you do. You well, chair scamming strats. You no, no one's gonna. When you get like a warranty certificate, you have to register the chair because they they have a record of you buying it. That's how they know. Like I can prove it's like, hello, I am Jabroni Mike, and I, you know, here's my receipt, dude. Do you think when you go buy a used one, you're gonna get the receipt and that has somebody else's name on it and shit? Finn, thanks for 21 months. Ready to get my brain fingered. Love seeing that kind of enthusiasm. Thanks for being here tonight. Get a mildly shat in office chair on Facebook Market. I don't want any shit in there, guys. And my shit threshold is 10%, okay? That's the amount of shit I'm willing to tolerate in one of these chairs, okay? Print a fake certificate. That's not how it works, man. Shit mites in the chair. All right, so here's the plan, right? You buy a Herman Miller chair, you wait the 10 years, okay? Apparently, they're supposed to last longer than that because they're supposed to be God chairs that cost $2,000. Nine years and like 11 months into your warranty, you just take a sledgehammer to this thing. You know, like, you just go to town on it. <laughs> like, does it, like does it, is that, does that work? You know, you, you think they won't know. I don't know. I, I, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Jabroni Mike chair scam. They're, they're saying, so you, here's, here's the scam. Here's the scam. You buy a used Herman Miller and then you take it to their headquarters or, or, or something, or you, you call them. I don't know. And you're like, Hey, the warranty is up. Or, or, I don't know, I, I I need a new chair. And they just give you a brand new one and replace the old one? Why would they do that? Why would they? No, because if I was them, I would say, okay, show me, you know, this, the, the, the documentation that you have a warranty. You, you know, like, it's not going to work, guys. That's, that's not, no, that's silly. That's silly. This is important. I need one of these things, dude. I want one of these things. You don't have a good track record of keeping receipts. No, I don't. All right. So here's the deal. The deal, fat. Um, we're gonna look at this. Uh, bot, botwa. Actually, it's now it's now called Tears of the Kingdom. It's called Toftka. The new the new Zelda is called Toft. Tatka, tat no tat tatka, tatka, tat tatka. Now it's the same map, right? It is the exact same map. It's it's not kinda. It's the same map with more tets. All right. Let's let's check it out, guys. I haven't seen this. Um, I'm gonna obviously gonna want to gonna want to play this game and, and, and probably stream this game. So, um, holy fuck, they doubled like they quadrupled down on 
by Twink Link for this one, huh? Y'all, he's fucking, yeah, that's holy shit. Uh, Junon, thanks for 13 months. Bro, he's wearing like, like disco ball earrings and shit. He's like, he's really embracing it, man. That's, that's Zelda, apparently. Oh. <laughs> All right. You know what? You know what that reminds me of. Do you remember? Should I even try to find this? I'm just gonna get porn if I Google image search this. You know the that the really horny art of Link. You know, I I know you know what I'm talking about. I know you know the one I'm talking. You everybody has seen this. Everybody has seen this. That really horny art of of Link. I, I think as like the the uh, the Gerudo. I know what he said. Everybody knows what I'm talking about. Yes, you need to be. No, there's an infamous one. There's an infamous one. No, there's a. The, which one? The one that turns you gay if you see it. That one. I wish I didn't see. Yeah, because you're gay now, right? What's what's what do you have to look at to like reverse that? That's all of them. No, the, you use it as a thumbnail for your Breath of the Wild stream. No, no, I, no, 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 not that one. No. No, no, no. You can't get turned gay twice. So, what are you saying? If you look at it again, it reverts you back to straight? Mike... <laughs> he went to the beach that makes you gay. <laughs> oh, that's fucking good. It's something in the sand that turns you gay. There's sperm in it. There's sperm in the sand. All right, bro, hold on. <clears throat> the beach that makes you gay from M. Night Shyamalan. Hold on, we're gonna watch this, okay? All right, no, no I think hold, I have to keep laughing at that. Dude, these drugs are fucking me up. That is too funny, man, holy shit. It's not even that funny, but I can't, I'm not gonna be able to focus on this if I keep thinking about that. Okay, it's not that funny. All right, that wouldn't even make sense. A beach that makes you gay. That that wouldn't even work. That how would that work? What you go? St you have to go in the water, or is it just this, just the sand? How does it work? <sighs> Fucking Christ! No, it's not that funny. It's really not. It's stupid. Okay, it's it's stupid. Let's watch this. Let's watch this this video. Okay, here it is. Legend of Zelda. T Tears of the Kingdom official trailer number three. All right, so some clouds. They look nice. Is this is this uh, game footage or is this uh, you know like a, like like a, the cutscene? The beach that makes you gay. It's game. It's gameplay footage. It's, okay, it's game game footage. Were they playing? Were they playing baseball? Nox, she's. Hey, thanks for eight months. It's in engine. They were playing. They were playing baseball. It was playing a little, little softball, batting, batting tits around. Right, I need an edit of this where. When he like flips, there a fart happens. Like, cause he's gonna watch. He's gonna spread his legs like really quickly. Right there, I need like a like a brap right there. It's raining twinks. Flambingo, hey, thanks for six months, bud. It's it, it it's raining twinks. Hallelujah. Also, what works is sing with me. Sing for the years. Sing for the laughter. Sing for the tears of, of the kingdom. He's airing out his his boy pussy right now. It's stanky. He's letting it. Dude, it smells like fish in there. I want you guys to guess why it smells like fish in there. Someone chat said Nazca lines. Where do you see that, dude? Oh, oh, right there. I'm fucking blind. That's cool as hell. They were des designed by like the ancient Incans for like skydiving twinks specifically. 
Like they 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 predicted that, you know. All right, it's a cute little little town. So that that was Cornando's castle over there, right? Wait, it, it is the same map or it's not the same map? I don't understand. Ricola. Oh no, not anymore. What's this? And this is the part everybody jerked off to because Cornando. That's Cornando's castle. Someone in chat called this a Genshin ripoff. Yo, I like his spaghetti hair, dude. Holes. Plenty of holes if you're a hole fan. Hole fan's gonna be eating good with this title. Dude, do you think that th there there was like um those what are those 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 graboids called? They're just graboids down there, right? Ready to grab your pee, pee Who's that? Is that a new um a new Tumblr se sexy man? What was this? Who's this? Is a new furry to goon too? Who is that? King Goat? A new thirst trap character? Zelda. The voice acting. We huh? rely on your knight and that legendary sword he carries. Our last line of defense will be Link. Oh, Zelda got a, a little uh, tomboy thing going. Pretty hot. Link. Wait, that is Link? No, that's Zelda. Stop fucking confusing me, dude. No, that that was you said. I that was who was in the thumbnail, and you told me that that was that that was fucking. You said that was Zelda. You can't do this to me. I'm on drugs. No, don't fucking gaslight me, pieces of shit. Yo, he's going in that hole. It's a very wholesome game. Dude, is that wait? Hold up. He's okay. So he's fucking. There's vehicles now. Look. Our last line of um, Bob uh, Bobberson with uh, three months. Thanks, buddy. Defense will be Link, and that's Nando. Nando hooks up with uh, with Zelda. That's that. What that that could be an interesting ship. Zel Zel Nando. Link. <laughs> she goes Link. It's like he's like, yeah, that's what I just said. Very good. Link, yeah. Good job following along and paying attention. Proud of you. Okay, so he's fucking riding a bird, like a a, a concrete bird or, or something, it looks like, right? It's like a um a glider of some kind. So it's not a flapper, it's not flapping. Right. It's gonna run at 30 FPS with stutter, sir. No, it's not because it, it's 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 a first-party Nintendo game. That that's that only happens to the. You know, actually, I played this game on. Wait, I didn't have this game on the Switch. Did it? Did, did well, this game? The first one. Did the first one have shit performance on the Switch? No, because most of the first-party Nintendo games do run good on on the Switch, right? Like. You know, again, like, r remember that those Pokemon games are not Nintendo first party. Okay. And forget about it. Like, the indies are, are dog shit on the Switch, right? Like, the indies are just complete poop. Like, I would never buy... You know, I'm, not, I'm never buying another indie game for this for the Switch. I, I don't care what game it is, how good it is. It's just, that's, just a, that's just a waste of money. But this is not an indie game, right? Who's that little fella he had with him? Who's that little that little, Who's that little guy? What's, what's what's that thing? I'm interested in that. Who's that? A bit like an owl? Looks like a little owl guy. It's a Rito. That's Rouge the bat. She's looking a little maybe more. I guess that's that's Rouge the flat. He's a Rito. He's a little Rito. Tits the bird. That's Tits the bird. Okay, so is that Link? Like, so basically, that's Link pulling the cart. So you could be like, 
an Uber driver in Hyrule, basically. Like, this is their version of Uber. You, yeah, you could, you could be like... Yeah. No, that's a horse. You make vehicles. What do you mean you make vehicles? Link, Link is like, he doesn't look like a mechanic. I mean, maybe that's stereotypical. Did you not watch the gameplay footage? Guys, I didn't see any of this. I've been fucking in, in pain and suffering since I got back from this trip. They explained it in the gameplay show, showcase. Okay, well, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about, bro. Yo, is it possible that this thing hits a rock and those people get launched? And then Link is, you know, getting sued for these people get when these people get hurt. I'd hate to be responsible for something like that, you know. But that would upset me. Like he basically does this to these people's bodies. They get yeeted like that, like as if he had used that ability. Oh, here's a new ability, right? Right there. So this one, well, th well, this one is too. Hold up. This is this is also in the building, isn't it? Not this fucking cock. This. This is this is this is different. I think. Yeah. This one is the rock. I did see I did see one tweet about this one. Because the description that they gave at the direct or whatever was explaining how you can use this to, you know, go up, obviously. It's it's a rocket. Rockets do what, you know, rocket's going to rocket. But interestingly, the, the, the text said that you could use it to go inside certain enemies. And this one person was, was like, fantasizing about using it while standing underneath the asshole of a Hinox. And basically getting, like, fucking, like, reverse void by the, by the Hinox. So, like, you could use the rocket to go up into his fucking intestines and have, like, a little, like, Lemmy Winks type, like... Yo, they sh here's what they do, right? There's a mini game in the Hinox's asshole, but it's classic top-down Zelda. Lemmy Links. It's, 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 it's called Lemmy Links. Hinox Inside Story. Okay. Could be cool. Oh, so he's in an area with like weird gravity right now, huh? Look at that. It's up in the in the stratosphere. Yeah, but he got you got up there with the rocket. Nintendo's inspired by uh, Elon Musk, the creator and job creator and titan of industry. Um, and not idiot who, by the way, broke gifts on Twitter recently. So he broke bookmarks and gifts. Cerevi, thanks for thirteen months. So what's this? Like you tell you telling me this is one of Link's like like homemade devices? Like homemade vehicles? You can make that? It's one of his like DIY projects, right? NetSpeed Neo and Neo AXT. Oh Neo, thanks for uh two years. Guys, thank you. I like how this thing like waggles around as it approaches the enemy. Like check that out, man. Check that. It's 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 like coming to give you a fucking like prostate exam. Battle bots. Wow. So you you can whoa. What's that? You can make whatever you want with that with that thing. Huh? Like you could get creative with that. Like the game gives you the freedom to like make like wacky, wacky robots. It's it's like <laughs> oh that that actually that sounds awesome. Actually, Wolfie, hey, thanks for the gift sub. Oh, that sounds really good. Oh my god. Is there any kind of, like, PvP in this game? Like, at all? Is there any kind of online? Because, like, dude, yeah, BattleBot Arena. Like, your robot versus... Okay, at the very least, like, you, you can... Your Link should be able to, like, download and fight, like, other people's Links. Other people's robots. Right.
Like just you you could you could just like like it's not true online, but like you can you know, like a strand like type thing. I know why I am here. It's something only I can do. What is that? <sighs> Her voice acting is bad, guys. I'm sorry. I know why I am here. Yo, are you okay? Like, are your lungs okay? Why do you sound like that? Evil Lou, thanks for 16 months. <laughs> I know I, I am here. Fuck off. Fuck, I can't stand that. Fuck! Bro, you know what the problem here is? Okay, you know what the problem here is? This is like the new style of, of, of fucking... I got, I raged and hurt my neck. This kind of voice acting is, is like, is cringe as fuck. Okay, it, it's, it's bad. And I blame, I blame a Horizon, uh, Forbidden West, Zero Dawn, whatever. I blame that, that, that woman's voice acting. Um, I also blame, yo, r remember when you went to go see the Dune movie, the, the, um, Dines, Dines Villa Nuevo's, uh, Dune, Dune movie, and every actor t spoke like that, they all spoke like that, and you couldn't fucking understand anything anybody was saying, because this is what, how all the actors delivered their lines, so you had no idea what the fuck anybody was saying at any point, wasn't that cool? Wasn't that cool when that happened? Mike loathes vagina, somebody said. Yeah, that's that's what we're taking out of this. Okay. Yeah, let's let's do that. Some and what's this is like a little embryo or something. This is like a little guy in here, right? It's like glowing, it's got like it's full of piss. Thing only I can do. Uh, whatever that fucking kind of voice acting is, I don't like it, okay? A king's revival. If you look and away, you're gonna miss all the weird furries and shit. The birth of his new world. Oh my god! Okay, let's go! Oh my god, the music! Yeah! But you are not alone. Link. You are our final hope. There's King Ghidorah. How many times is she gonna fucking say that? So yeah, there's Cornando. Guys, I didn't see the tits that you guys were talking about, though. Where are his tits at? And the birth of his new world. He doesn't have tits. World. Oh, I guess... Okay, alright. So there's, there's tits, I guess. There's some... Yeah, alright. Yeah, okay. Wow, look at them. Yeah, they are substantial. Tit check. We're doing a tit check. Wow. I would, if I was had to get, like, if I was in, like, a survival situation, I would want to be, I would want to be stranded with Cronando. Because you, those tits will, like, if you had to eat him, those tits will last weeks. Like, he's a lot of meat in there, you know? Okay, let's go! That's not Ganon. What do you mean that's not Ganon? <gasps> oh, that, oh, I thought, I thought that was fucking, what's her name, for Urbosa for a second. That's not Urbosa. But, you are not alone. But why would Urbosa not be in this? Uh, she's dead? Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, they all, they all died. But they, didn't Sidon die? Also? Why the fuck is Sidon there? Sidon also died. Sidon died. And the other fucker, uh... Yeah, he... Oh, because his sister was the champion. I got, I, I got, yeah, I got them, I got them confused. Wow, look how fast the chat's moving. I'm telling you, all you have to do is be wrong about something and you can fucking, your chat will just... Again, I feel like I'm, I'm fucking XQC right now. Just because I just because I said the wrong thing, fucking wild. It's like it's like there's fifty thousand people here because I said the wrong thing. 
Mifa, the the Daruk, Mifa, Daruk, and the and and uh, and Urbosa died. That's right. You are and uh, the bird, R Ravioli died. Yeah, Ravioli died. Final hope. Your final hope. <laughs> Slow down. Catch your fucking breath. Okay, relax. Okay. Like, take it the fuck easy. She's like, like, like permanently hyperventilating. Like she's got an underdeveloped heart or some shit. Like there's just something wrong with her fucking organs. That's why she sounds like that. Stop bullying the vo the voice actor. I, you know, I, I'm not bull. I, you know, no. Listen, if my beef is is not with the person who 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 acted the lines, my beef is with would be with the directing people, the people who are directing them. Yeah, the people who was like, yeah, I want you to sound like this. You know, like here's what we want her to sound like. He was like, whose fucking idea was that? Backpedaling. Shut the fuck up. I could. I, I can't even shake my head in disgust because it's gonna hurt. Like you know how that, you know how handicapped I am right now because I can't visually shake my head in disgust at chat. Link. <laughs> You must find me. <gasps> find me, Link. <gasps> Fuck off. Well, I'm going to be bitching about that a lot. But other than that, game looks fantastic. Game looks good. And Link, again, never says anything. I Here's my... Uh, here, here's my belief. Okay. In these games... If you want to have one of the characters talk like that, have voice acting like that, then you have to give all of or did not, No, no. Link is the only one that doesn't have voice acting, if I remember correctly. Right. Because the ravioli and everybody did have voice acting. So my feeling on it was it was just really awkward. Like, like I'll never forget that scene from Breath of the Wild where Zelda watches her father get like... Or was that in Breath of the Wild or was that in that other fucking game? Was that in the, the Hyrule Warriors game? It was in Breath of the Wild, right? So so Z Zelda watches her father get, like, impaled through the heart by Ganon or some shit. Okay? And she's fucking hysterical. Like, you know, she's, like, crying and she's, you know, she just watched her father die violently. And she's having the kind of reaction that, you know, I think most people would, like, you know, and, you know, instead of like, you know, Link is standing there watching her watch it, watching her bawling her eyes out. He doesn't hug her. He, he doesn't like obviously say anything because he can't. He just kind of he just looks at her like this and goes. And it's like fucking awkward. Why is he the only one who can't talk? Hoop. That's it. That's it. She just watched the front. People are saying he's mute and I'm being ableist. Guys, he's not mute. Okay, he says hoop and he ah. Uh. Okay, he says hoop, hot, hoop, hoop, hoop. Like he makes all those little twink noises, bro. He's not fucking mute, clearly. Because if he was, if his vocal cords were like damaged or something, he wouldn't be able to make any of those sounds. Bottom sounds. He makes bottom sounds. He's nonverbal. Shut the fuck up. Listen to me. They need to give him... Th this is how you fix this. You have to give him voice acting, guys. The chat, chat's gonna chat's gonna say things like he he's autistic coded and Mike is ableist. Moderators, you you gotta you you gotta fucking sm like smacking people with, with that shit. Okay. It's a fucking video game, guys. That is not what's happening, guys. No one taught him how to speak. He's a feral gremlin. Is that what? Is that what it is? He's like a Mowgli type thing, like raised by animals, and that's why he, you know, he he'll be breathy and British. Is that what you want? Ah, you're right. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. Well, you know, don't do that. You just make him, you know, make him, make him talk. 
normally. I, it's, it, the, the accent is not what's bothering me. It's the breathiness bullshit. The breathy stupidity. I don't care about the accent, obviously. They should sound British because British is the, is the default fantasy accent. You know, like, 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 what, what, like, what if the hobbits sounded American? Like, what if the hob, what if the hobbits were like number fifteen potatoes, boil them, mash them, put them in a stew? You know, like that would fucking suck, right? Like, what if Samwise Gamgee sounded like chills? Like that would not work, right? Potatoes, right? Boil them, mash them, put them in a stew. Right. Well, sh we're number fifteen. Sharing your bros load. Listen, the the point I'm trying to make is that the accent is not what bothers me. It's the stupid breathiness or whatever the fuck. Right. Hey, I'm Gollum here. Yeah, it just wouldn't work, guys. So give him some voice acting. I, I, I think it's just he's standing around awkwardly like. I don't know. It, it's weird. I'm just saying it's weird. All right. Seeing him standing there. All right. So here's the alternative. Voice acted like things I've stuck up me ass. <sighs> Master sword. I couldn't remember what it was called. Epona, stiff cocks. And Ocarina. Sidon's fish head. <laughs> the Koroks. Koroks. All 999 Korok seeds. Twisted Skull, thanks for the sub, man. Freak! 900 is 900 Korok seeds. That's a fresh freak, guys, by the way. Dump them up. An entire Hinox. Things I've stuck up me ass. Every single one of me weapons. How do you think I walk around with 120 swords? I put them up me ass. It's also why they break so easily. They've got shit rust on them. Shit rust. They, that's why they break like that. Shit rust. Um, why is Freak Please broken? Jesus Christ. What is wrong with my fucking chat, dude? Um, all right. So somebody's pointing out that Link did have dialogue in the CDI games. Yeah, not like that. Yeah, don't do. Yeah, don't do that. Okay, don't do that. Bomb tubes. 1,000 rupees. Okay, um. Dodongos. <laughs> uh, okay, so. How long is the gameplay video, guys? Shoebreaker. Hey, thanks for four months. It's a 10 minute. All right, do you want me to watch that or do you want to start watching the Finger Family trash? 13 minutes, but it's worth it. Um, Zelda Family. Do you think that you, you, you think there will be Zelda Finger Family like around the time this game comes out? All right, there's a poll. All right, I mean, like, I, I won't pause it 50 times, okay? All right, chat's here for the finger. All right, well, we're, they're here for the finger. We're going to watch the finger. We're going to finger. We're gonna. I, I'll watch. Yeah, they, they want to see finger. We're going to watch finger, guys. Uh, we got a bunch of finger. Um, chicken. Fi we got chicken fingers, fish fingers, and cock fingers. We have um, gold fingers. Um... Fingers. Fingers and more fingers. All right, guys, listen. Here's the deal, fat. 
those live act that live action video pack that we watched a couple weeks ago all right a month ago i mean probably closer to now it had um there's three videos left in it okay i want to watch them I want to. I want to watch the. I just want to. I, I want to. I want to. Um, like finish this this folder. So there's. Here's. Here's. Here's the, the plan. All right. We're gonna watch these three live action videos. I don't know if it's the man or not. They're gonna be cringe as fuck though. Okay. So I want you to be mentally prepared for that. Um. Kid named Finger. Did you hear about Owl House Finger family? I don't know what Owl House even is. Mike, the people that want to watch you watch the trailer, they want to see you come to it. And when you don't come to it, they're going to riot. Is that what, that's what, yeah. I mean, I might come to it. There was some cool shit in that, in that trailer we just, what you just watched though. Don't in head. Hey, thanks for the uh, gift sub, man. Also, we got, uh, Curry Murmurs, an indie film with the resubs. Guys, thank you so much. Come now. Come now. Come now. Come right now. Guys, does Pog Champ work? Can can somebody just post the Pog Champ for me? Owl House is Disney Steven Universe. Oh, that doesn't sound good. All right, so Pog Champ is working. Guys, where what what, what where did that we we got to talk about that for a second? What, what what where did that emote come from? Like what? Who are those, like, those chi- I guess, like, a chibi Knuckles and Sonic? I remember the, you know, the Ugandan- That's the Ugandan- The so-called Ugandan Knuckles. But, like, did those things exist prior to that? Like, we're- On condom sex, yeah. Azja Jazz, thanks for 65 uh, months, man. Owl House is amazing. I, I've never I've never heard of Owl House. So it's just Steven Universe, but they're owls. Thank you, AJ. 65 months. That's a long time, bud. Thank you. All of the people saying Owl House is good have 3,000 hours of browsing Tumblr pre-porn ban. Uh, you know what? I, it sounds like I'm going to have to fucking find out what Owl House is, whether or not I like it. Uh, that's what it's sounding like to me. Okay. Use the Nintendo online membership to get ta Tatka. Yeah, I should do that. Tatka. When is Tatka dropping, guys? I wasn't paying attention. D but they, they made the, the Ugandan... Well, he wasn't a Ugandan. The Chibi Knuckles and, and the Chibi Sonic... Avatars for VR chat. The game comes out on May 12th. Okay. Okay, that's kind of soon. In it. Yeah, that's like a month away. Wow. That's on Vinny's birthday. Is he getting like is he he's so he's gooning hard over this, huh? Oh, you know that when did you know what now that you mention it when did this fucking trailer drop? That was like it was like 2 days ago, right? Yeah, no, it was yet yesterday yesterday. Yesterday. D you dude, dude. Dude, it was around like 2 at 2 p.m. and I heard a fucking explosion and I looked out the window and a couple of miles away there was a fucking cum geyser rising above Staten Island. That must have been when Vin Vinny watching the trailer. That's what that was. And then there was a cum rain for like a couple of, a couple of hours. Like a light cum mist descending. That's what that was. Like when 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 fucking Zelda went, Link, you're our last help. He was he just went like it was like fucking it was like old faithful. The geyser. There was there was even a cum rainbow. That's it's all making sense now. It's a, that's what that was. That's why there was a cum geyser. Oh, okay, okay. It's all fucking coming together. Um, so here's the plan. Live act three, 
fucking horrible live action uh, videos, and then we're moving to um, some Sonic, some some fucking regular Sonic, and we'll look at some Fabiosa, I guess. There's also some other shit. We could look at Claymation and stuff. There's there's a lot of shit that we haven't um, we haven't even dipped into yet. Like there's Sonic Claymation. Right, like like Sonic, uh, Finger Family claymation. I don't know how to explain it. It looks like shit. Um, but yeah. Punstar says New York has the Rat Czar. We saw about the Rat Czar. Uh, yeah, I know about the Rat Czar. I'm planning the IRL stuff. Actually, I, I've been talking to Zot, and it's been very illuminating. The, the IRL stuff is 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 going to happen this year, guys. It might it might not happen till the fall. But it is gonna it's gonna happen this year. Um, it's gonna happen. Um, all right, so let's bust this open. I don't know what this is. The file name is just Papu. I don't know what YouTube channel it's from. Uh, MP. All right, hold on, hold on. What what the fuck is this? Uh, it could be Dar Man. Hey, uh, Cernan, thanks for being here. Uh, we got any Fingoids here? To fingoids is, is my, um, my pet name for the Finger Family Project. We got any Fingoids who could tell me where this video is from? Pog Champ, never judge a book by its cover. Pog Champ. <laughs> uh, Diora, thanks for 10 months. Never judge a book by its by its cover. Kiss a homie. Okay. Never judge a cock by its foreskin. Guys, this feels bad. Fuck. Oh. Okay. Oh god, dude, my escal escalator phobia. Anybody else have like a severe paranoia of getting sucked into the fucking escalator as they go, like when they get to the top or the bottom? Yeah. Why do you have that fear? Home monkey list. Thanks for six months, man. Can't wait to melt my brain into a useless, useless paste. <laughs> um, the Simpsons. Live leak? No, dude. There was an episode of The Simpsons. Oh, that was on TV when I was a kid. Probably like season fucking three Simpsons. And the, uh, it was, it was, they were watching an episode of the Itchy and Scratchy show and fucking, the whichever one is the cat got sucked into the escalator and it ripped his fucking flesh off. And then he was just walking around like with like, you, you know, with his musculature, musculature visible. And it was horrifying. And it fucking, that, that made me terrified of escalators for years. There's a JoJo episode. I don't remember a JoJo episode where somebody gets sucked into an escalator, guys. There's an infamous live league video of a woman who gets sucked into the escalator. That sounds horrible. Part three. Oh, well, that was a I would have been a really long time ago. No, I don't remember that. He Joseph Joestar almost gets sucked in. All right. I'm going to play this, okay? Let's tr all try to conquer our phobia together. Did you guys see that? Somebody got sucked into the escalator? What? Hi! Oh, fuck me. Huggy Wuggy's flying the plane? <laughs> fuck off! <laughs> oh, fuck me. Hello and welcome aboard. This is your captain speaking. I'd like to thank you for flying uh, Huggy Wuggy Airlines. Uh, we're going to get off the ground in about uh, 10 minutes here. Uh, once we're in the air, I'm going to come back there and give each one of you a hug individually. All right. Okay. All right, guys. Just uh, make sure your feet seat belt is fastened when you see the light on. Okay. And um, get ready to be hooked. Um. Huggy Wuggy Airlines.
Guys, his arms are like too long to fucking pilot the plane, dude. Another huggy has hit the towers. Is that okay? <sighs> yep. All right, I'm gonna play this, guys. Flight 63 now arriving from London. Dude, Russell, why are you sitting all the way over there? Huh, it's because I need room to spread out. He's man spreading. Did he just rip ass? He did, didn't he? Ah, uh, uh, San Diego. Fuck. Gate 23, San Diego. Bread out. There's a tiny fart sound. Do you hear it? He's farting. Russell, why are you sitting all the way over there? Huh, it's because I need room to spread out. Very, very soft, but it is fart sound. Ah, San Diego. Gate 23. That's it. Oh, I've been to this airport. Okay, so somebody's playing uh, Poppy's Playtime. Connor, what are you playing? Poppy Playtime. Just got chapter two. What are you playing? So what is this? Is this like a fucking advertisement for Poppy Playtime? They're conversing like the characters in, in, the, uh, in the figure fantasy commercials, dude. I still have one. Two's not- Oh my god, mom, you play figure fantasy too? Not on the iPad yet. Once I get around this pillar, I can reach the door lock. There. Wow, that is fucking unbelievably cringe. You may look cute, but I know not to trust you. What's that noodly pink thing with the bad hair? That's mommy long legs. Gaming on an iPad though. Oh, she is bad news. She's a bad bitch though. I would fuck the shit out of that mommy long legs. There are no creatures like that in chapter one. Oh yeah, I'm sure. She's a bad bitch though. Probably all just hugs and good times. What is this dial? What the fuck are they talking about? What are they? Are they like? He's saying he's. Oh, I, fuck, fuck, fuck! I'm just gonna play this. Excuse me, could you move your bag? I want to sit down. Uh, sure. Fucking tongue my balls, lady. There's fucking seats over there. Absolutely the fuck not. Get the fuck away from me. Social distancing. This pandemic isn't over. Get the fuck away from me. Excuse me. Fuck off. Lady, why do you want to sit there? There's plenty of seats over here. Because I bought one of these for my grandson's birthday. And I want to know what games you're playing. Games? This is Poppy Playtime. It's the hottest thing right now. Poppy Playtime. Oh, it looks so cute. I'm sure it's safe for him. <laughs> That's what you think. How old is he? 11. I'm sure it'll be fine. Why, well, it is made for children. Does your 11-year-old son like NFTs by any chance? Free right, thanks for 19 months. And uh, Funky Ghost with uh, 19 months. Guys, thank you. It's made for kids. Oh, yeah. If, if anybody asks me for a game suggestion right now, it's going to be Pizza Tower, probably until Breath of the Wild Tatka comes out. And then it's still going to be Pizza Tower because there's no way that game is going to be more fun than Pizza Tower. There's not. It will be very fun, but I fucking love Pizza Tower. Karen bought a new iPad for her grandson and wants to find games for him to play. Dude, he doesn't need games. Just fucking pop on a Finger Family channel and let his fucking brain get reduced into a fucking remoulade. He doesn't need games on an iPad. No, that's not what that's for, man. Who's are people really playing games on iPads? Why am I asking? I know the answer to that. I seen, I seen my nephews do it. Dies of Glanch. What will she think of Poppy Playtime? Flight 312, departing for New York, JFK. Hi, I'm on the flight to San Diego. That's a dildo kiss. That's dil that's dildos. He's got like four fat dildos in there. That is absolutely what what else is that? What else is in there? That's like a bad dragon tote bag, bro. That's Louis C.K. <laughs> Man, he didn't do well after getting canceled, huh? Um, he's got a diarrhea beard. <laughs> he does! He looks like he was just eating the booty hole of somebody who had some Taco Bell, man. Holy shit. Louis C.K. with the Chance XL.
Very good. What's the name? The name's Hedwig. He ate some um, liquid booty, guys. The liquid booty. Eli Hedwig. Hedwig, Fake name. Hedwig. Yes, I see it right here. You're with Playtime Company, right? Well, actually, it's Playtime Co. And oh, is this, wait, so wait, is this a character from Poppy's Playtime? And I'm traveling with some of my associates. Okay, you're all set. Here's your ticket and proceed to gate 17. Well, why am I fascinated by like all the po I, the Poppy's Playtime content? Like I've never fucking played Poppy's Playtime. I think it's just remarkable how quickly Poppy's Playtime went from being like this really niche in indie title, but, you know, to, to being like the fucking meme cancer. Like it, re it really was was fucking instant. Like it's, it's it was meteoric. Right. And, and now you go to fucking like you go to like dollar stores and there's bootleg huggy wuggies hanging from everything that happened so quickly. It was made. To, right, we did. We did talk about this. It was made to be meme trash. Very good. At the mall. Yeah. If I go to the mall, there's fucking boot. There's a, there's a stand at the Staten Island Mall that is just all the only thing they sell is bootleg huggy wuggy like plushies. Tell them I'll be upstairs. I'd love to see you play it. I kind of want to play it, guys. I got to be real. I, I kind of want to. There's waiting for the train. My leg is falling asleep. Why it's is my plain. leg falling asleep? Is that the fucking, is that, is that, is that the drug? Not train. What? Huggy Wuggy? No, I got to get away. <laughs> there he is. That thing doesn't look friendly. <sighs> yeah, lady. Told you so. I guess you were right. At least your game looks- Karen, go read a fucking IGN review and fuck off. Okay, what do you want from me? Go fuck- you, you have Google? What are you fucking talking to a stranger about something stupid for? We, we go Google, okay, what's a good game? Yeah. Safe. <gasps> Who's that cute little girl? I, the people who made this are just like gooning for Poppy Playtime like really hard. Oh, that's Poppy. Well, I mean, they're they're forced to make it. Like, there's, you know, the script was written because they saw Poppy's playtime in like Google Trends or whatever, right? That's why the script exists. So it's actually irrelevant whether or not they actually like Poppy's playtime, but it is kind of coming across like they really enjoy Poppy's playtime. I don't trust right? her. Dude. This shot. Your game looks safe. <gasps> Who's that cute little girl? Oh, that's Poppy. But I don't try. Turbert, thanks for eight months. What is this shot? Like, is this, did this woman consent to her fucking dumpy being in this shot like this? Like, what is that awkward? That is fucking awkward, man. That ass shot. She's a brick. <laughs> She's a brick. Shit house. Because don't forget, that that is what that song would sound like if the FCC didn't exist. Sex sells. <laughs> Sex sells. Oh, he's gonna bust Has out bust out the chance in the airport lounge. Cheers. Welcome to Totally Scare Lines. Flight 313 with one-way service to San Diego. We will be boarding passengers by group. So wait until your chapter is called. Did I'll just fucking come right out and say, I'm hard. Anyone else hard? Did you see that? That's her. Did you see her? Yeah, she said our flight's gonna board pretty soon. No, that's your poppity fun time <laughs> she means that's poppity playtime i can fix her why would you want to fix a fucking sexy clown there's nothing there's nothing to fix what's the problem here what's the fucking problem what do you what do you mean fix her she's perfect somebody timed it out <laughs> someone timed it out <laughs> who timed who timed them out for saying that who did who timed him out? That's right. See, he saw her too. I didn't see anything. All I saw was the airline lady. Don't put words in my mouth. Fuck, bitch. <laughs> yeah, lady. Don't make me sound crazy. You are crazy if you don't see her. Your characters are coming to life. 
This Karen is giving off some real Karen energy, huh? It's just a game on my computer. Am I? Mike doesn't want to fuck Peppino, but he will fuck finger family fetish bait. Hi, Pat. I think you might need some fresh air. Fine. I was going to go powder my nose anyway. You're going to go get fresh air. You're going to go outside. You're, it's going to take you fucking 40 minutes to leave the airport, and then you're going to have to go through security again. <clears throat> That's why airports and flying are such a nightmare for people who smoke, because... Think about it. Like, if you're gonna go fly somewhere, you're you're not having a cigarette for like at least six hours. Karen thinks she's seeing Poppy in real life, but is she just imagining things? People who smoke smoke a lot, you know. Hi, I'm supposed to be flying to San Diego. Oh, oh she's on the muscle relaxers. Holy shit. Okay. Is she okay? You're in the right place. What's the name? It's Mona. Mona Legerton. Oh, that's the mommy long legs. Legerton, Legerton. Legerton. Oh, I see it right here. You're with Playtime Co. Yes, I handled playtesting with all of the beautiful children. Okay, you're all checked in. Proceed to gate 17. She's not on like a no-fly list? Oh, okay, game 17. No, it's gate 17. <laughs> She's zonked, bro. She's totally zonked. The dudes who made this have never been to an airport. <laughs> uh, it's, 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 none of it none of it makes sense. Spirit Halloween wig. I mean, if you if you're making a fucking garbage like algorithm bait YouTube video, why are you going to spend more than like Three dollars on a wig, dude. I can't believe that they don't. I is she fucking green screened? I think she looks like that poppity character. Good thing that spider lady or that blue beast thing aren't here. It's, okay, lady, you are the blue beast thing. That's number one. Number two, why is she calling her poppity? Is this like, is this like sometimes how people call Rosalinda Rosalina? Because they're stupid? Is that what's going on? Is this like that? Poppity. Boomer speak. Boomer speak. Funny, dumb boomer. Boomers can't learn new names. 67% of chat believes the murder clown is hot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what is she fucking screaming at? There's pictures on the wall? Like what? Flight 225 from Dallas. Now He's got Matryoshka dolls. Things I've shoved up my ass. Matryoshka dolls. Yo, what if, like, that dude was, like, really talented with his asshole? And, like, he could, he could, he could, like... Hold up. Like you, you, you separate them. You separate the dolls, and then you put you put them up your ass individually. But then when you plop them out, they're all in the right like, in the right place. Yeah, would that that would be crazy? I bet you. I bet you. There's people who could do that. Ass magic. I bet you there's people who are talented enough to do that type of shit. Genius idea. Thank you. Matryoshka Gotsi. This, this is a grown man having, like, probably way too much fun with these, huh? Well, he's supposed to be one of the poppy characters, right? My, there's a series called Anal Acrobats. 77 to Las Vegas at gate two. <laughs> I think this one scene is the only thing I've seen of Poppy's playtime. Like, I think I, 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 Joel was maybe streaming this and I saw this. That one bit of the game. 
That was quick. Yeah, I just had to get out of there. Really? Why is that? They're all in there. Oh, crowded, huh? No, the, the characters from your game. There's no toilet paper. They're in there, in the ladies' room, in the mirror. In the mirror? Well, they're all back in here now. See, look at my screen. Guys, why is this video so bad? Oh, that's more like it. Oh, who's that? She's having fucking fentanyl withdrawals. Cute little rabbit. That's Bonzo Bunny. Raz, if you don't do the puzzle, he crushes your. He, he's like a. He's like a symbol crashing like monkey. Well, I guess a rabbit. And if you don't do the puzzle, he like crushes your head in that thing. Oh, how cute! That reminds me of Peekaboo from Pokemon. <laughs> Who? Oh, Pikachu. She's saying Pikachu. Peekaboo? That's right. Just like Peekaboo. I see you. Oh, he's like the toy CEO. That's why he's, he's like testing the toys. Hey, Patricia. Hi, Hugo. Are you driving the train to play care? Instantly you mean rock solid. Flying the plane to San Diego? She's got to be, yeah, she's got to be like a porn actress or something. Oh, 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 did you guys see that? Clown, see yo, clown porn. Guys. Guys, I think I recognize her from clown porn. Just kidding, I never saw clown porn. It's not, it's not even a thing that exists that I know about. I don't even know about it. These drugs are making me like, telling myself here, man. <gasps> it's that poppy character, that the blue thing with the, the teeth. You mean f clown porn? Flying the plane to San Diego? Huggy Wuggy? San Diego? What's there to do in San Diego? Well, Patricia, I think a lot of people are going to Comic Con. Oh. Comic Con? And don't call me Patricia. Call me by my nickname. You have a nickname? What the fuck is this? All I see is the airline lady in the How pilot. long is this? Oh, there's are like another fucking 40 minutes, dude. Huggy Wuggy's flying the plane? No, he's not flying the plane. Besides, he left. Okay, fine. As long as he's not flying the plane. It, it really is remarkable, though, like the lengths that somebody will go to to take advantage of like Google Trends algorithm uh, like, like data. Like they'll just make this absolute fucking pig slop of a video and just upload it. I mean, don't get me wrong, a lot of time did get spent on this. Like, like how long, like how much effort you think went into this? Like, starting with the writing phase and ending with like uploading this to YouTube. This probably took a couple weeks, man. Is live, live action shots, costumes, you know? No, effort, no, there was effort here. I mean, it's, it's still ass, but about a week mm, to get off the ground here. Torgo, thanks for uh, 23 months, man. He says, this is too cringe for me. Have a good night. Okay, bye. Hi, Mona. Hey, Mr. Hedwig. Is this game 17? It's gate 17, and we should be leaving soon. Oh, I guess it's too late to have something to eat then. Mona is joining her boss, Mr. Hedwig, on the flight to San Diego. Yeah, if I had a, a, a disposable income, uh, I would, yeah, I would absolutely do dumb shit like this. That's a fantasy, you know. Why are they- Although maybe not this dumb. Going. D the narrator has serves no purpose, yeah. Did you guys see that? What? But it's padding, that's I guess. That's her! That's who? Th 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 that's that's the, the spider lady from your game! Mommy Longlegs? Uh, yeah, she's got pink hair. So what? Is yeah. there is there a Five Nights at Freddy's version of this? And she's got like pink legs, and there's like eight of them. Well, I hate to break it to you, but Mommy Longlegs only has four legs. Well, I hate to break it to you, Connor, but she's got four legs too. Jackson, you're not helping. What are you guys gonna do about it? Don't worry, lady. We'll protect you. Yeah, she comes over. We'll give her Jackson. What are the odds that this, this does end with, with Huggy, like, slamming the plane into the Pentagon or some shit? Or, like, just... It's not gonna have a fucked up ending. It can't. This is for kids. Hi! 
I'm going to San Diego. Oh, well, you're in the right place. What's the name? Bonnie Benson. Are my friends here? Benson, Holy Benson. Fuck, this sucks. Oh, I see you're also with Playtime Co. That's right. Holy fucking Christ. Are you playing? No, I'm not playing any game. I'm just checking you in. Guys, when I It'll gave you a cringe warning before, I, ha I have to admit, I didn't know it was going to be this fucked. I mean, I assumed it was going to be cringe, obviously, but but holy fucking shit. Just a minute. Come on, hurry up. The game's already started. Well, in that case, the game's up at gate 17. We're watching You're this whole thing. I'm not, I'm not game skipping this. I'm not skipping okay. this. I'm not that's skipping this. We, we, uh, that's mind. a sign of weakness. I'm not, I'm not Hi, weak. Mona. I'm not weak. Hi, okay. Bonnie. We're Hi, watching. Mr. Hedwig. We're going in roll. Oh, hello, please. Bonnie. I'm glad you could hop in here. I'm so excited. When does the game start? There is no game today. We're flying to San Diego. Well, I'm a man I of hope principle. there's music. All right, and my principle is I finish <gasps> where I fucking start, Pika. okay? B -b Bunny B Bonzo Rabbit thing! Oh my fucking god. I finish what I start, all right? Even if that that's a, a, a terrible YouTube fucking algo trash video or a shitty sandwich. I've gotten food poisoning like that. You mean Bunzo Bunny? Are you? Or if I'm doing your mom. You know, I'm not gonna stop before I come, guys. Okay? I don't understand what the joke is here. There is no joke. Okay. <gasps> no, I'm not okay. That thing's gonna get This is one of those don't things where it just, it's just—it's a babysitter for your child. Way there. back. Thanks for three months. I appreciate that. Who are those people? Do you think they want to play a game? I wish they would play a game. No games at the airport. Is she horny? She's horny. So you admit it. That is the real mommy long legs. Oh, lady. Jackson here will protect you. Yeah, I got you. All right, fine. The name's Karen, by the way. Nice to meet you, Karen. You might as well know. Yo, is anybody else fucked up by these spirals that are inside the plane engines like that? Like, it's like there's a polywhirl in there or some shit, right? It's an Uzumaki. That's weird. It's 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 like uh it's it's like a little too fun, you know? He zooted. It's a little it's the Dreamcast logo. It's like it's too fun for what it is. You know? Mike is in bat country. Uh-huh. Yeah. Don't stop here. Guys, she said her name was Karen earlier in the video. Didn't she? Why do you think birds? Is it to scare birds or something? Or like hypnotizes the birds to like suck them into the engine, like to be fucking sadistic, right? You're risking it all for. When does the video happen? Like, are they gonna get on the plane? Hi, or? I'm Hugo Wagner and I'll be your pilot today. Are you flying alone? No, these two are with me. I and mean, there's a lot of needless Welcome build Welcome to Totally to Scare things. Lines. What's your name? Hi, I'm Mona. Do I know you? I don't think so. Man, what do you think, like, her direction was? Like, what do you think they told her? They were like, okay, we want you to act like you have really long arms. Like, what, Wait, what, do you, what did you say to get her to act like this, man? Did they, did they make her play the game? Dude, they gave her a copy of Poppy's Playtime and they were like, come back when you've seen credits. Okay, method acting. All right, we're going to immerse you in the source material. It's like the dude who played The Witcher. The, who played fucking Gestalt, whatever the fuck his name is. John Galt, what's his fucking name? She zooted. The spirals tell the ground crews whether or not the engines are in motion. Is that what they uh, they have a reason? I thought they were just for, I thought they were just for fun. I also thought of uh, Lazy Town. I guess when I saw the pink wig, right? They have a crazy like bright color wigs and shit. 
Someone in chat said, this sucks shit straight from the asshole, straight from the source, right? It's like Homer Simpson when he gets behind the bar and he, like, puts his mouth under the tap and opens it. And, like, fucking mainlines the duff. It's like that, except with feces. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't fucking think that... I don't think this is a high point in these actors' career, right? Like, I don't think they're going to be putting this on their, their permanent, like, demo reel. You know what I'm saying? But you will by the end of the game. But while you're with us, make sure to get to know all of the passengers. Thank you for flying. And who might you be? I'm Bonnie. You haven't met me yet. This sucks. Oh, Did oh, you God, see that? Guys. Wookie Huggy is looking for his next victim. Wookie that's Huggy. That's the pilot. Yeah, I'm sure that's what the last people that were sitting here said. Look out, Karen. Here he comes. What Meanwhile, these two kids are fucking uh, mentally abusing like a mentally ill person. They're they're bullying a mentally ill woman or or like a woman suffering from like severe addiction. We supposed to do? This is a senior I've abuse. Read this in the book. Just act normal and he'll go away. Okay, you better be right. She is dementia brained, and these are two TikTokers. Relatable. Very relatable. I like the sound the game makes when when the fucking hand hits nothing. Hi, I'm Captain Hugo Wagner. I'll be flying this plane today. Holy shit, guys! Hugo Wagner. Hugh, go. Wagner, like. Like H W, like Huggy Wuggy. Well, thanks. Holy I'm someone shit. that wants to meet you. Hi, who are you? Uh, uh, who are you? Don't you know? <laughs> I'm Huggy Wuggy. <laughs> Yo, I bet you Huggy Wuggy. Like, yeah, of course he gives good Hi. hugs. Who are you? Don't you know? I don't, we know he gives good hugs, but like, why do I feel like he probably eats a mean pussy? Right? Like, I thought he was going to say head. Well, he did. I just took him a minute to get there. He probably eats a mean pussy. Bro, this and a blunt. Right? I'm Huggy Wuggy! This is a modern Twilight. Th this is the modern version of the Twilight episode with the goblin on the wing of the plane. Did Huggy Wuggy get rid of Karen? Keep watching to find out. She got hugged. There has been a power outage. Please get on the plane. If you can. Rock hard. Apex, thanks for 22 months, man. Instant boner. Instant boner. Guys, do you think I could get her to, like, come yell real hard and, like, yell really loud insults at my dick? What are you doing sitting here? Remember that? Uh, that's what the tickets say. Are you going to San Diego, too? I sure am. I bet my ticket a long time ago. When did you get yours? Clean. Thanks for nine months. We got ours on Priceline. Yeah, we got student discounts. Well, I used Miles. And Priceline name drop you're in sponsorship. My seat. Well, you're free to sit in the middle then. Product placement sponsored. Dude, I don't want her sitting here. Okay, well then she can have the window. Fine, I'll take the window. What's wrong with the aisle? Yeah, most people want the aisle. I'm not falling for that. If I'm on the aisle, those things can get me. What does she mean, things? She means the Poppy Playtime characters. Duh. Fine, lady. You can have the center seat. There's a huggy on the wing of the plane. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. <clears throat> I like her logic that, like, she thinks that... So say, say fucking Huggy Wuggy is on the plane and his goal is to kill as many people as possible, okay? 
Does she think the seat that she's sitting on is going to matter? Like, like, does she think she's going to be able to escape if she's not sitting in the aisle seat? Like, I don't understand what the fuck the logic is. This Someone in chat said, this is agit prop against white women. I'm so excited. What time does the game start? It's it's working. I'm sure the plane will take off very shortly. I'm hungry. I'm, I'm feeling very agitated. It's working. Is there any food on this train? Working as intended. <laughs> oh, the flight attendant's coming. You guys want anything? That's not the flight attendant. That's her. That's who? That's Poppy Playtime. <sighs> fucking Christ. These seats are so uh, tight. Fucking look I... at what we get ourselves into here. W what is my life? What is my life? Out. Is it okay if she switches to the aisle seat, Mr. Head? Oh, did she say something? Hold on. Was it erotic? Was it like, was it like sexual? These seats are so tight. I need to stretch out. Is it okay if she switches to the aisle seat, Mr. Hedwig? Sure, that'll be fine. That's good, because I need more leg room. Well, I think we... It, okay. She definitely knows who the character is, right? Like, at least she knows the character that she that she's playing, at least. Right. She's low-key the best actor in this entire fucking video. Hi, can I help you? Yes, could you please leave? I want this game to be over! I'm not gonna leave. Maybe you should leave the game. If you don't Clown leave, porn. I'm going to tell the pilot! You should go tell the pilot. Have you considered a career in clown porn, ma'am? He loves making friends. We'll just see about that. What is that? What does that mean? <laughs> what the fuck kind of response is that? What are you gonna do? What? We'll see about that. That is not no, he she's implying <sighs> fucking Christ. <laughs> That's so much better. When does the next chapter start? Yeah, I want to know too. When do we see fucking credits? Yo. Mommy long legs. Needed more leg room. Guys, she needed more leg room. I want to die. I want. I want to die. I want to die. Can I die now? Nothing is is good anymore. Anyway, like I like fucking. You'll have to ask the pilot. Are you the pilot? Because I need to talk to you. <laughs> <laughs> Do you need a hug? Do you need your pussy ate? <laughs> Until you stay tuned for chapter three. <laughs> really milking the fuck out of this algorithm, right? Sprigatitos, thanks for five months. Do you need a hug? I could use a hug, honestly. I could use a fucking hug, honestly, dude. So that means that there's a chapter one and a chapter three. Like we're seeing the second episode. So there's a video prior to this one and the video um after this one and guys i'm sort of feeling like we need to you know see the rest of that don't you want to know what happens here man this was the empire strikes back of the series <sighs> guys don't you want to know what, what happens here guys can't wait for next time which one is your <laughs> favorite character let us know in the comments <laughs> 
fucking eat my ass. It's called Papu. Okay. Um, well, that was brutal, guys. I'm sorry about that. It's talking about the games. Oh, like part one and part three. and the, Oh, they're talking about the games chapters. That's dog shit, dude. So those people are going to make one video per like when, when like the next chapter comes out. Well, I mean, they did buy all those costumes and shit. Well, I mean, like there is no real mommy long legs costume. I guess they just really just put her in a pink wig and like a pink tracksuit. And they were like, you're mommy long legs now. Mantis. 502. Thank you for the fresh sub. Freak! Fresh freak chat. You know what to do. Um I I I kinda wanna see uh I kinda wanna see more. Please engage right. There was an engagement question. There was. There was. These people know what they're doing, man. These people know what they're fucking doing. Which one's your favorite character? Oh boy, I have to pick a favorite. That's impossible. The game is in chapters with only two out right now. They mentioned chapter three to get SEO for people searching Poppy chapter three, right? Got to get as much mileage out of the, the costumes as possible. The Huggy Wuggy one is, is you know, kind of um, Hollywood tier prosthetics, right? The, the Huggy one is kind of impressive, honestly, yeah. Uh, that was the worst video we have ever watched in this Twitch channel. I I think it's it, it's definitely up there. It, it it's 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 real bad. That was real bad. Yeah. How many? Uh, just out of curiosity, because as we all know, um, every video gets the views it deserves. So, Protector of Jam, could you tell us how many views that video has on YouTube, please? If you know offhand, Peachy, thanks for the uh. Freak! The sub, that's another fresh freak. Thank you so much, Peachy. Um, you guys want to take guesses? Okay. The video has... Okay. The video has 1.7 million views. One point seven million views. I'm not fucking with you. No, protect your jam wouldn't make that up. Dude, so like every video gets the views it deserves. Guys, right? Man, that was fucking painful. 1.7 million future U.S. Senators. Okay, we're going to watch another one. Um, hopefully it'll suck less cock. This is, just, the vid, the file is just called Prank. I'm going to set off a huge fireworks display right here in the school parking lot. This backpack is full of fireworks, and I'm going to light them. That's going to kill somebody, man. Don't do that. Holy shit. Get away from the car! Get out of the car right now! Please, just get out! Get out! Get away from- This is a carjacking. The car. Just get out of the car! It's gonna blow! Get out of the car! What? What? Everybody get back. What is happening? <laughs> <laughs> My car! I, I, I mean, just drive away? He okay, so the fucking fuse is burning down, like the fuse is 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 you know uh, the fireworks are gonna explode. He jumps in front of the car, and he starts screaming at her to get out of the car. Guys, if he didn't fucking say anything at all, she would have probably just drove away. She had like a good yeah, she had like a half a minute at least to just get the fuck out of there. He could have just been like, drive away, quick, drive away. Mike, this is realistic because people are this stupid. Nice. He unintentionally became a, a member of the IRA. All right, it's time. You can't joke about that. Okay, you can't. Jo you can't joke about that. Don't joke about that. All right, you're gonna get in trouble, or you're gonna get me in trouble. All right.
for another one of Tyler the Trickster's amazingly hilarious tricks. Aw, doesn't Dana look so pretty in her white dress? I'd hate to see her get anything on it. And he just fucking throws a, fi a lit firework into her lap. <laughs> I've got a surprise for her. It was just a prank, bro. Oh, hey, Tyler. Hey, Dana. You look nice today. Is that a new dress? Yeah, my mom got it for me. I heard it was your birthday today. So here, have this balloon. Happy birthday. Thank you. That's it's full of piss. It's full of piss. Nice of you. No worries. Piss balloon, bro. Give me a balloon. All right, guys, watch this. <laughs> <laughs> You've just been tricked by Tyler the Trickster. How could you? You ruined my dress. You got glitter all over it. Wow, what a fucking loser. Sucks to suck. If you like this video, you'll love the next one I have planned. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. That video is gonna get the views it deserves. If I get up to 1 million likes, I'm gonna do something crazy big. Aren't you going to say sorry? It's not my fault you wore a white dress to school. It it'll come right out. What? I should make you pay for a new one. Once I reach 1 million likes and I get TikTok famous, I'll buy you 10 new dresses. All right, let me ask you guys a question. What, what's wrong with the fucking dress? There was something in it? Something like crazy big. I don't, how did the balloon destroy the dress? It would glitter. Aren't you going to say sorry? No. Okay, can't you just put that in a fucking washing machine? My fault you wore a white dress to school. It, it'll come right out. What? I should make it. It's not my, my fault you wore a white dress to school. <laughs> Once I reach one million likes and I get TikTok famous, I'll buy. Uh, you know what's funny is that there's people, really people with logic like that. Well, you shouldn't have wore a white dress to school. That's just the way she goes. No, you got glitter all over my, my dress intentionally. Like, that is not... I have 10 new dresses. Come on, Later, man. I've got some cool things to do. You remember Gamby? This, okay, this fucking... Sh I've been trying to remember this story for fucking months, okay? Because it, it's related to the that's the way she goes thing from, from Trailer Park Boys. We were in... I think we were in college at this point. And... Uh, fucking, like... <laughs> Gamby. Remember Gamby? He... Uh, what was it? He he was uh, fucking... He wanted to... He was gonna sell weed to these girls, but he, like, took the money and was like, oh... He was like, oh, thanks for the... All right, though. I'm gonna go pick up the weed now. And he was, like, gonna bring them the weed. But he went and got the money from them first. He went and bought weed and was like, yo, fuck this, and smoked it himself. And then when they called up and were like, why did you do that? You know? He was, they were like, where's the weed? He's like, I couldn't get it. And they were like, well, what, 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 can you bring, bring us our money back? And he's like, yo, I don't have it. And they're like, well, what do you... Where is it? Can we have it back? He's like, yo, life sucks. Deal with it. And then hung up on them. <laughs> so, so in other words, he's saying, yeah, welcome to the real world. Like he's saying life sucks. Like as if whatever, as if like this couldn't be helped. You know what I mean? Like as if, as if, <sighs> As if this was out of his control, you know? No, because he didn't say welcome to the real world. He said life sucks. Like the, like the cosmic nature of the universe is, 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 the, is the, to blame for the tragedy that befell them. You know what I'm saying? It was destiny. It was destiny. He taught them a lesson. He did teach them a lesson, though. He absolutely did. Yeah, you don't fucking give somebody money until the drugs are in your hand. Or no, no, no. The, the lesson is don't buy drugs, okay? That's the lesson. Don't buy drugs. Yo, life sucks. Deal with it. Like he was like, he, <laughs> deal with it. All right, so in new dresses. Dude, see, I started watching the the Trailer Park Boys. I've been thinking about Gamby a lot because he he's very he's very like like the character Ricky. Is very similar to like how the things he would say and do because he was also that stupid. So definitely, I'm I'm having some, I'm having some like l latent memories being uh, 
brought to the surface as I watch this show, you know? Later, I've got some cool things to do. Someone in chat had pointed out, no, 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 the map does have Alaska. It's just Alaska's up here. Okay, tricksters, are you ready for another trick? This one's gonna be really good. Hello, Tyler. Oh, hello, Miss Stevens. Don't you look lovely today? You know that shooting videos for social media isn't allowed on school property, right? Of course, I would never do something like that. Then what are you doing with the tripod? Why is it? Why did it become so quiet suddenly? I'm working on a video project for- So much as that holy milf. Dude, I can't help but feel like she would look a lot hotter if she had like white face paint on with like a big red nose and maybe some like, maybe some like red diamonds over her eyes and, and shit, you know? Like maybe like some big red lips. And like a big fucking red afro. Class. Okay. Are you telling me the truth? Miss Stevens, I promise. And yes, it's for art class. A flower that shoots seltzer out of it. Yes. Okay. Good luck. That would really bring the ensemble together. Go jerk off. Who's the hot clown from Arms? Doesn't Arms have a hot clown? Oh, here's your mom. With like a fat ass. I have a surprise cupcake. For Who's him. that? Lola Pop. Best. Maybe I gotta give arms another shot. Hey Jamal. Oh. I'm sorry, the drugs are making me so stupid, guys. I'm sorry. Hey Tala, what's up? My mom made me an extra cupcake and I'm way too full to eat it. Do you want it? Really? Sure. Imagine just eating something not wrapped from a random person. Like, uh, okay, no. Especially somebody that you know is like a fucking notorious jerk off. Yeah. Oh, what is that? It's this brand new flavor called mud. I swallowed some of that. Is that even safe to eat? It's 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 a, a like a mud cupcake. That's a great question. Oh, I think I'm gonna be sick. <laughs> Looks like you didn't like the special mud cupcake I mud made cupcake. for her. How would that work? Like, is is it just dirt? Do you mean dirt? Sonic. Oh, another opportunity. <laughs> that cupcake was laced with fentanyl. Full of fireworks. Oh my gosh, like, did you know about the, like, uh, Oh my guys? gosh. What are you doing here? I just want to apologize for what happened earlier today. Oh, I, I was pretty rude. That was really not nice of me. Are you telling me neither really of them noticed this? It wasn't cool. Do you guys forgive me? Kids are getting dumber. Yeah, their per their perception is warped. Like they don't fucking there's their like awareness of their surroundings is is severely handicapped from years of watching fucking content like this on YouTube. I'm sorry. Sure. Well, bye. Thank you. And TikTok perception one. Okay, that was really that weird. Was weird. Three, two, one. <laughs> ah! 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 Yo, do you guys hear the music? Yo, bro, it's like scorn music. You fucking hear this? Okay, what's go what happened? I don't know. It got louder again, or these are fireworks. Who did this? this I still haven't played scorn, by the way. Extremely. I'm assuming that's like that's the kind of music that's going on. Be dangerous. You know? Kelsey could have been seriously injured. Stevens, I'm fine. Explo Don't play scorn, loser. Listeners like this are not allowed on school property. If I find out who did this, you're going to be in huge trouble. Here, Kelsey. I'm going to take these. Two time. Kelsey, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. That was really scary. The screeching made your dog go crazy, Soki? Yeah, it was very high pitched. And the fucking shitty microphones weren't helping. Could have been hurt. I know, but I wish I knew who did it, though. We know who did it. It, it was, was Tyler. Tyler. He's been playing tricks on people all day. He ruined my dress. He made me sick. I he shit in my mouth, basically. To go to the nurse. His tricks are getting out of control. We need to stop him before he can do it to anyone else. Wait, he made you eat a shit cupcake? Okay, that's, that's, that's pretty funny. I... Gotta be honest. Hey Tyler, we need to talk to you. We know you're the one who put fireworks in Kelsey's backpack. Oh man, that was hilarious. That wasn't hilarious. It was actually quite scary and we think you should stop. 
You like the sound design here? Before you could actually hurt someone. <laughs> Are you kidding? I finally got 1 million likes with that last video. It'd be Every video gets the views it deserves. Don't stop now. We're going to tell Mrs. Stevens that you've been making videos and you'll get suspended or worse. You think I care? After this next trick, I'm going to be famous. I don't even need school anymore. This is this this is the fucking backstory of Mr. Beast. I'm not even kidding. Do you know Mr. Beast dropped out of like fucking eighth grade to be a YouTuber or something? No, that re this is this is Mr. Beast origins. Yes, he did. He really did. Or he dropped out of high school to be a YouTuber. What what what? When did he drop out of school? He was already a millionaire what, when he started making YouTube videos. Who let him? Y yeah, I mean. Okay, he so he okay so he's from a rich background. He was called Beast Junior back then. Um. But you gotta fit. You gotta fit. Okay, <clears throat> he was able to do that because he was supported by his rich parents. Okay, he doesn't make it sound like a rags to riches fucking like bootstrap success story. Like he doesn't do, he, does he do that? He fucking, you know, he 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 doesn't. He, I I think the story is that he dropped out so he could focus or his parents let him, which I mean like holy fuck irresponsible parenting. I don't care how rich you are. What the fuck? I'm going to drop out of school to become a YouTuber. Uh no you're not. You fucking high? Uh, what? No. Who like who allowed that? You know how many people probably do that or and, and don't get anywhere? Like YouTube is such a fucking crapshoot, dude. It was college, and that's very... Co okay, all right, all right, all right. Dropping out of college is less... Yeah, okay. That's... All right, that's less... Well, at, at the same time, though, it's like... Uh, Moon Bun, hey, thanks for seven months. He is now teaching a Harvard class on his grift model. What the fuck does that mean? What, does he teach you how to do, like, YouTube SEO and, and shit? Um, who is he grifting specifically? I, I mean, the child laborers who make his chocolate. I mean, is that, I don't know, is that a, is that a, I think that's worse than a grift. I don't know what the fuck that is. Your mother, someone said. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't, yeah, I would, I wouldn't, I wouldn't drop out of school to like, essentially gamble my future on whether or not a YouTube channel was going to work. But apparently he, he, he went hard into like studying YouTube and like trying to figure out how YouTube works. And I got to be honest with you guys, I tried that and it did not work. I didn't drop out of fucking school, but I was sitting here and, and putting free time into figuring out how to fucking, you know, make YouTube work. I, I did everything I fucking could and it didn't really work. So, I mean, I don't know what the fuck. You, you, you can't force that, you know? Like, YouTube is the type of thing where you could do everything right and it still doesn't work. You know what I mean? So, I mean, I don't know what the fuck. Probably made a pact with Satan or something. Smurbish, thank you for 14 months. And Layla with uh, two months. Thanks, guys. What you don't see, right? You don't see the thousands of kids that dropped out school to be a failed, YouTube, uh, failed YouTuber. Just how, like, you don't hear about usually the people who, like, lost money in crypto, right? Everybody's like, oh, dude. Like, uh, somebody in Florida was telling me, like, a guy who made, you know, who was able to retire on, like, Shiba Inu. And it's like, uh, yeah, that was one guy, you know? I don't know. You don't hear about the, 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 the fucking... The fa you hear about the success stories. You don't hear about the failure stories. Okay? On top of being pro-trans, Mr. Beast is starting to get relatively based. 
I love that the dude will publicly defend his friends. I think that's fucking incredibly awesome. But like, I I don't want you guys to get distracted from the fucking children slate child slaves making chocolate. Okay, when he fucking starts doing things like like stopping that, then we could talk about how based he is. Okay, but having fucking child slavery. Okay, what the fuck? No, there's no that no amount of fucking like you know supportive tweet is gonna cancel out child slavery. The slave isn't real. It was deconfirmed. It was deconfirmed. It was deconfirmed. But is it good chocolate? It, but okay, by all accounts, it is mid and nor and and fucking basic run of the mill chocolate. Okay. Mid is a praise. I, okay, I didn't eat it. I didn't eat it. Part of the reason I haven't eaten it is because I can't get past the name Feastables. Is he selling cat food? Feastables. Disgusting name for food. Fucking asshole. Feastables. Bre bre he should have called them Breastables. <laughs> Breastables. Yeah, apparently child slavery is deconfirmed. It never happened. It's not real. Fake news. All chocolate is made by slaves. No, chat 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 said that there's there's um that there's ways to get non-slave chocolate. All right. It is there's non-slave chocolate. It exists, right? I thought Mr. Beast was locked in some dude's basement, but then his son found him. Yeah, and he made an epic video about it that got all the views it deserved. Mm -hmm. Okay. Some of the people saying that the slavery allegations were deconfirmed are referring to lawsuits that were dropped by corrupt judges or not allowed to come to trial because of jurisdiction issues. The former slaves are not being allowed to sue. I'm going to tell you something. I am. I'm. I'm. I'm going to. I'm going to tell you this right now. I, I. Again, you know, I like. I like to have conversations like this once in a while about like serious stuff that's not like memes. Okay. I think I. I, I want to be able to do that sometimes. I do, and I don't think it's that big of a deal. And I get annoyed when people bitch about it. The problem is right now I'm too high to talk about that. Okay. That's the fucking problem right now. Pretty obscure. Thanks for 20, uh, 26 months. Thank you. I'm going to play this, vid this video, okay? Come on, guys. Let's go find Miss Stevens. Tyler, what are you doing? Why are we outside? It's for a video. We don't care for your dumb videos. Yeah. You stay right there. It'll be cool. You don't care for okay, your dumb video, Tyler. Are you ready for the grand finale? To celebrate reaching one million likes, I'm gonna set off a huge fireworks display right here in the school parking. Yeah, but that's not a prank, penis. What the fuck? How is that a prank? You're just setting off a bunch of fireworks in the parking lot? I mean, I go, all right, the, the, the sound is gonna be a, a disturbance, right? It's it's gonna be, but is it, is it a prank? It's probably just a fucking nuisance, if anything. Man, he's not a prankster; he's a trickster. Hey, John, what is the origin of the all v views deserved phrase? <clears throat> when when I was in San Diego at at TwitchCon last year, I met a a Zoomer Minecraft YouTuber who was very, very successful. I will not tell you who they were. And I was asking them, I, and I was asking them about YouTube. I was like, well, you know, I've been, I've been, <laughs> like, I've been trying to have, find success on YouTube for many years. Um, you got any, t you got any tips? You got any, you know, you, what, 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 what's your take on it? You know, what do you, what do you think? 
And he told me every video gets the views it deserves. And I said, well, I don't really think that, that that's fair because, you know, I've really fucking busted my ass on, you know, some of my content. I think some of my content's fucking great. You know, you haven't seen any of it. I'm going to tell you straight up. I'm going to tell you, I believe, I believe my content deserves more views than it gets. Well, I think it, I believe it deserves a lot more views than it gets. If you think that makes me sound like a cunt, then so be it. But it, but I believe it. And he just kind of repeated himself. He said every video gets the views it deserves. And I want to remind you guys that the huggy wuggy fucking algo vomit we just watched has 1.7 million views. There are finger family videos of fucking. Sonic the Hedgehog being mpreg that have fucking 3.6 million views. You know what I'm saying? Like, like there's, there's something's wrong, guys. That's like that. It's not true. You know, I'm I'm trying to think of other pro other examples. The system is functioning. Do not question it further. Yeah, I mean, if I had fucking two million subscribers, I would probably say the same thing. You know, how did how, how how many views did the Sonic Long Legs video get before you YouTube pulled it? I don't know, too many. Yeah, you know, I mean, how many times have you seen a YouTube video where you're like, how does this not have more views? And it just is. I mean, you've probably seen it many times, guys. It's it's just it, it's simply not true that every vi video gets the views it deserves. That's just false. But it's kind of a funny thing to say sometimes, when, especially when something clearly doesn't deserve the, vi the views it has. Right. What? This backpack is full of fireworks, and I'm gonna light them. Because don't forget, it, 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 it's it's not people deciding they're not going to click on your video. It's not people deciding, oh, I. I and mean, so, sometimes it is. Sometimes it is people saying like, oh, I watched one of their videos and it was terrible. I didn't care for it. So I'm not going to be subscribing or watching any more of them. You know, nobody is seeing them. YouTube is burying people's videos. Like it's, it's not, they're just not being, they're just not being distributed. You know, like it, it's pretty clear. I mean, like try to find my shit in incognito mode, for example. You know? That's why I stopped making YouTube videos. Like, I don't make YouTube videos anymore. Like, Spitforce, it makes, it makes it edits of streams. Like, like highlight clips of streams, and that's it. If you go back a couple years, you're gonna see I was doing fucking... I was going hard. Like, scripted stuff and shit like that, you know? For a lot of people, YouTube is just fucking nuts. They, they put the videos up and they just get the views. It, 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 it's fucking nuts how some people just put, you know, virtually no effort into it and are just, I don't know. Get away from the car! Get out of the car right now! Please, just get out! Get out! Get away from the car! Just get out of the car! It's what gonna blow! Bro, he sounds like a, he sounds like fucking a Rick and Morty character. This backpack is full of fireworks, and I'm gonna light them. Listen. Oh, jeez, Rick, you gotta get out of the car, Rick. You gotta get out of the car right now, Rick. Get away from the car! Get out of the car right now! Please, just get out! Get out! Get away from Come the on, car! Just get out of the car! It's gonna blow! Come on, get out of the car! What? Everybody get back. Fucking straight up like Justin Roiland dialogue right there. <laughs> You're allowed to. You're allowed to get out of the car. You're allowed to. Why would anyone believe it? I. Oh yeah, the explosion. Honestly, the the explosion of, uh, video effects are not bad. But that's pretty fucking good right there. See that? That's that looks legit. It also looks like a fucking IED and not a bag of fireworks, but I guess that's a different, a different problem, right? Get 
Whoa. Cool. Who is responsible for this? It was Tyler. He's been doing all of this because he's smart. There's smartphone apps that can make that effect. <laughs> Making some dumb video. Tyler told me that video was for art class. He lied. He's been making TikTok videos. Come on, you don't believe that, do you? I would never do something like that. It's true, Miss Stevens. He was the one who put the fireworks in my bag. Look, here's his TikTok page. Yeah, it's an IED explosion. It, it, it's, apparently, it's a stock explosion. Python, Melon, thanks for 26 months, bud. You're coming to my office right now. Got him. Wow, what little bitches. What you and snitches. What you did was reckless and dangerous. You could have killed yourself or some fucking narcs, bro. Someone else. What were you thinking? I was just trying to make a good video, Miss Stevens. Well, now you're responsible for covering the cost of damages to my car. I'll be able to pay for that, no problem. Now that my last TikTok video went viral, the money's gonna start rolling in. Dude. You fucking get him. You, it's, if you get like, if you get five million views on that video on TikTok, you made seven cents. No, your TikTok channel will immediately be taken down. What? You can't do that. Yes, I can. In fact, I already spoke to your mother, and she has deleted your profile. But now I'll never. <laughs> How did she get into his fucking account? Famous. You've got bigger problems than that, Tyler. You're also expelled from this school. Get fucked. No education for you. Bringing explosives onto school property is illegal and will not be tolerated. But if I can't make TikToks anymore, my life will be ruined. Well, maybe you should have thought of that before you made those videos. Now, your entire future is in jeopardy. Dude, just make vlogs about your life living out of a dumpster. That'd be a huge hit. I bet people would unironically like that. You know, dumpster vlogs. He's 14. Yeah, I mean... What's he gonna do? Like, he's... I wouldn't let that kid back in my house. He has to go on Jeopardy? Oh, because his future is in Jeopardy? Right, that's how he... She says your future is in Jeopardy. And then he gets the fucking... He gets the idea. He's like, oh, that means I have to go on Jeopardy and win a million dollars. And that becomes his new fucking obsession is getting on Jeopardy. And it works. Because fucking shitty people have the best luck. Right? Like people like 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 scumbags always get like what have wonderful things happen to them. You ever notice that? You notice the worst fucking people have amazing lives. You ever fucking notice that? Piplup, up. Thanks for uh, nine months. Doom combo. The the doom combo. Mike is describing the Paul brothers. It's because they're willing to fuck people over. To an extent, perhaps. I'm gonna say to an extent. Right. Uh, all right, so let's not go into a doom spiral here. For Dermis, thanks for 15 months. Uh, uh, Mike, I'm in Tennessee for work, and my rental car, car got wrecked. Thankfully, nobody was hurt. What kind of food do I get to make myself feel better while watching you? Cheers me up. How close are you to Nash? Can you get to Nashville? I agree. I agree, Buzz. Thanks for five months. I actually never had the hot chicken, but if you can get, get hot chicken, 20 minutes from Nashville, go get Nashville hot chicken and tell me how it is. I never got to have it. The only reason I didn't get to have it is because when I was in Nashville with my brother, it was like, I don't know, fucking seven years ago or something. We heard about the hot chicken and we, uh, we, we drive to the restaurant that has like the world famous Nashville hot chicken. And the fucking restaurant looked like Shrek's Swamp Hut. And my brother was like, I am not eating in there. That's fucking rancid. I, I'm not going in there. I'm not getting food from that place. That place is fucking 
That's that's like a fucking cockroach hotel. I'm not eating in there. We're not eating. That's a place full of roaches. And then I, I was like, all right, dude, whatever. You know what? You're probably right. I told him. And then I found out when we when we came home that that hot chicken joint, that that little place is like God tier fucking chicken. Does anybody know the name of that place? Cockroach. Hattie B's. I was going to go there for lunch and I was slammed. All right. Well, here's the other thing you could do. All right. Listen, this is going to be, I'm, I'm giving you a touristy suggestion. You go into town. There's the two barbecue places. Like it, it's, it's, you know, like Southern style barbecue places that are across the street, street from each other. Fucking they're called Jack's and Rippy's. Here's what you're going to do. All right. All right, Walton. Here's what you're going to do, Walton. First, you're going to go up to Jack's. You're going to go sit on the fucking... It's got to be a beautiful day down there. You're going to sit on a roof. You're going to order yourself some St. Louis-style ribs. You're going to eat that whole rack of ribs to the face. Full rack. Not a half rack. All right, get a full rack of ribs. Eat them to the face. All right, now you're going to go down and you're going to go across the street to the other restaurant and you're going to get a rack of ribs from that restaurant. And you're going to eat that to the face. You know why? Those are the two. You know, it's 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 it was a little bit like no half racks, Walter. You know how Philadelphia has the two like cheesesteak places that are across the street from each other and they like beef with each other. What is it? Omega monkey. Thank you for the gift sub. What what are the name of those places? Cheese cheesesteaks. Pats and Geno's. Yeah. And everybody's like, yo, I'm team Pats. Yo, I'm team Geno's. And the funny part is they both suck. And it's fuck it's like it's like touristy bullshit. Wet farts. Thanks for the gift sub, man. It's a little bit like that, but you're gonna do it anyway, okay? Go get eat both ribs and tell us which one's better. All right. Nintendo, thanks for 23 months, bud. Eat since you can't decide, eat both of them. Uh, hold on. Mike judges a book by its cover and instantly regrets it. I did not judge the book by my brother did, and I had to do what he wanted. Like he was, he was driving. He we were gonna eat where he wanted. I wasn't gonna fucking. Also, he was, like, paying for me on that. He was, like, paying for everything on that trip. So I didn't want to be like, fuck you, no. We're going in there, you know? Uh, ruined bun. Ruined bun. Thank you for 10 months. <laughs> At, when we, were, we were, like, on the airport, in the airport on the way back. And he was like, man, you like some expensive beer. I was like, I sure do. <laughs> I sure do. Nah, that, okay, well. Well, we, we were together in Florida, and I, I more than made up for it. I, I bought him tons of drinks in Florida. I bought him, I bought him tons of drinks and, and food and shit when we were in Florida. So it's, it's more, it's more than made up for now. Um, never judge a cover by its book. I mean, that happens, right? Like, sometimes you have, like, a really, really cool uh, fucking cover art, but then the book is dog shit. Like, what do you think goes on with all those, like, paperback paradise covers that they edit? Like, you, th like, you think those books are good? Never judge a man by his cock. It's pretty good advice. I guess. All right, I'm gonna play this, guys. Okay. Oh. Fuck, that was loud. Everybody, anybody, is everybody's ears okay? Holy shit! Oh, look what we have here. And then I forgot to lower it before I, I pressed play again. Funny.
The name of the video, by the way, is Roblox. Oh, look what we have here. That's chills. Russell's backpack. Number 15, Russell's backpack. I wonder what he's got inside. Oh, look. It's fireworks, look out. You should never leave your laptop unattended. That's enough for me. <laughs> <laughs> wow, what a fucking penis. <laughs> Russell's so lucky I'm around to teach him life lessons. Who is he staring at as he talks to himself? Time for Pet Simulator X. Great, let's do the tech world. No, we're playing fantasy. Pet Simulator X, Roblox. Life, <laughs> life sucks. Deal with it. Yeah. Fine. Let's hatch some eggs. None of these. Did you pour orange soda on my laptop? Yo, shit happens. Deal with it. Basics. I want the rare ones. But this isn't shit happening. This is you deliberately poured orange soda on my laptop. Yo, deal with it. Welcome to the real world. Life lessons. Yeah. Yeah. Who doesn't? Got a corgi, black bear, golden tiger. That's oh, thanks for the scam train, guys. Classic Corobo with five months. Thanks, bud. Lame. I'm looking for a legendary. Hey, it's they destroyed a laptop to make this video. Guys, is that the same dude? You guys are playing Roblox. That's right, Pet Simulator X. Yeah, Russell, you should join us. I, uh, I think your laptop's in your backpack. Okay. Dude, that means it's gonna be the same type of fucking bullshit video. Oh my god, it's fucking 16 minutes long. Okay, no poison. What is this? My laptop's ruined. Oh, looks like Russell wants to play Ocean World. I don't think so, Brock. That's not funny. Obviously, he did that on purpose so he doesn't have to play against us. Oh yeah, I'd ruined my laptop on purpose. Russell, man, what are you gonna do now? Now you see him, he's doing that betch, like his head's moving around, like, like, like fucking... I don't know. Like he's sassy, you know? I'm writing a Roblox game. It's a good thing the files are online. Oh, you are? Well, you better get a diaper for whatever computer you use. Very funny, Brock. A computer diaper? That's a million dollar idea. All I can say is when my game's done, you're gonna stink at it. That is so cool you're writing a game. When can I play it? It doesn't matter, Dylan. They didn't the guy in the middle is coming off as like mega passive aggressive and I don't think he's intending that He's only writing that game because he's the worst at every other one. Oh Yeah, well, maybe you and I should do a competition one of these days Maybe we could do it in a swimming pool so that you will always win They're gonna have a gamer off a game off guys. You know what? I'm out of here. I'm gonna write my game at home. They're breaking the 180 rule so much. Pro protector of Jam, what is the 180 rule? I've never heard of that. What's that? Bye bye Aquaman. Dude, don't you think you're being a little hard? It, but it wasn't water, it was soda. Russ Camera angle switching? What's Russell's the rule? Russell's laptop is broken and he doesn't know who did it. I I'm starting to think these people might not be professional. Toaster Wings, thanks for 13 months, bud. He's going to have to find a different computer to build his game on. It's the fucking TikTok voice. When characters look at each other off screen, they look in their direction, not in some random direction. Hey, could you guys teach me how to play Brookhaven? Sure. No, I got it. Why is this all wet? Oh, that's Russell. He's messy. Don't pay attention to him. Vivarium. Now that I have my shanty next to my cove, I'm gonna put the spawn point on the other side of town. Here. Oh, Russell. Anyway. Why are you using my laptop to do your homework? Why show that? To show you that they're at home now and not at school anymore? Man who has only seen Vivarium seeing his first suburb. By the way, that movie is pretty good. I, I, it, it's bad, but I like it. It's one of those. Uh, I left mine at school. Uh, I'm using yours so I can build my... 
Homework. Yeah, it's an establishing shot, right? Oh, really? What you working on? The cock movie. Uh, it, it is, though. Uh, history. That's not history. You're playing a game. It's on fucking uh, uh, Amazon Prime. I'm not playing a game. I'm writing one. Making, playing, there's no difference. I told you, you cannot play games till all your homework is done. Dude, she's sweating profusely. You see that? She's like fucking... Mom, I'm all... She's leaking, dude. What the fuck? I'm already getting all A's and B's. No, you're not. You're only getting a C in history. She looks like Rudy Giuliani in court. History? Who cares? The future is technology, not history. And just how are you supposed to learn about the future? The fuck? Is that more sweat? Why is she so moist? If you don't know about the past. Fine, I'll do my history. But I am gonna be a big game developer someday. Well, that's more like it. Dude, what you working on? It's my new game. I'm calling it Quest Forever Lost. Looks cool. That fucking blows. What's it gonna be like? Well, it's set in the Middle Ages. Imagine a fantasy land that you can explore. All right, but all the NPC voice acting has to be done by chills. And participate in epic adventures. Wow, where'd you get that idea? I came up with it myself. You've got like an ocean and village and, and people. Wow, where did you come up with the idea of a medieval fantasy game that has villages and oceans? Right, he's like, you see that bush? You can no clip through it. Well, how do you do that? Roblox has and people a powerful developer toolkit that I've tailored to my needs. So then I move it here. Hey, what are you guys doing? See that bush? You could fuck it. I like the idea of this kid that not having seen of not having seen or ever heard of a fucking like medieval RPG in his life. Russell showing me the Roblox game he's building. No doubt he has to build his own medieval fantasy RPG. He doesn't know how to play. That's what Roblox guys. It's getting like really scary the, the the fucking shit that people are making in Roblox though. Isn't it like like some of those fucking games are, are just bananas? Like you you can no, it, it's it's pretty it's actually kind of impressive. Do you think all you're gonna ever be able to do is play games? Well, I am gonna make them. Well, at least I know how to play them. Unlike you. What is their beef coming from? It's like not a believable beef. Like, he destroyed his laptop for no reason. Like, is there, again, like, did we miss something? Like, what is their, like, are they friends? Are they not friends? What the fuck is this? Brittany, as if I even need to tell you, you got an A. Oh, wait, did I miss one? Dude, this would be so much more epic if he wiped his ass with her paper before giving it back to her. I'll do better next time. I see a couple of areas where you could improve, but otherwise, great job, Dylan. B plus. <sighs> I feel like there's something missing from the from this from this story, you know, and it's a little bit of feces, right? All right, Brock. Seventy one percent. I mean, C minus. Seventy one percent. That's passing, right? Uh, yeah. Yes. All right. Sweet. Russell, on this test, you got a D plus. I mean, you're gonna have to pull this grade up. I'm doing really well in all my other classes. Well, if you can't do better in my class, you're gonna have to retake history. I can't retake history? What am I gonna do? Well, have you considered getting a tutor? I can offer a few referrals. Yeah, man, whatever it takes. Guys, my eyelid is, is like jiggling profusely. Do you think the spinal issues could be like exacerbating the eyelid issues? What year was the French? Oh yeah, I'm loving the people sitting next to each other and not looking at each other as they talk. Revolution? The French Revolution was... 17... 80... 8. I was one year off. I was one year off. I was one fucking... That's not bad. That's not bad at all. I'm going to tell you what. I'm, I'm, we'll, we'll take that. We'll take that. 
Of course, that was the first French Revolution. Because don't forget, the French had a revolution to... Here we go with the French people again. The French had a revolution to overthrow the monarchy. And then they were like, we, we, <laughs> we were just kidding. And then made Napoleon emperor. And then had to have another revolution to like undo that. They were like, just kidding. And they, they, they said, just kidding. And, ha and went back to having an emperor. And now they're, and now they're doing it again right now. They're fucking pissed. They're fucking pissed off. Guys, that's, that rioting is not about their fucking retirement age anymore. That is now about, like, the system. And you know what? And you know, and you know what? I'm too high for this conversation. Again, again. I'm too high for this conversation. I would also like to point out, can I just point this out real quick? I have only seen coverage of 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 any of of what's happening in France on TikTok. Why is that only being fucking reported on on TikTok? Get, like think about it. Like where did you I've seen a bit on TV, but but barely. Yeah, it it's it's it, it's fucking a massive fucking global event, right? And isn't it funny that our our government wants to ban TikTok? You know, you know, you know, you know. Not global. Shut the fuck up. You know what I fucking meant. Fuck. I don't know, maybe it's a coincidence. I don't know. I'm just gonna Google it. Google this. Russell, you're not playing that... History? Yeah, Mom. I think I'm finally starting to get it. Oh, really? History is nothing but memorization. You know, names, dates, places. Well, honey, there is more to it than that. Maybe we should get you a tutor. Yeah, that's what Mr. B suggested. Well, in that case, why not try it? Russell's mom wants Russell 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 Rostel Rostel Mr. Breast History is nothing but memorization. I missed the breast. You know, hold on. Hold. Names, dates, places. Fuck. Well, Fuck. honey, Fuck. there is more Fuck. to it than that. Maybe we should get you a tutor. Yeah, that's oh. what Mr. B suggested. Mr. Beast suggested. Well, in that case, why not try it? Russell's mom Russell. wants him to get a tutor because she won't be happy unless he gets an A in history. If you have eyes and ears, then you already know that and you don't need the narrator to say that. In fact, you don't even need eyes, you just need ears. Russell. Hey, dude, I, I just built my first boat and it's floating. That's not the way you play build a boat for treasure. What do you mean that's not how you're supposed to play? Yo, this fucking uh, Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom is looking fucking you're supposed lit. to build a boat for treasure. No, oh, man, what you want to do is get treasure first so you can build a better boat. Look, I just got a soccer goal. Yeah, I see that. And 50 gold and 40 blocks. Where exactly do I find that anyway? So what you want to do is you want to go into this quest tab. Like right now, I'm going to load up the ramp quest to get more gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I see it. I'm going to go for the target quest. Why are they showing us this? This is completely fucking irrelevant. Like, you think any of that has any impact on the story? Look who's here. Dylan, why are you hanging out with this Roblox noob? No. He's not a noob. Yeah, I'm better than you. Oh, really? Well, how many Robux do you got? More than you. I got 800 for my birthday. You know what's fuck? I, it, it just hit me what the problem with this is. These are supposed to be like, like they look like high school students. They're acting like they're eight. Right? That That's the fucking problem.
Yeah, they, they, that that's yeah. What? They're all fucked up. Look who they have gigantism. He's here. Watch th watch this fucking dialogue. Watch lo listen. Look how they talk to each other, especially how the the the, the little like the little like Jerma clone is acting. Dylan, why are you hanging out with this Roblox noob? He's not a noob. Yeah, I'm better than you. Oh really? Well, how many Robux do you got? More than you. I got 800 for my birthday. Well, I've earned 1200 so far and my game's not even done. Well, while you're working on your game, I'm gonna be going to the Roblox Championship up in San Francisco. Dude, did you make it into the championship? This kind of makes me want to commit violence. You know? He has pigeon neck. He has like congenital fucking terminal pigeon neck. They got Roblox in Evo. They put Roblox in Evo. Well, not officially. I have to win two more rounds first. Don't you only have to win three rounds to get there? Yeah, but that doesn't matter. I'm the best Roblox player in the school. Uh, don't you mean second best? Well, why don't we do a little competition and make it interesting? What do you have in mind? Well, I've got 800 Robux saved up. Why don't we play winner take all? 800? That's nothing. You're on. Should have been something like you have to suck his fat, sweaty cock. Bring your 800 Robux. Robux. What are we playing? Blocks fruits. Blocks fruits? Yeah. Whoever survives the longest, that's the winner. You're going down. Did a boomer write this? I, I don't know who the fuck. I, what, they, what, uh. Brock has challenged Russell to a winner take all match to decide the best Roblox player in school. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> the, the narrator. Oh, uh, it's so unnecessary. I don't know why I need history tutoring. I can memorize all this on my own. There's more to history than just memorizing. You have to understand the implications. Like the French Revolution. I know all the dates and people. What else is there to know? That's all fine. But do you know why there was the revolution? Mr. Beaton ran out of baguettes. Cover that? Am I supposed to know it? Yeah. That's the difference between getting a C and an A. Oh, it's kind of like Roblox. I know where and when to put things, but I- No more cake. I need to know why people like to play. Yeah, history's like people. If You know what was fucking bonkers? There was, there was like a, 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 a fucking French noble that was- they, they were like outrageously fucking rich. And they had a, a, a fucking pretend poor person village built on their fucking estate where they could go pretend to be poor people. Did you guys ever fucking hear about that? That was that was Marie Antoinette. Like, imagine if you're a poor person and you see that. You're not, you know, you're, you're suffering from like, you know, you're, you're, in, you're living in squalor and, and, and poverty and fucking you have like fucking shingles and like fucking ass mites. Okay. And, and, and fucking crawling all over you while you fucking say a shit mites. You got fleas. Okay, and you sleep in a burlap sack in fucking dirt. And then you find out that one of the Richoids has a fucking pretend poor town where they pretend to be poor as a game. You're gonna, you are gonna, you are gonna kill somebody. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna make you real mad. I don't know, man. Like, I, that's gonna, there's gonna be violence, dude. And, you know, like, you know, imagine, dude, how was the modern equivalent of that not, I, I fucking can't, like, oh, all right, we're doing this. We're doing this.
we're doing this. I I put this I have it in the Discord. Uh guys. Now I don't know. I'm not going to say anything. Uh I'm just going to I'm just going to put I'm just going to place this here for your consideration. That is a fucking penis. I have can we yeah, can we really dig into that for that's a fuck that's a penis. That is a fucking penis. D d I mean like they knew, right? That's that was the point, right? That was the point. That's a TOS penis. Yeah, that was the uh, what you think that you think that was unintentionally uh, uh, a penis. The one in Austin Powers had balls. It has veins. It has fucking veins. It has veins for fuck's sake. And if you have to get ejected from it, you get ejected from the top. Like all waste should be ejected from the tip. Bumble friend, thank you so much. Freak! For the uh for the sub. That is a fresh freak, guys. Please dump his. I'm gonna get two dollars and fifty cents of that. And the other two two dollars and fifty cents is going to this guy. Oh wait, actually, no, I didn't account for taxes. I'm gonna get a like a dollar and ten cents out of that. But thank you, I appreciate it. I want to know how these rumors of Marie Antoinette still persist 300 years later. I, I don't, listen, I don't think it's a rumor. Okay, I, I just didn't know that that was Marie Antoinette. It, I knew it was a French noble. I didn't think it was Marie Antoinette. Well, you don't think that happened? You think that you think that's all fucking fake? Hey, Degree, thanks so much for the uh, for the bits, bud. I appreciate it. Thank you. You're, wel I, you're welcome. Thank you. No, th she's not going to fuck you, dude. <laughs> Let them eat cock. That would be like the porn parody of the French Revolution. Let them eat cock. Posting it again, Marie Antoinette didn't said that. It's the people who invented this to discredit her. Chitarbi. Chitarbi is, is French, if I'm not mistaken. So they know. When I read about this, it wasn't Marie Antoinette. Are you are so I don't know. I don't me I don't I don't know where that fucking came from. That's new to me. Are you telling me that that never happened? Oh, the quote. You're talking about the let them eat cake quote. Is that what you're talking about? Why are you defending Marie Antoinette? She's not going to fuck you, bro. Oh, yeah, I believe that that quote is misattributed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it sounds fake. It sounds like a fuck. It sounds like a Hollywood line. It sounds like it sounds like it was written way, way, way later for like drama purposes, you know? Mike, that whole thing is fake news. Unlike Jane Goodall fucking the apes. You know, can, there are still people who believe that Jane Goodall did not have sex with those gorillas. Meanwhile, it was like, what was she even notable for if not gorilla fucking? I, I still don't understand. I still don't get where this is coming from. She absolutely did. Why are people saying it like it's even on the table that she didn't fuck the apes? Like, what's that about? Like, you, what, do you think that's funny? That's like saying Amelia Earhart didn't fly around the world. That's like saying, you know. She is the ape sex legend. If you play the story mode, like the single player story mode in, Apex, in ape sex legends, it's literally just like the, you play through the biography of Jane Goodall. <laughs> Amelia, that's not funny. Amelia Earhart fucked those crabs.
I, I heard. Holy shit. They, she didn't fought gorillas. They were chimps. Oh, okay. All right. So they were chimps. Sorry. Because it matters. You are the ape sex champion. Okay, dude. We're going to fucking fuck. Fuck. Ha! Ah. Guys, I think I'm going to have to go get the fucking, like, the neck brace and put it. I really didn't want to wear it, but, like, I actually think I have to put it on. You know what's going to happen? People are just going to keep asking questions about it, and it's going to be fucking annoying. You know what? It, you know what it is. It's it's not that the neck brace, um, holds my my neck in a certain way. It's more that it, it's a reminder, like not to move my head in certain ways. Does that make sense? Put up text that says "Ask about the neck brace." Get banned. Okay. My neck, my back. And what else? It won't fix it. it it'll, it'll make it like... My theory is that the neck needs to be stable to heal. So every time I turn my head in a weird way and fucking aggravate this thing... I, I'm I'm like fucking redoing some of the damage. Does that am, am I right in assuming that? Like Dr. Chat, I know we're having a Dr. Chat moment. And the neck braces again, it's it's not that it's doing something like it it's just kind of stopping me from I don't know. It's like I could still turn my head, but if I feel something there, I'm not going to. Like, does that make sense? All right, if you don't understand it. Aaron, when to put things, but I need to know why people like to play. Yeah, history is like people. If you don't understand it, you're going to make the same mistakes over and over again. The fuck is she talking about? Mom, I got my history quiz back. Really? Do I want to know? I think you do. I got a B. A B? Good job, Russell. How'd you pull that off? Well, there's this girl, and she and I uh, have been tutoring together. A girl helped you? Is she your girlfriend? Wouldn't that be nice? She's like the most popular girl in school. Why don't you ask her out? No. I can't, Mom. She's got a stinky pussy. I'm too nervous. I'm just going to go upstairs and work on my computer. It better not be that game. Now, if the player wanders too far from Everlost, they'll end up in this creepy town. I'll call it Hill Fair. Hey, Russell, to celebrate, I'm gonna make your favorite Sloppy Joes. Ooh, Sloppy Joes. Russell, what are you doing? Mom, I'm making my game for Roblox. Remember, I got a B in history. I don't care if you got a B or not. You are supposed to be doing your homework right now. Well, Mom, that's not fair. You know what? You don't get to decide what's fair. He, he's he's fucking 24. There, <laughs> I do. All right, back to what I was doing. This is like Coco Melon Andrew Tate. Somebody said he repeated grade seven like seven times. Yeah, mom, you got to give up at some point. You know, he's just not getting it. Can you explain to me what Roblox is? It's a virtual role playing game. Well, what role am I playing? Anything you want. So how do I do that? First, you get your username. Then you got to pick your avatar. Okay, I'm going to set my username as Rebel. Look at her nails. How is their acting this bad? Like, I, I feel like you got to try to act this bad. If I took a random person with absolutely no fucking acting experience and I put them in front of a, in front of a camera, I feel like they could fucking act more convincingly than this. D this is almost like they're deliberately acting like shit. I honestly believe I could do better. I, I know you could do better, Wet Farts. And you're a guy named Wet Farts on the internet.
Yeah, you absolutely could do better than them. Like, they get paid nothing. So that means you do deliberately act bad? Twitch chat, Junior, thanks for 13 months. They're doing it out of spite? I... I guess that could be cool uh, to do that. I... On the other hand, this is something that you could use as part of your resume when you try to get other acting jobs, right? You know, like, like, you know, I, I wouldn't throw just because they're, they're not paying me enough. You know what I'm saying? That's like I make my streams worse because you guys don't sub to me enough. <laughs> what if I did that? What if my my the quality of my of of me as a streamer increased uh correl in in correlation to how much money you, you you that that this audience gives me. What if that was a thing? Wait, you aren't? No, my streams got worse the more successful I became. What are you talking about? Chat would enjoy lower quality streams. Did they? I think so. Yeah, I think my streams suck cock. You know? I think my I think I I think my old streams were better. I think old Mike was he was kind of um he used to say it how it is, and now he's like jaded and he's becoming a more generic kind of a kind of a content creator. Like I think old Mike was based. New Mike is like cringe. I miss the old Mike. I wish Mike would be more like he was in, you know, 20, like 2017 Mike. I miss 2016 Mike. You know, Where, what happened to that Mike? Right? TBH, you peaked at millennial angst slime. Cocksucker, I'm joking. You're not, you can't say shit like that to me, you fucker. I'm just kidding. You're serious, you piece of shit. Fuck you. I'm just, I'm kidding, you cock. Fuck you. Piece of shit. New Mike sucks. New Mike sucks. Old Mike was so based. Current Mike has testicular torsion and doesn't have a foreskin to wrap his cock on. I miss when Mike used to make totally not racist makeup tutorials. But you, you got again. You understand why there isn't why there isn't millennial angst slime too, and and why there isn't fucking totally not racist makeup tutorial too. It's because there's there did nobody watched that shit. You know, it was it just wasn't working. Like it just wasn't working. Uh, Zakute, thanks for the uh, the raid, buddy. Make the mic shitty on purpose. Uh, the microphone quality? Mindfucker. Thanks for three months, bud. I mean, what the fuck can I do? You know, like, what, 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 what can I do? Like, if it worked like that, you know, as I made more money, the streams increased in quality. Like, what could I do? Like how? Like this is all I know how to do. Like what, what am I? What am I gonna? I could spend money on shit. Like I can buy shit. Like I'm gonna eventually get a fucking yeah, like an IRL backpack and shit. But what the fuck else am I gonna do? You know, germ kind of ideas. Guys, you understand? If I try to do anything like that, people will just say I'm I'm ripping off germ. They say that now. What the fuck? Do you... I can't do that shit. Spiteful Crow, thanks for 26 months, buddy. By the way, I can't do what Germa does because, frankly, I lack the creativity for that. Um, he's really He really is a genius, guys. Check Wisp's link. Uh, okay, hold on.
the totally not ri oh i i know i know about this video i made this video why do you why are you linking that she's hot she's pretty hot right we're not we're not watching that right now that'll fucking cause problems and i'm not watching that that vid let that video stay where it belongs okay she's such a bad bitch though she's pretty hot she's pretty hot Pr i'm proud of that i'm proud of how i'm proud of how good i pulled that off mike was serving runt all right, I'm going to play this fucking video, guys, okay? Captain. What's an avatar? You don't know what an avatar is? He fucking sucks so much. What, are you living on Mars or something? No, I live on Hummingbird Lane. And they don't have those in Mars. Wait, I want mine to be a boy, not a girl. You can't be a... She... Her... Her... Script... Like, her dialogue and her acting implies that she is six years old. Okay. Boy, you're a girl. Fine, whatever. Just do what I say. Okay. All right, obviously I missed something. Hold I want on. mine to be a boy, not a girl. You can't be a boy, you're a girl. Fine, whatever. Just do what I say. It, it, fucking what? It's a video game. What the fuck? Okay, now what? Okay, we need to go find a lot to build your house. I don't want a house. I want to be a kid in high school. You can't be a kid in high school. You have to have a house. Okay, fine. Let's get a house. But can I get a house on the beach? I love... I, I, I know girls who play guys in games. You, you know what I love? When, like... I, why, why does this happen a lot? Like... Hardcore misogynistic fucking like like gamers making female characters and playing female characters in games where you can make characters. Why is that so common? The, you, the guys, that's not that happens so so much, right? Guys, he's talking about us. I'm not talking about you. Cause they're gooning at the characters. Yeah, but sometimes it's not like a goon, a go, like you know. A sexualized character, you know? Because they think the characters are hot. They want to look at the characters. Okay. No, there's no beach. You have to pick it's very common. a lot. And here's a good one. Vacant lot number 16. Okay, fine. Where do I pick one out? You can't pick one out. You have no idea what you're doing. Why is he being so shitty to her? Right? Here's his Rolex. Now, how can I edit his account? She's gonna delete Reset his fucking Roblox passwords. account. She's gonna redeem all his V-Bucks. I don't think- DO NOT REDEEM! DO NOT REDEEM! Think so. So, what's this competition for, anyway? Only to decide who's the best Roblox player in the whole school. Oh. But Brock said he's going to the national competition. Well, that's his plan, but he hasn't qualified yet. Is anybody else being slowly driven insane by the fucking like two second music loop of like the do 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 do? The gladiator has arrived. Gladiator? Dude, what's that about? It's a competition to the finish, and I need to feel the part. He looks like an ace attorney character. Oh, I get it. It's kind of like mental motivation. And where is my challenger, Russell? I don't know, man. Maybe he chickened out. Oh, no. I know him. He'll be here. Oh, look. Is it Halloween? Oh, I see you've dressed warmly. Because it's going to be a long, cold winter after you lose. Well, it looks like you're appropriately dressed for Blox Fruit. That's Dude, you know what I think the inspiration for this garbage might be? You know those those cringe Disney Channel fucking like like sitcoms for kids. Yeah, yeah. I just I just figured that out. I just realized that. Like that that shit, that fucking slop. 
Dan Schneider show. Yeah, like Nickelodeon and Disney have those fucking ass fucking like it's like sitcoms for kids. I Carly. What, what what the fuck out there there's another channel that has that garbage, right? Drake and Josh is not S. Guys, I don't know how to I I I hate I hate being the person that has to tell you this. That shit is fucking mega cringe. I'm old enough to tell you. Because I... That shit came after me. Like, I was too old for that when that shit... You know what I mean? When that shit came on the air. I was a lot older. And I saw it and I was like, what the fuck is this? And I was probably in, like, college when that shit came on, dude. It was too late for me to enjoy that. And I fucking... Yeah, I... Okay, I, to be fair... To be fair... To be fair... <laughs> I ne I never watched it. I mean, I saw like you know, I, here and there. I, I would I would see it in my periphery, and I would be like, "That's fucking shit." There was good stuff in there. I mean, Steven Universe has good stuff in in there. You know, it does. Like you know, things that are fucking cringe, can, things that are shit can have like little nuggets of gold inside of it. You know, like. Family Guy, yeah, Family Guy has good stuff. You know? Um, for example... Um, this one, um, uh, Family Guy funny moment that I... I guess I want to show you guys because I thought it was, I thought it was really, really, really funny, guys. Um, it was a really funny uh, Family Guy funny moment. Pizza Tower is its own genre of humor. It 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 is though. It is. D this is edited so fucking well. I kind of can't believe it. Like, look how seamlessly this character is just back here. Like, look look at the look at them. Also, gay. What the fuck is Gay City? What? What is, what is that? Oh, look at the TV. <laughs> That's a de that's dead Brian in the street that he that he's like pointing at. <laughs> Fuck, man! Oh, that's so. Ah, uh, the noise is back here. Look. Lucky there's a guy of some sort. The dr- <laughs> I didn't even notice this! I didn't even notice! It's a glunch! <laughs> it's a glunch! I didn't even notice this, dude. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, holy shit. <laughs> How is this so good? Snotty. <laughs> it, it, it's, it's called the drunken cum. 
the drunken calm. Oh, fuck. This is a virus tailor made to target Mike's humor DNA. Oh man, it, it it is hard to deny that. It's almost like the Rouge the Bat video. Like the like the, the I was just kidding when I when I said I liked piss. This is the YouTube channel, by the way, Conkfis. And then it says, uh Normal words, but an Italian guy. <laughs> uh, that's fucking awesome. Did you see the Ed, Ed, and Eddie one? No. There's more shit like that? There's more pe like pizza tower edits? I I'm trying to figure out how we could do a pizza tower Cleveland show. Right, like the problem is there's no song with lyrics in Pizza Tower. <gasps> the Pizza Face song. With the fucking the the uh when you get what you want, you don't want it. How do we how do we ram the Cleveland show lyrics into that? Watch the newest video on the conf. I I just closed the fucking. Well, hold on a minute. Fucker. Oh. No, I'm not watching that. Okay. There's the unused pizza mayhem, cheese and pepper. Let's make some noise. Like, there's more songs. Oh, it's it's a song that wasn't used in the game. Guys, I can't stop thinking about the Putinesca, uh, Bordello di Putinesca. By the way, that's going to be my, my fucking Pizza Tower stage when, pe when, when Pizza Tower Maker comes out. And you know what I, you know what I was thinking about doing? Going to the guy, was so, the sauce man who fucking made the soundtrack. Well, one of the guys who worked on the soundtrack. And seeing if he wants to make, like, 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 commission him to make a song for my stage. Because I want, like, I, I want the, the, like, the music to be thematically in line with the game itself. You know? For exposure? No, I'm paying him for it. Are you kidding me? No. Wisp posted. Okay, hold on. I want the music for my for the the Putin Bordello di Putinesca to be as good as the fucking rest of the like the actual soundtrack of the game itself. That's what I want. Scrimmies, thanks for 13 months, man. And I want it to be like in there, you know? Like I want it to be... I want it to, to flow with like the game itself. Alright, what do we got? Holy fuck. Uh... See, that, that's... This is just, just a scene from Ed, Ed, and Eddie that had the fuck, yeah. Scrimmies, thanks for 13 months, man. Oh, I just said that. I'm brain dead. Okay. Thank you, though. Thank you. I appreciate it that much. I'm going to read it out twice. Thank you. This is going to probably get me a visual DMCA. The TV is perfect, yeah. Well, it's it's also the kind of uh, like the it's a really similar animation style, so it just works. Did you also see that again? Snotty got fucking like booty blasted, like he did in the other video. 
<laughs> Poor Snotty. Again, I never even fucking seen him. Instead of paying for life-improving spinal surgery, Mike will pay a, commi a commission for whore's pasta music. That's fucking right, I am. Unfortunately, guys, we have to watch the rest of this. But don't worry, there's only fucking 15 minutes left. Right? Because you look like a grape. <laughs> well, you're not going to be laughing so much when we're done. Let's do this. Yeah, I'm tired of listening to your whining. Get it? Because he's a grape. Winding, grape, grapes, wine. Get it? Reset password. <laughs> I don't think so. Ah, here it is. Delete. Now he'll have no choice but to do his homework. Worst mom ever award goes to. Okay, you two know the rules. Whoever survives the longest is the winner. When I s bad mom. They go. You're gonna start, but first, log in. Okay, I'm logging in. What? What's wrong? All right, I'm in. Oh, what? She deleted you... his account, all the fuck, the game that he was making, that he spent months making is deleted. All the Robux, the, the Robux are deleted. Like those are worth real money and they're fucking gone. She deleted them. Forget your password? No, my password is fine. It says my account's deleted. That means he's afraid to take me on. I don't know what happened. Russell, check to see if you have an email. It is a convenient notification thing that's going on here. You owe me 800 Robux, loser. Brock, that's not nice. Hang on, I'm checking into this. So, did you figure it out? Yeah, somebody deleted my account from my home computer. Oh, did you run home because you got scared? The kids keep falling for the use your parents permission meme. Your mom wouldn't do it, would she? Yeah, she did. Okay, Brock, I guess you win. Not fair and square. Well, I don't care how, as long as I win. I've got to straighten this. His name is Brock. Bye bye loser. Russell's- He- he fro- I thought he like froze like that, cause like he had a stroke or something. Roblox account got deleted and he had to forfeit- Guys, this is not the- this is not a freeze frame here. They're- they're just- they just stopped moving. The Brock, will he ever get all of his work back? Home computer. Oh, did you run home because you got scared? Your mom wouldn't do it, would she? Like, dude, watch this. Bye bye loser. Russell's Roblox account got- They just stopped moving. Oh, Ru 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 Russell's Roblox account got delted. And he had to forfeit to Brock. Deleted, and he had to forfeit to Brock. The camera is Will moving, but they're not. Will he ever get all of his work back? Yeah, th this is fucked. Why, why are they doing this? <laughs> Holy shit. Russell, hold up. What? How is school today? I don't want to talk about it. Well, this came in for you today from that Rolodex company. Yeah. I already know what it's about. They deleted my account. Well, you better hope that's all they did. Read it. What? Yeah, she said Rolodex. Oh, it's supposed to be funny. Somebody wiped their ass with this piece of paper. So, what's it say? He licks it. Hey. They're summoning me. I have to go there. They're summoning me? I have to go- No, you don't. Who is summoning? What the fuck are you talking about? It, 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 it's not a court that you have to go where you get fucking held in contempt or some shit. What the fuck you- No. He got on a plane for jury duty? Oh, he's a demon and he has no choice. Wow, I can't believe they're flying me to L.A. Where did he get, like, the fucking, uh, what do you call it? Preppy, like, Spider-Man suit. Hand on a private jet! Spider-Man drip. How did they know my favorite drink? Or Mario drip? Ah, I can get used to this. They put him on a private plane? 
There's a phone? This is pissing me off. Oh? Russell, I'm so glad I could reach you all the way up there. Brittany, it's so nice to hear from you. Sorry, I'm flying right now, so I'm gonna have to miss our tutoring session. Oh, I... They have a, a fucking rotary phone on the fucking private jet, dude? Actually, I wasn't calling about that. This is something personal. Oh my... No, I don't know how to deal with yeast infections. Ask your mother. What the fuck? Um... Someone in chat said, this suit, and then it, it, they're saying it's a pog champ suit. <laughs> it's a pog champ suit. Hey, that suit kind of looks like two echidnas fucking on your chest. <laughs> this is two... He's a, 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 a... Like, it's a pog champ cosplay, basically, right? Fuck. Yeah, why do they have like a 90s rotary phone in the fucking pri in the private jet? My goodness, personal. Something wrong? Oh, no, nothing's wrong. Um, I was just wondering if you were taking your girlfriend to prom. Girlfriend? I don't have a girlfriend. <laughs> I'm a fucking loser who's obsessed with Roblox. Well, that's why I was calling. Brittany, are you calling for the reason I think you're calling? Yes, I am. Will you be my boyfriend? Yeah, that's how that works. Heck yeah. What would Brock and the other... Oh. guys think? I don't care what they think. Heck yeah. I only care what you think, honey. Wow, that's really fucking stupid. This is, this is like revenge porn almost? Yo, are they gonna have sex? Se Yo, segs? Red flag. Oh, she's fucking psychotic. Hi, do you want to be my boyfriend? I go to therapy. What the fuck? Segs. 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 He died, and this is a high before death. It's his, like, pineal gland or whatever the fuck, right? Guys. I, I figured some out. What's her name? Something personal. What's her name? Oh my good. Oh, so I'm sorry. Brittany, it's Brittany? so nice to hear from you. Sorry, I'm flying right now. Brittany is a... Oh, so I'm gonna have to miss our tutoring session. Oh, I... I... Brittany is a, a, a slow living blogger. And what she really needs is a look. And like, honestly, when you when you're when you're like that dependent on like you know a host like you really need a host to survive if you know what i mean you will take any dude that shows the slightest amount of interest in you you know what i mean and just be like do you want to be my luke i need somebody to open gates for me and help me put on and help me tie my shoelaces bro I love white people happy looking at the butterfly. <laughs> Who started that? Who who started? Who started that? Did I say thank you, Dingus? Thank you, Dingus. And uh, Didney, thank you for the resubs, guys. Who started that white people happy looking at the butterfly? <laughs> Every time you bring up the Luke video, we do. I haven't. I haven't noticed it. I haven't noticed this. <laughs> oh, that's so good, Mike. When are you gonna add white people happy? That is white people happy, dude. Oh, he said wider people happy. There's a wider people. Like, how wide do these peepos get, man? I'm starting to worry about these peepos. Too wide? I actually wasn't calling about that. This is something personal. Oh my goodness, personal? Something wrong? Oh no, nothing's wrong. Um, I was just wondering if you were taking your girlfriend to prom? Girlfriend? I don't have a girlfriend. Well, that's why I was calling. 
It's almost over, guys. Brittany, are you calling for the reason I think you're calling? Yes, I am. Will you be my boyfriend? Heck yeah. What would Brock and the other guys think? I like how that's his first fucking concern about this. Care what they think? I only care what you think, honey. Yeah. Honey? The acting in this is like that sexual harassment in the workplace video. <laughs> it is. It, it, it is, though. It is. It, it's, it feels like she is sexually harassing him, though. We're about to land in L.A. I'll call you back. Yo, Daddy Long Dick is about to land in L.A. Okay, call me when you get back. Is that... I thought that was CG. I was like, why did they do that? Why did they recreate Los Angeles in, in CG? I bet he pissed loud as fuck. Oh, definitely. Especially if he's pissing out the plane. Oh, no. Huggy Wuggy is flying the plane. Russell. Okay. We're fully aware of what you've been doing on roll. Chad is insisting that this is not a real shot of, like, Love Los Angeles. They're insisting. It's I'll CG. call you back. How okay. Call let's, me when you get let's, back. Let's look at it again. Guys, why would that, why would that exist? Why, what do you mean that's CJ? It just looks like it for some reason. It's not a real shot. Why are you saying that? It's shitty. It, guys, why? It, it's a real fucking shot. It's stock footage. It's stock footage, guys. The, the shot was taken in a helicopter or something. It is real. Why are you guys... They, they, it briefly did look like CG, though. I, I thought that, too. But it isn't. Russell. A drone. Or, a, yeah, a drone. It was taken with a drone, dude. Fully aware of what you've been doing on Roblox. He's like, oh, man. Well, look, I, I'm sorry. I, uh, you caught me jerking off to all that Ninja Turtle Roblox porn, didn't you? Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. I don't know what to say. Uh, no, we're not talking about the Ninja Turtle Roblox porn. I'm, I'm so sorry. I didn't know you guys could see me jerking off to that. Listen, I can explain. I came up with all of those ideas myself. Are you telling me that you designed those villages, adventures, and challenges all by yourself? Well, yeah. Roblox is the most powerful gaming platform in the world. Well, what's your plan after you finish Quest Forever? Doubt. We're lost. That's just the first. Hashtag advert. Hashtag ad. First one. I have seven more I want to do. You know, just like Harry Potter or Star Wars. And you plan on doing these all by yourself? Yeah, that's why it's going to take a while. No, Russell. I don't think that's going to happen. Really? You're banning me? No, quite the opposite. We want to give you your own development team and welcome you to the Roblox family. The Roblox family, I guess. Me? A part of Roblox Corporation? Just kidding. We're suing the fucking pants off you. That's just part of it. We want to make you vice president of special markets. Vice president. I like the sound of that. Imagine getting summoned to headquarters just to get banned. <laughs> that would be a funny prank, though. And would it be acceptable to... I bet that would get a lot of views on YouTube. Start you at a half a million dollars a year. Half a million dollars? Well, I'm gonna have to think about that. Fine, I'll give you $750,000 a year, but I can't give you a raise, at least for your first 90 days. The $750,000 a year is to develop games, right? It's not to, it's not like his take home salary, right? It's like, it's, that's, that's the fucking, that's, the, that's devel game development money, right? You know what? You got yourself a deal. Brock may have won the Roblox showdown. It's his salary? You know what I would really enjoy about that? I would enjoy not giving my shitty mom a penny of it. And never speaking to her again and fucking... Yeah, I'm, I'm getting off on the revenge porn aspect of this now. 
I'd be like, oh, you wanted to delete my Roblox account? Well, now you're dead to me because I can go buy a house and don't need don't need you for anything anymore. Fuck you. You and you 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 fucking actively tried to sabotage this, so fuck you permanently. That's what Quentin Tarantino did. Based. But it looks like Russell's moved on to bigger and better things. Imagine being Quentin Tarantino's mom and, and like, you know, just having to live with that, right? If you don't know, Quentin Tarantino's mom, like, like, made fun of him for wanting to be a filmmaker and, like, in some, in some ways, like, sabotaged his efforts to get there. Things. Like, they had no respect for it whatsoever. Oh, so that just ends like that, huh? That just fucking ends like, man, that was fucking dog shit. Holy Christ. Oh, uh, all right. Well, that was profoundly fucking stupid on every level imaginable. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Like having my fucking brain melted. That video has 4.7 million views. Oh, by the way, his, that guy's account is still deleted. Okay, listen. I got some very, very sexually charged uh, finger family videos here. Uh, Sonic the Hedgehog finger family, the old school, traditional. I I don't know why I said that. I, I mean, I don't know. They might be sexually charged. I think I just kind of pulled that out of my ass. Um, this is that time of the night where... We are going to grab our bingo cards. Can we get that bingo card pinned mods if possible? Uh, Robot, what's up? Thanks for 44 months, buddy. He says, I'm here for the sex. Okay, well, I don't know what sex is. We have segs, though, if you're interested in segs. We got plenty of that, but no sex here. No way, no segs. You're in the wrong place if you want, if you want sex. But segs, we got that in spades. All right, so grab your, again, you've, I haven't seen any of these. You know the drill, you know the score. This is fresh to my eyes, okay? Although it probably will contain um, familiar things at this point. But uh, I got my bingo card here. Uh, let's take a look at that. Uh, see if we can get a bingo tonight. It's been a long time since I got a bingo, boys. Uh, let's see if we can make this happen here. It says Sonic Soap Opera. Part 1. Let's hold a wedding. <laughs> let's hold a wedding. He's okay. <laughs> so Amy and Shadow and Purple Amy are going to be involved in a three-way, like, what is it, polycule? I see it. I, yeah. Maybe, oh, well, may, well, maybe that's the difference between a wedding and a weddened. How are we pronouncing that, chat? Weddened? Or Weddined. How are we pronouncing that? <laughs> weddined. Oh, it's a Weddined. A Weddined D. Huh. A Weddined D. A Weddined D. A Weddwendwe. 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 Oh yeah, these these gals got fat fucking milkers. What a fucking image this is, huh? I, this really tells you everything you need to know. Buff shadow, fucking Amy and and weird Amy clone with fat fucking honkers, and the word weddined, which is not a word in the English language, just to be clear, uh, to my knowledge. Thunder Engi, thank you so much for the five gift subs, but. <laughs> Thank you. 
They're getting married as friends because of taxation. The taxation penalizes you if you're not married. It's like I pr now pronounce you Chuck and Larry, but you know with Sonic characters. <laughs> the brain rot is already so strong with this one. This is when the doctor walks in and he's got a chart, right? And he looks down at the chart, and you know he fucking see and he see and he sees this. And he's like, he looks at you. He's like, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, this is never easy, but it's terminal. The brain rot is terminal. We have the scans. The scans are, are, um, in, uh, you know, infallible. We, we, we definitely know what we're looking at. It's terminal. It's terminal brain rot. Terminal seven brain rot. You have months to live. It's over. Please, please make good use of your remaining time. Perhaps the neck thing is the brain rot spreading to the neck and causing neck rot. Maybe we've gone, we flew too close to the sun here, Joaco. I'm, I'm so sorry. It's terminal brain rot. Weddined. <laughs> and she says, let's hold the wedding, right? That's something that, yeah, you just casually decide to hold the wedding. And by the way, who the fuck is this? I'm gonna call her lame me. Lame me. Oh, uh, joaco has got a good idea. Lean me. <laughs> That's Yannick the Vaghog. Shame me. <laughs> Shame me. It's an arranged marriage. I see. I think. Oh, because Amy does not look excited about the holding of the wedding, right? <laughs> Why did Shadow just fart out of his armpit, dude? <laughs> Why is there a fart coming out of his fucking armpit, bro? Well, it's not like, you know... You need two, you need your hand under there to do that. Hey, Samantha, they said, they said, play the video already. Holy fuck. First time, Samantha. First, first time. You knew? Okay. Uh, huh? Yeah, she doesn't like him. It is an arranged marriage. Don't forget, a lot of these videos are from the Southeast Asia, where that's very common. Look at the, <laughs> look at the old Shadow. Oh, <gasps> uh, it's just, dude, that's Shadow. After we, he's at Costco, and he had one of the fucking, you know, the spinach, the spinach quiches, you know, the one where I like the ones where I like fucked your mom on top of them. He had one, and it was good, and he wanted another one. So he put on, like, some fake Colonel Sanders facial hair and went back to get a second free sample. <laughs> huh? He does have fat tits. <laughs> we don't like that. We're going to lock you, you in the closet. To marry him. Wedined! Wedined! <laughs> My love is Sonic. She loves Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> it's less funny when you realize that shit like this probably does happen to people. But Sonic is repugnant. Look at John McClamey over here. She fucking flew the coop, bro. She sprung. <laughs> She's wiped some dried cum off her skirt. One hour later. An hour later. Sonic, where are you? <laughs> Yo, why are they all missing teeth like they're meth addicts? You notice every single one of them has had, has had missing teeth? <laughs> <laughs> this is my dad. <laughs> He's the fucking werewolf. Please come inside with us. 
you know, I never want to see a furry like Sonic OC like that saying, please come inside ever again. <laughs> <laughs> this is my dad. My dad. Sonic's dad got fat milkies, fatter than Crenando's. Where did she go? So these are Amy's parents I'm putting together. <laughs> And yeah, you saw them like looking at the, the chests of, of, of treasure. That's like the dowry for, you know. Wait, no, because the dowry is what the parents of the, the parents of the bride have to pay the parents of the groom, the dowry to like take their daughter. Right, that's how that system works. So why would Amy's parents have the dowry? He does have fat tits. Oh. Milky werewolf tits, bro. I will marry Amy. <laughs> huh? Amy at Sonic's house. Well, who called her? Why is Sonic's father a werehog? Because you touch yourself at night. No! 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 Stay away from my daughter! Hmm. He's going werewolf mode, dude. <laughs> Gotta go fast! This is a flashback. <laughs> oh. My family. <laughs> Wait, what? So... Rich kid. Okay, this is just the this this is going off the fucking. I can't fucking follow this anymore. I can't follow this anymore. What the fuck happened? What is Knuckles doing here? Why does Knuckles' head look like that? Why does Knuckles have a fucking eight head? And why does he have like like four times the number of tentacles he normally does? Why did they fucking inflate his skull with a bike pump, bro? Is this some kind of fetish shit? Doom Master, thanks for 11 months. He looks like fucking Kit Fisto. <laughs> Kit Fisto! Oh, I can't believe Kit Fisto is real and not a fucking, like, like, that, dude, that's the name of a character in, like, a Star Wars porn parody, bro. That's not a real character. Like, that's, but, but then you remember, like, oh, yeah, it's George Lucas and he's a fucking idiot. Right? <laughs> oh. My he says, my family. So... I think the implication of this is at some point the purple Amy was fucking the 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 werehog and she left him at one point but before they they split up uh they had kids it's Sonic and Amy their siblings and then they separated and each of them kept a child but this woman didn't know that. So so okay. So, but they, but they've been fucking. I'm high, guys. You got to give me a second. All right, <clears throat> guys. I'm high on fucking like muscle relaxers and fucking steroids, dude. Wow, the best part of waking up, huh? Damn. Mike, you watch Game of Thrones. This should be easy. Well, I read the books, so I was. Just, it, I was like primed to understand it, you know. Vade Apocalypse is only one away from bingo. Emily! <laughs> rich Kid. It's the purple Amy. It says Rich Kid. There's, there's two knuckles now. <gasps> Yeah. 
they like literally ripped them apart from each other and what what happened knuckles underwent mitosis <laughs> So that means that he forgot that Amy was his daughter? Like he saw Amy and he never said like, wow, I had a baby once that was a pink hedgehog. Wasted chat? Oh, the, the sound, it, that's the sound effect, right? <laughs> Dementia moment? Oh, yeah. They are my kids. <laughs> Just in case, you know, you were high on, on painkillers and couldn't follow that. <laughs> <laughs> Who's got a lopsided titty? Oh, Amy? Oh, yeah, her tits are fucking mangled, dude. <laughs> Yo, her tits look like somebody nailed some fried eggs to her chest. What the fuck? <laughs> mom 2, I got bingo. There's no mom 2 here. I swung! We are sibling. We are sibling. <laughs> sibling. <laughs> the best part of waking up is hedgehog come in your cup. No, it's not true. I don't know, man. I, I, you know, dude, fucking. All right. Can I say something fucked up? Okay, this is. The, I'm, I'm, try, I'm trying to... Fuck, ouch. I'm trying to think of how to say this without sounding like... I... I... I like a weirdo, okay? If, if you... I'm not going to say incest is good. Shut the fuck up and listen. If you are... Like, let's say you're dating somebody for fucking years, Okay? And then you find out that it's your long, your your estranged sibling, and it's it, and like the relationship is perfect. It, it does did you end that? That has happened, and then like what happens? This is a community. Oh, how often does this happen? Like, what are you going to do? You're going to be like, oh, well, now I don't, I, our whole relationship was a lie and I don't love you anymore. And now, like, our, our the last five years together are fucking meaningless because, I mean, that, that's fucking awful, but how often? I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm wondering, I'm thinking about it realistically. Like, if you're in that situation... What do you do? You know, what the fuck do you do in that in that situation? You know, especially if like I'm not I'm not saying incest is good, you assholes. Can you fucking listen to what I'm saying, please? I don't believe this happens that often. Erase those years <laughs> from your life. That's not a thing that that's not real, bro. Mike is projecting. Yeah, what are you what are you saying this happens to me? I don't know. Like I, I that that's genuinely fucking. That's genuinely fucked. What do you do? I would. Mike, you erased years from your life. You know it's possible. You think that? So you think you think that happened to me, and I subsequently forgot. That happened in Game of Thrones. If you're referring to Cersei and, and Jaime Lannister, they they knew they were twins and they always knew they were siblings. That wasn't a surprise to, to either of them. They weren't like separated at birth or something. They were they were just fucked up. Yeah. Different characters. Oh right, yeah. I forgot the other angle. Yeah, I forgot. That did happen, but like they didn't care. I don't think they cared. Game of Thrones, but they, they don't know they're twins. I, I just, I don't know. I don't know what the fuck goes on in this. 
situation. Yeah, and then if you have kids together, it's like, oh. You know? This happened in JoJo Part 6. I just watched Part 6. When the fuck did this happen? Part 6 is Stone Ocean, no? Wait, when did that happen in Stone Ocean? Weather report. Oh, yeah. Don't you spoil that? Well, chat spoiled it. So what the fuck do you want? It, that, what, no, that's not, really, that's not really what happened, though. That's not really what happened. You remember how all that fucking like like dense plot was crammed into like one episode and it was like a whirlwind of bullshit that just fucking leaves you feeling like you got hit in the back of the head with the baseball bat. Remember that? I forgot so you re-spoiled me. And remember that misery porn like flashback subplot that that was fucking like, like, dude, meme of Walter White with the test co tubes cooking meth and, and the fucking font is Araki making the most fucking convoluted misery porn backstory imaginable in the history of fiction for this fucking character. Right? Like, like, holy fuck. By the way. Today, I finally finished the Sky P arc. <laughs> it took like four months. I just finished the Sky P arc today. How long have you heard me talking about that? Right, Ludo City, and then and then it was fucking irrelevant because none of it none none of it ended up mattering. <sighs> it was really stupid. All right, I'm gonna fucking play this. Got our own. We got our own misery porn here. It's called our lives. I love you. <laughs> our lives have enough misery, as you can see. <laughs> My Amy. My Amy. My Amy. My Amy. <laughs> oh, it's part two. All right, all right. So listen, part one and part two will be considered uh different. What happened to my bingo card? Will be considered different bingo cards, guys? So, yes. Uh, we have... Okay, I mean, like... We didn't have human OCs. In fact, humanized or hogified OCs, I feel like we've only, we've only seen that, like, once. Uh... Fetish incest? No, be I'm, I'm going to tell you why. Because it's not being presented as, as a fetish, is it? It's not being... But in this story, it isn't be being presented as a fetish. It's being presented in like a tragic Oedipus type fucking scenario. It's not like, oh yeah, incest, that's hot. You know, it's not what's going on here, man. So, wow... Jerking off? No. Alcoholism, vehicle, no, no. Was there backwards text? Uh, child abuse, no, no, no. I didn't see it. Um, for, I, I didn't get this, guys. But I am going to refresh this. I'm so sad. <laughs> huh? Okay, he just jerked off his ear. All right, so let, let's let's start right there. Do you have jerk off motion? Guys, I didn't get it this time. If you got jerk off motion, you can check that off. I, that was quick, but look at it. I'm so sad. <laughs> huh? I'm so sad. You can't just have the characters say how they feel. That makes me angry. <laughs> what, is, what is that, that? What are you quoting? What are you quoting? That is familiar. I'm sorry. That's Futurama? Yeah. Sonic. <laughs> Gee, such a genius fucking show. 
That was such a fucking brilliant, brilliant show. If you haven't seen that, what the fuck are you doing? Servants, bring treasure for me. <laughs> These fucking... <laughs> These knuckles minions, bro. Look at this. Look, look, look at these, look at these fucking, oh, these beautiful little knuckle, knuckles clones. They're like his Oompa Loompas, bro. <laughs> Servants. <laughs> Servants, bring treasure for me. And they have one name combined, and it's Cervix. Maybe one is named Sir and one is named Vix. Now the enchilada has two nipples. These are P P Ken Pender's characters. Cervix the, the echidna. Oh, I'm going to tell you what's going on here. Okay. Cervix the echidnas. This is like Steven Universe. And those two weird shaped knuckles, they, they fucking have lesbian sex and merge into the regular Knuckles with the fucking cowboy hat and shit. And he's stronger than you. Right? That's what that's what this is, bro. Sir and Vix. Yeah. You like that? Fucking the rubies, yeah. Sir Vix and the enchilada. Fist and cervix. Yeah. <laughs> hey kids, I'm cervix the servant. Yeah, cool. Oh man. Manslave. Bring me the the gold. Manslaves. He's got manslaves. They're misshapen because they're clones. Yeah. Yeah. They're so bad. Why why do they exist? <laughs> Fucking Christ. Okay. Do you marry me? Do you marry me? That is bizarre. Huh? I can't stand this. Hi. <laughs> Hi. She farted. I can't marry you. Wait, you had the option to say no the whole time. Why didn't you just do that in the first place? <laughs> yeah, they have deflated balloon tits. <laughs> which is all the more... um. Confusing when you realize that these are porn models. Like, these are porno models. What they should have like 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 competent breasts. Your goat is boy. Your what? Your goat is boy. Your goat is boy. Your girl is boy. What? Your girl is is spoiled. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't. I don't. Yeah, I don't think it's a. I don't think it's a trans pride situation, guys. I, I think. I think there's just saying he's saying spoiled. Boy. He's pronouncing it spoiled. Your girl is spoiled. Girl is spo spoiled. Boring. <laughs> He's fucking hyperventilating like the uh like Zelda's voice actress. Love you. <laughs> Who the fuck is this now? Rouge is invited. Who the fuck is that? I Who the fuck is that? What the there's another Knuckles? Love you. <laughs> and he's what whose body is that? Bro, is that like Mighty the Armadillo or some shit? Mm. We have so many beautiful times. We have so many beautiful times. But we're siblings. I was kind of hoping for a Naruto moment here. 
I love how Sonic's skull was made out of jelly. But we're Cyblings. Cyblings. Aren't those the bad guys from Battlestar Galactica? Sonic, where have you been? Cyblings. Dolor sit a met. Is that Lorem Ipsum? Sonic! Where yeah. Where have you been? It is. <laughs> Be careful! Get a load of this! <laughs> Oh no! Fuck yes. Bro, she got hit by a car and there's like fucking jelly beans on her arm. What the fuck is that? Flatline, bro. If we get a fucking if we get a flatline here, dude, that would be extremely epic. My baby! <laughs> this all my fault. <laughs> See, they were gonna fuck anyway. They were gonna be like, we don't care if we're siblings. Let's, we, we, we love each other. It's too, it's too late. We, we're, we, it's too late. We're in too deep. We, what are you gonna do? It, it, it's, it, it, that fucking sucks. But it's too late now. <laughs> too late. <laughs> Guys, do you hear the the fucking music? Is phenomenal. <laughs> It, the, the music is fucking inspirational, dude. L listen. It's all my fault. <laughs> That's fucking powerful, bro. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Maybe we got it! If, if she lives, that counts. If she lives, that counts. I don't give a fuck. Okay? With that doesn't matter if she dies. I'm worried. Yo, this fucking rules. It's very easy to get a bingo here. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna lose. <laughs> Who's this bitch? Dude, fuck Fem Sonic. There's like another hog. There's a new hog. <laughs> she has Amy's ears though. Huh? The See patient that? is fine. <laughs> Thank you, doctor. <laughs> Thank you, doctor. Can you fix our teeth real quick? <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh, that, looks. That's the fucking. The, that's the JoJo. The Joe Star fucking birthmark. Hunter looks just like me. <laughs> uh, what a coincidence. Okay, so this is a flashback, I think. Uh, okay, so for some reason Robotnik swapped them as babies and Amy- This is fucking intense. Amy is not his sister. Mm. And by the way, why would Robotnik do this? He's like, Get a load of this! And then he swaps your babies while you're not watching. Okay. Like, while you're not even looking. Like, 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 how, like, what does that achieve? This is top tier finger family. D this again, they're deliberately trying to make it like a soap opera, apparently. But like, this is a top ten finger family right here. Ab absolutely, D this this one this one will be memorable. Yeah, definitely. And by the way, yeah, what's up with the pubes, man? Like I always see that in old footage, you know. And I have to assume that back in the day. These people had extremely poor pubic hygiene. Like, they were all constantly, like, balding at the penis. And their pubes just got everywhere. Constantly. 
and got in their fucking like you know their video cameras and shit. Why did they? Why were these people shedding pubes like fucking like like their cats? Like what's that about? They were rubbing their balls on the camera. I mean, guys, my pubes never come out. Like I don't my my I don't shed pubes. I smeared my penis on every frame of this film. Guys, I'm gonna tell you, I never just find a pube like in my underwear or something. That never no, I'm not kidding. I'm, I'm, I'm being dead serious. I never just find the pube. I'm not a, I'm not fucking lying, guys. It doesn't happen. Show us your pubes. That's not gonna even if I could do that, that's not that's not gonna fucking prove anything, you freaks. Penis being bald is real. Guys, my penis is bald, but I think that's normal. Guy, are you guys telling me it's not normal to have a bald penis? Like you guys have hair like all the way up to the tip of your cock? Like the head of your penis has has hair growing out of it. Yeah. The hole too. It is uh, okay. The hole too. All right. All right. All right. Best. Best. I never just find pubes, guys. It doesn't happen. I have to go in there and manscape to like keep that under control. I don't I don't I don't just shed pubes. It's not an ad. You know that that word existed before that company did. Okay, and shout out to Giga. I of course by manscape, I mean I have I have uh, I have pube scissors. Guys, this is not a joke. I'm not I'm not even this is not like a ha poop spoon type meme. I have specific scissors that I only use to cut my pubes. And, and I I fucking like I'll I'll grab a handful and I'll just like pull them and then I'll just go and snip. And then it looks like a barber shop on the floor of the bathroom. And you don't drop one? Well, you got to you you got you got to sweep up after. And then I, you know, I washed the, the, the pube scissors, right? Clippers exist. Cool, I don't have them. I have, I have pube scissors. Some people's pubes do, don't stop growing at a length. Well, the, the length that they stop growing at is more pubes than you want. Elizarin, does that make sense? But it's not like if I didn't, <clears throat> it's not like if I didn't do it, it, it wouldn't, it wouldn't be like, you know, um, that Indian guy who never cuts his fucking, his, his, his fingernails. Right. Hey Dean, I keep thinking there's a hair, a hair on my screen. How many people are like pawing at their monitor right now trying to get that giant pube off of it? <laughs> Uh, dude, you just, uh, you know what? You just gave me an amazing fucking idea, bro. Hold on. All right. Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, you fucking, you fucking cocksucker. You fucking, you fucking cocksucker. You, you really got to be like that? <sighs> I fucking hate you, Google. You know what I'm trying to do, right, chat?
fucking son of a bitch. It want it want it, okay. It want it wants to be like that. It wants to be like that. Okay, dude. I have to edit this now. Why? Why are you making me do? Why are you making me do this? My fucking joke is like dying on the floor now because of this shit. All right, fuck it. My my joke. Yeah, joke doing a lot of heavy lifting there, huh? Okay. All right, now nobody fucking say anything, okay? To any, if anybody asks, just act like they're fucking stupid, okay? Gotta be smaller, okay, all right, all right. How's that? Tiny? Did you do it? This is a fucking this. This is next level gaslighting, dude. How's that look? I I actually can't see. How's that look? <laughs> dude dude we should do this every night okay fucking nobody say <clears throat> stop now now we have to stop talking about it Okay, we have to stop talking about it now. No more, ignore it now. All right. I will switch the babies. <laughs> Why? 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 <laughs> 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 Why did he do that? <clears throat> what did he gain from doing that, though? What was his motive to do that? The, the satisfaction of being a sick fuck? Mike, he was being a trickster for his TikTok account. Oh, of course. Of course, very funny. <clears throat> he did it because he wanted the incest to happen. <clears throat> She's my daughter. Mm. <laughs> it's fucking... This is bad. Prue Amy. Prue Amy. What's Prue Amy? Prue Amy. Poor Amy. Pru Pru Amy. Pru Amy. Video is very loud. Pu Amy. Oh. You can be with her now. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> he needed her her their mom's permission. She doesn't remember. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Brain blast. That is a Naruto moment, by the way. Amy? Amy? Stay away. You know what, dude? It's, it's just every fucking, like, uh, soap opera trope crammed into one uh, plot. Right? Yeah, that's, that's, that's all. Yeah, that's that's why they were calling it like a, a telenovela. Who are you? I'm your boyfriend. No, I don't know. Who we, you briefly thought was your brother, but turned out to not be your your brother. You. Hmm. She lost her memories. <laughs> no. The young and the restless. 
Sonic Edition. We're going to call our version The Fecal and The Funny. In honor of Sonic Meal. Right? That's how it ends, yeah. That's how it ends. Queer Duck animations. Yo, Queer Duck has a portal gun for some reason. Look. Is that not the portal gun, dude? Why does he have that? Yeah, what the fuck? He's got a, a Minecraft diamond sword. And what is that hammer? It's not Amy's hammer, is it? TH8827 is in the chat. This is uh, one of my uh, 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 Finger Family archival project uh, contributors. And they are saying that they have not been able to find part three. They've look, they looked extensively for part three and could not find it. Maybe it doesn't exist yet. Maybe they're still animating it, dude. Maybe it's better that way. I think I speak for all of us when I say it's definitely not better that way. Right. Hey, Sazabi said, Mike, I can't hear the video over me ravenously fucking Punstar's mom. Could you crank up the volume just like his dad cranks off as he watches? I got to tell you something. All right. First order of business. That is very funny. All right, let's just get that out of the way right off the bat. Second order of business. You can't be doing that, all right? You, 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 can't, you can't be... This can't devolve into you guys making your mom jokes about each other, okay? Because that, that that's too far. No, don't do that, okay? That's the line... That's where the line has to get drawn. You enable it. No, no, here, no, here's... Here's the established fucking norm, okay? I I make the jokes about your mom, you make the jokes about my mom. It's 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 chat's mom, it's chat's mom, sometimes an individual if they get my attention, and it's my mom. That's that's the jokes. That's not it's not chat making mo your mom jokes at each other, okay? Because that's going to get fucking... That might get bad, okay? All right? But it was funny. Just don't do it. Uh, Smiley Word, thanks for uh, 26 months, and uh, thanks for being here. Uh, I mean, was Sonic buff? Uh, no. I, that, that's it. Elder Butte? No. No, no Elder Butte. Love wins? Ca ca I, no, it didn't. It didn't win. Love did not win. Ultimately, she had amnesia. Absurdist storyline? Compared to some of the other ones, this one made sense. Like this one was was relatively easy to follow. I would I don't even want to say that was absurd a storyline. That was just like a storyline, right? Like I always get fucked on when these get generated. Like like where is ve vehicular mayhem? Where is vehicular manslaughter? Where's the the other shit that happened? Where's the fucking Where's flatline? Why didn't I get flatline? Please tell me some of you got flatline, please. <clears throat> Majima, thanks for 27 months. The Eggman swiping was absurd. The Eggman swiping was absurd. <clears throat> but I don't I still don't know. I mean, why did he do it, right? You know what? Yeah. I'll, I'll give it to myself. Bad voice acting. But look, they're all scattered. I got no cross-dressing. Wow. I don't I didn't hear a wow in there. I did hear 
And it was in the first video too. Um, snake exclamation point. Right. <clears throat> Laughing baby. Maybe maybe we should take some of these out, uh, Elizarin. If you're here, like maybe we should we should take some of these out to just make it like more likely that we get bingos. Um. Okay, so TH88 is letting me know that the channel that these originally came from was nuked. YouTube nuked it, and. They re-uploaded their videos, but they only re-uploaded part one and two to their ban evasion channel. They have moved on to Choo Choo Charles, so I don't think that part three is in the works. Well, wait until well, we at least have to wait until some the 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 the, the third Sonic the Hedgehog movie now, right? Part three got them banned. That means we got to see it, dude. Maybe. Well, maybe they already made part three. Maybe we should tap the glass a little bit and just go comment and ask for part three on, on part two. Like maybe they got it sitting on a hard drive and all they got to do is upload it. Maybe they like forgot. The, maybe it exists, but they forgot to upload it. Maybe. You know. It's maybe it's sitting in their like export folder. Why would they not upload it? Well, maybe because it got because it got them banned. What's a wombo combo, Peach T? Um, I, I think it was just violence. Like it was just basically when cat when the characters were punching each other. What what, what 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 was? Yeah, yeah, it was like a fist fight. Yeah, if I remember correctly. He's zonked. Um, I'm a little zonked, guys. I'm a little zonked. So it, it's lost media. We're never going to see part three. That's so sad. Mike, any more tapping and we'll break the aquarium glass and it'll be almost as wet as when your mom met me. Pawnstar likes the, uh, he says, the Ducky Games mascot looks kind of cool is there any art online of him getting railed this video it looks like it's actually a spongebob video so but we, we, we will treat it like a sonic video okay we will do a bingo for it who gives a shit of course, Punstar is a fantastic artist and can animate the character getting fucked themselves. They don't actually want an image of this character getting fucked. They just want to be a meme lord about it, which I respect. Um. Yeah, they, they don't actually want it. You know, I... I Do you actually want it? What if someone commissions Punstar to do it? Yeah, I mean, like, he can make his own porn, like, all day long. And just jack off to your own porn. Guys, I'm tapping the glass. Listen. TH88 says they have been tempted to tap the glass just to ask for part three because of how good these episodes were. But our official policy is not to tap the glass. I mean, I'm not going to try to tell you guys to do something that you don't want to do. But is it that bad to tap the glass once in a while? I don't think I don't think it I don't think it. You know, I think in situations like this, because let me ask you a question. What what happens? What's the worst that happens on wait, if we tap the glass a little bit here? What's the absolutely the absolute worst that happens?
They find us and kill us? No, we're not talking about harassing them. I'm talking about literally just, just going to the YouTube channel and making a comment about part three. Be like, where's part three? Can we see part three, please? That's it. If they become aware of us, they can change how they operate. <laughs> Do you think these people are capable of change? They'll get worse. This isn't the prime directive. Maybe, okay, well, Protector Jam says that they're not going to comment on the videos, but maybe I, they said, they said I should just do it. He said I should just go do it. If they become aware of us, they are not aware of us, Gutsy Crow. You know, briefly, briefly, for a split second, I thought they were when that, when we, when we watched that one video that one of you made with, with, with head septic in it and he was crying about dead shadow the hedgehog so he wiped his tears with his own toilet paper <laughs> his toilet paper that, the how was that so fucking good man They will learn that we like the unhinged stuff, so they make their videos worse and more traumatizing for kids. I could... I, I Okay, I could see that happening, TH88, if I was, like, a really large creator. But frankly, I... I they, they, the amount of, like, views I'm getting on YouTube especially is like wouldn't be able to justify an overhaul in fucking like business strategy dude like maybe if I was like Mr. Beast or some shit you know what I mean and I was getting like millions of fucking views every time I put one of those like finger family VODs up then maybe they would be able to justify that and be like, be like, oh, we should lean into this. It's getting us, it's getting us exposure, you know? You're Mr. Beast to me. Aw, I appreciate it. That's so sweet. Guys, thank you. You'll always be our Mr. Beast. You guys are so good. Thank you all for being here tonight, by the way. And watching and 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 supporting my bullshit, guys. Thank you so much for all the subs and the resubs and, and all that. You guys are beautiful. And there was like, there were two, at least two scam trains, guys. Thank you. Um. And yeah, let's just do this now. No, I'm not ending the stream. Roll a point. Thanks for 17 months. No, I'm not ending the stream. But I just want to say, if you are new here, I'm going to post some links in the chat. Okay, just check them out. Especially if you're new here. Why am I like repeating myself? He's, I'm getting loopy, dude. I'm getting loopy off this poopy. That's my Twitter account. That's my TikTok account. That's my the YouTube channels that we were just talking about. Um, there's my uh, coffee and the Patreon if you want to support this channel financially that way. Um, and there's also a Discord server which you should get your your booty hole into because it is cool and also you will get consistent stream notifications every night when i go live <clears throat> do you have a twitch i do have a twitch slushy um and consider uh consider following that twitch i'm getting really close to 50k followers which is uh which is just crazy really big um milestone for me you know so that's awesome um soy pog uh alizarin okay so alizarin's got <clears throat> an idea they're gonna remove hogified oh yeah the humanized thing only happened once 
Canceds. Uh, I feel like you could keep Canceds. Because how many of these videos open with like somebody's mom has cancer? Right? It's just a cough and blood. That's what Canceds is. Coughing blood up and shit. Uh, piss? Yeah, I feel like there's not a lot of piss. Mermaids? It's, it's still very common, but... Maybe remove that one. Uh, cross-dressing? Cr yeah, cross-dressing only happened once. Actually. Or twice. And condensing wow and exclamation point to one square. Yeah, you know what? Good idea. Good idea. Those are all good ideas. 50,000 lives rooms. 50,000 future U.S. Senators. Mermaids crosses genres. It doesn't matter what series it is. You know what would be extra stupid is if they made like SpongeBob mermaids because they're already aquatic creatures. Hey, Lukewarm, what are you planning on doing for 50,000 followers? When I hit 50,000 followers, I'm going to teabag your mom's forehead. Okay. Cock reveal. You guys want another cock reveal? Seriously? You already seen my cock, guys. You know, you know that that that, that mystery is over. That ship has sailed. Another? Yeah, you weren't here for my cock reveal? Who missed my cock reveal? Oh my god, a lot of you guys missed my cock reveal. Well, there's no record of it anywhere. I was just one day I just whipped my penis out. So if you weren't here, you, you're beat. I mean, sorry. I might do, I mean, I, I think, you know, I think I will do another cock reveal soon. But like, you gotta be here. Cause I, you know, that guy gotta delete that VOD afterwards. You got, so like, make sure you're here all the time if you wanna see my penis, okay? Because I could just decide to do it at any moment. And if you're not here, you're not seeing it. Promise? Yeah, I, I promise. I promise that there is a non zero chance that my penis ends up in that webcam at any given moment. Okay. Hot dog in daddy. Thank you for the bits. Please schedule cock reveal one week in advance. Absolutely not. I will not tell you. I will never tell you the time and date of the cock reveal, guys. Because then you guys can prepare for it, take screenshots. <laughs> guys, you didn't miss much. Don't worry, guys. It wasn't that impressive. I saw it kind of disappointing, TBH. All right, I'm going to... You know what? I'm gonna be, like, like, all right, jokes aside, my penis is is bad like it's just bullshit honestly i th i think it's a bullshit dick i do think so it's it, it it's like it... i don't know it's just stupid it's just a stupid dick so this, this doesn't really have anything like special going on you know it's like it's like slightly below average size you know it's like did you name it yeah his name is nebuchadnezzar it's, it's, it's extremely, it's, okay. It's like a notch below mid, like aggr aggressively. It's, it's an aggressively mid penis. It's a comedy penis. It, it's, it's not funny though. It's just, it's just kind of depressing. Uh, Velvet Nimbus. Thanks for uh, a full year, man. They said, my mom agrees with everything you're saying. Based, based mom. Mike, this is because you don't listen to enough affirmations. And plus, it's circumcised. You know that. It's just like, it's like, what's the, it's like, fuck this thing. You know, it's, like, it's just, it's just stupid. It's just a stupid penis. It's like. Four inches is way below average. It's like six. It's like, it's like six. It's like barely six. It's like, okay. It's 
like it's not no it's it, it's not it's not big vod watchers skip six hours <laughs> Five point five is average. Oh, I thought six was average. No, it's 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 the it's the it's like at the average. It's like five point. It's probably like five point four, or something. I haven't actually measured it in a very long time, but I remember, I remember like looking it up against the average and be and being like, wow. So I'm I'm I don't make the average. I'm like just below the just below the average. It, it it's it's not really girthy. It's it's not long. It's 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 not like thin, but it's like it's just bullshit. It's just a bullshit dick, you know. But I don't think. But but here here's the thing though. Here's the thing. It's not like you guys. It, it's not like you would be excited to see. Like a big, impressive, cool dick. You know what I'm saying? You are wanting to just, you're wanting to see my dick. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what you're, like, it, like that's, that's what's pogged, that it's mine. You know? So, I mean, like, is it really ever going to be disappointing if it's attached to me? No, fuck you. Right? There's your confidence. Somebody said that my my lack of confidence is making them soft. No, it's just it's 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 a different kind of confidence. Like, like I'm not gonna pretend my penis is awesome when it's not. You know? But maybe that's not what matters, you, you know. Listen, here's what matters. Every time I fuck your mom, she comes. Okay? And those are the facts. So, I mean, like, it's small, but it's fierce. You know? Also, this is fun. Um, the the anti-big dick movement is, is growing, right? Like, this is re regularly now, I, I'll see, like, social media posts about, like, I don't, I don't like big penises. Ironic, yeah. I don't like big penises. You know? People will come out and say it. They don't like them. They hurt. They don't feel good. They, they suck. Big dick is not back in town. Mike, you will tell us about your penis to the point where we don't need a picture, but you would never tell us if you were married. That's just the way I roll. If I'm fucking married to somebody, then that now involves another person. I'm not fucking, I'm, I'm not dragging another person into this bullshit. But if I want to sit here and talk about my penis, that doesn't involve anybody but me. And I guess the people listening to it, but shut the fuck up. You know? Dudes like it more than women do. Even straight men, ironically. It's it's like I think straight guys want to watch porn with 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 big dicks. That's true. And they 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 want yeah, they want to see like big dicks like, you know, demolishing a vagina. And then the thing with the gay men is they just want to have their, their assholes destroyed, like beyond recognition. That's why they use phraseology like, like, wreck my guts. Right? They say wreck my guts. And, and they, like, what, what, what is it? Destroy. Rearrange my guts. Rearrange my guts. Do you want to like? Do you want this to end in a hospital visit?
Like, what's going on? Like, like, look at... My partner says that. Yeah, that's disgusting. Tell them to stop. Put my intestines 40 degrees westward. Thank you. No, man. This is your fucking... These are delicate organs, bro. This isn't feng shui going on inside your body. You're going to fucking perforate your fucking intestines and you're going to ship blood. But that's what you want, apparently. That's apparently what you want. You're talking about it like it's rearranging furniture. You're talking about it like it's interior decorating. Well, it kind of is interior decorating if you count the cum. You know, but stop using the word, the word guts. Like, what are you, a fucking zombie? Stop. Morty Yorkis, thanks for two months. I appreciate that, man. And also, not a clever name with 27 months. Thank you. Morty Yorkis says, I subbed to you for the first time tonight, but Twitch ignored it. Now says I've already been subbed for a month. Freak! Well, let's freak him up. Don't know what the fuck is going on there, but I do appreciate it, buddy. Um... Remember that the one guy, one jar dude went to work an hour after his incident. Yeah, then there's like the 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 infamous internet gapers. The gaper capers. Like you got Goatsy and that guy, and you got like 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 why are you guys doing that? Like is that even is that even sexual at that point? Or are you just engaged in like a gape Olympics of sort? Like like is it just bragging rights? I I like after a certain okay, listen. After a certain amount of time, after a certain amount of gape, okay, after a certain amount, that is not going to feel good, dude, okay? That is, like, like, Goatsy is not, is not fucking, like, feeling, Goatsy is in some serious fucking pain, dude, okay? And, I mean, he did it for clout, He straight up did, like, that's not, that's not sex, that's not about sexual pleasure anymore. It's about internet points. Okay, that's about clout, that's about bragging rights. That's, it's just about, like, at that point, it's like a sport, you know? It's, like, like what the fuck are you doing? What, what, what is that? It's to impress people? Goatsy is very likely dead. I mean, he's probably been dead for a long time, man, you know? Probably had anal bleeding. Wow. He was soft in the picture. He was soft. Guys. It's about drive. It's about power. <laughs> Go Someone said Goatsy isn't even that big of a gape. You guys are fucked, man. It's about sending a message. <laughs> That's fucking stupid. That's stupid. That's just fucking stupid. Describe how big his hole is. I I don't know. I haven't looked at it in a long time, and I don't I don't. I don't want to either. I'm seeing bigger gapes right now. Guys, stop looking at gapes, please. Why are you guys looking at gapes? Guys, please stop looking at gapes, guys. Okay, we're instead of gapes, we're going to watch this... This video here, again, it's a Spang a Spangbab video. From Ducky Games Animation, which you're not making games, guys. Why are you calling it that? They got an irritating little theme song. <laughs> Holy fuck, is that SpongeBob's mom? <laughs> guys, she died. <laughs> Man, that went from zero to 60. So, this character, canon? Did they make, did they make this character up? 
She's been in the show. The parents are in the show. They okay, and they're not square. <laughs> What if it just ended there? What if, what if that just ended there? Hey! Huh? <laughs> Ow! Uh. Dude, that ice cream looks fire. Uh. Okay. Aha! Uh -uh. uh -huh. No! Ugh. Ah! No! Hey! Ah. He's walking around with like. A loose burger and chicken wing in his pockets? Hello there. Yes. Oh, SpongeBob sucks. <laughs> Hey. Oh, they're gonna fuck mom too. If anybody's got mom too, might as well click it now. Oh. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Mom mm. too. You got mom too. <laughs> Did I get mom too? Nope. Go. Oh, yeah. Oh, we need a Naruto moment. Bad voice acting. Uh, An unhinged rage. I don't think. Oh, you know what? SpongeBob had unhinged rage. <clears throat> yes. Yes, he did. Did we have any voice acting at all? Because, I mean, any any voice acting is going to be ba bad voice acting, guys. Okay. Bye! I don't consider th that to be voice acting. Those are just, like, like little voice clips, like, sound clips that, they that they're using. <laughs> Huh? <laughs> huh? Oh. Yeah, this isn't voice acting. This is just shit that they fucking stole from other media. Oh. <laughs> hey, Link. Thanks for the uh thanks for the sub. Freak! That's a fresh freak chat. Don't peace, please. Link loves you. I love you too, Link. Thank you. Huh? Bye bye. <laughs> He's not happy about mom today. Huh? <clears throat> Hello. <laughs> We're not gonna get voice acting because they would already be voice acting. <laughs> huh? Sweep it up, bitch. <laughs> Uh, Dean Money with nine months. Thanks, bro. <sighs> and also Nanashi, thank you. <laughs> uh, no! Please stop! <gasps> uh. <laughs> <laughs> Why didn't he just stop the microwave? Wouldn't that have prevented that? Huh? <laughs> Burn the fucking house down. Me and the boys watching the spoon spark. Ah, no! All right, so he. <clears throat> I just want to watch this again. He comes in. He he knows this is gonna happen. He's just being a little piece of shit. Ah, no! No! Please stop! Smacks him out of the way, and it deliberately burns the house. <laughs> deliberately burns the house down. 
deliberately burns the house. Holy <laughs> fuck. That was a Mr. Beast video. Huh? I wish he would have yelled the third time. That would have fucking made it perfect. <laughs> huh? Oh. <laughs> Patrick was like, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me? Excuse me? What? Um... Hello? The fuck? Huh? So he, he's crying. Oh. They see each other. They hug. And then the... And then the happy music starts to play. Absolutely nothing is resolved. The fuck? And they hug each other. And so he's not mad that the kid burned the house down. There is no resolution. The house was the problem all along. And now that they're homeless, guys, this had absolutely no fucking plot to it. This, 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 this is a new, this is fucking a new low. This is a new low because absolutely nothing happened. Nothing, nothing at all happened in, in, in this video, dude. The, the, the video is too loud. You, you guys got to tell me that shit sooner. And, 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 and like it's, it's over now. It's, this is for babies without object permanence. They can do whatever whatever they want and get views. We're, we're trying to... Uh, again, I, I believe that's going to be bad for the child. I believe that the child is going to um, suffer developmentally, thinking that stories don't need coherent narratives. You know what I'm saying? Like, like that's a problem. They don't care. What was the more? Like, like I guess, like, less houses, less problems or something? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, my my point is that the child does not understand that the house exists anymore. He will grow up to write the last season of Game of Thrones. <laughs> uh, yeah, fucking hell. It, it 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 it's like yeah a new low I mean, it is, nothing happened there was no resolution there was no moral was it like oh we can be happy with nothing it, it wasn't even that it was literally there was no cause and effect or nothing happened because of anything it's just it's really fucking painfully fucking stupid um zero uh zero out of five stars Okay, guys, we are at a crossroads. Um, would you like to continue watching Sonic videos or is it Fabiosa time? Vote in the comments below. Maybe we do a vote. More, we'll do more bingo, obviously, with the... 
But Sonic, obviously I didn't get a bingo here. If you vote loud, post it below. There's a folder within this folder. And it's the, the name of the folder is Thumbnails to Inspire the Next Generation. Okay, I think we is some of the stuff from last time too, alright. Uh, animation boxing ring, Sonic versus Tails. Sonic said backstory. Oh, I have a sad backstory too. <laughs> Today in every video gets the views it deserves. Choo Choo Charles vores Amy's asshole. He is eating her ass. That's his tongue. It's going into her asshole. He is eating out Amy's asshole, guys. 100k views. Sonic, please rescue Amy from Choo Choo Charles. Then why is she crying? What are... Okay, it, 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 the, the tongue is a tentacle that is wrapped around Amy's legs. But it is going up her skirt, guys. How and why is the tongue... Why is the video 34 minutes long? Because <laughs> it, it's not all this, you know. But this might not even happen in, in, in this fucking, you know, in this story. Guys, what's that on the tip of this tentacle over here? Some some white stuff? Or is that part of Amy's dress, guys? He, he's also looking up her skirt, and he's ramming his tongue up her skirt. But, you know, for kids, 100k views. 100,000 future U.S. Senators. That's awesome. He's literally eating her ass. Mike, only 240 people voted. Are you viewbotting? I'm definitely not viewbotting. I, again, look, I never view body, you cunt. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and assume that what happened is what happened to me because I was waiting for the moderators to make the, the fucking poll. Okay. The majority of you never saw it because it was blocked by the pinned um, bingo, uh, bingo link. Am I right? That's what happened to me. Is that what happened to you guys? Yeah, I didn't know the poll happened. No, I have never view bought it. I'm sorry I called you the C word. I'm actually not supposed to use that word. Um, You said it twice. I know. I guess I miss it. Maybe I should view bot. Hello, fellow Jabrowdy Mike Chatter. Come, Pog Champ. Come, Seaman Glanch. Come. I mean, that's, how is that indistingu indistinguishable from any of you, really? I can't tell anymore. There's a new poll, guys. Vote in it, please. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe I should get some view bot. I think it's against TOS, though. We've been bots this whole time. If I found out that my my views were somehow artificially like inflated, that would make me so fucking sad, you know.
That would like be a very depressing moment in my life. Um, they said that because they wanted a recount. Okay. Guys, I'll tell I'll tell you what. We'll do like we'll do like two more Sonic videos and then go to Fabiosa. Making that making that poll pointless, okay? Sonic versus Choo Choo Charles. Why is he got a there's like a good Choo Choo Charles? Like who's that? Do we have any trouble busters? We are actually fresh out of trouble busters. We don't we don't have any trouble boss. I don't have any trouble busters left. Six year old girl begs her parents to let her die. And what happens next is shocking. They let her die? <laughs> they, they, let, they let her? Can we watch it? It's it's probably not funny or interesting or anything. Seven-year-old Dogecoin millionaire buys back grandma's house. We did watch that one. It was very stupid. The real origin of fake Peach? No, who is Peach really? Husband dies from wife's fart. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. By the way, featuring Cinema Sins, who according to you guys wasn't even in the video. It was just like it was like like an AI voice that was fucking making the doing the Cinema Sins voice. Enema Sins. Broke versus rich versus giga rich. What the fuck is going on here, bro? They only have one future U.S. Senator watching this. Giga Rich. It's like combining Finger Family with... I mean, like, dude, it's Fingers. Combining Finger Family with, like... Those bizarre surgery flash games that Rev used to stream. Or something. Fuck this. Garten of Ban Ban. Yeah, a ga Garten of Ban Ban is, is gonna be a thing, guys. Who will Amy choose? Amy is gonna fuck Garten of Ban Ban? Cops use taser on 73-year-old grandma. Remember when she pissed? <laughs> Dude! Dude, that's the fucking like the like the crypto king Luigi. Right? Chad Luigi. This Luigi just bought more land in the metaverse. Lago soup, thanks for two years. Rich versus poor. I, 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 we we watched this one. Yeah, we watched we saw that one. What happened to Sonic and Shadow? We seen this thumbnail. Husband fat shames 300 pound wife. This video was actually a fucking banger. Remember that one? Animation. When Sonic and Tails become idle. Someone in chat goes, not okay. <laughs> not okay. Look at their faces. Look, look at their faces. And and look at Amy. Why is Amy crying? Like, she doesn't want to let them be themselves. Like, she's like, so upset by this, right? 
Why is she crying? Twelve lost souls watching. <laughs> they got cake! Alright, we're not, we're not, we're not looking at- Where are his tails, by the way? This is tails. Where are his fucking tails, guys? Where, where are they? Tucked in his bunghole? Mean bosses mistreat employees from darn men in the most ironic fucking video imaginable. Beautiful Peach with love for Bowser. Do you love Amy? Yes or no? Who is Sonic's mermaid girlfriend? Well, clearly none of them are fucking mermaids because I can see they have fucking human feet. So what the fuck kind of thumbnail is that? Amy got no money in banking account. Poor Amy and rich that mother rouge. Thrown off airplane for poppy playtime. That doesn't even that, that doesn't even happen in that video. The thumbnail is fucking outright lying about what takes place in the in the video. That's not remotely what fucking happens in that video. What the fuck? Get baited. TikTok prankster blows up teacher's car. Kid Roblox billionaire gets the girl. Sonic versus Alphabet Lore. Rainbow Friends, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 animation. It's, it's, oh, it's, it's referencing the uh, Alphabet Lore. Streamer is caught cheating. I remember that one. Che teacher takes shit on student's essay. And they picked the single best frame in that entire video. That was the best video. That one did rock. All right, that's so that's all oh, that's in that folder. Um, hold on. I have a folder full of all the videos that we watched. I feel like I should probably just delete it because what the fuck am I doing with it anyway? What's the Finger Family compilation email, guys? I feel like I've said this a number of times. I'm going to say it again. Because I'm still getting emails. With finger family links. Usually I just forward them to FAP. Because it's not that big of a deal. Um, but I don't. like. I'm, I'm like fucked up with emails. You want to email them. You, to, you want to email them directly to FAP. I emailed you. I forwarded one to you guys today by the way. But. Finger family archive project at gmail.com is where you want to send your links guys. Okay Do you guys want to see something Unbelievably fucked Okay It's not Goatsy. These are all Sonic videos. That we haven't watched. You're here forever. Well, I mean, you don't have to be, but. Years of content, literally. All right, um, let's watch, yeah, we'll watch, we'll watch like two of these, okay? And then we'll move on to, uh, to Fabioso, guys. Open with MPV. Oh. We know what's funny. We literally just removed mermaids from the fucking bingo card. <laughs> <laughs> we literally just did this. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Maybe it didn't update yet. <sighs> I 
I I do not see mermaids, guys. Damn. All right. Well, they called it boat murdered. <laughs> It's a fucking blowfish. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna sting you. Oh, they're gonna literally be murdered by a boat. Huh? Did we see this before? That was a wow. It was kind of a quiet wow, but it was a wow. Are you flirting with that mythological creature? That's upsetting to me. I mean, I should be, you know, surprised at the existence of the mythological creature, but 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 I'm more upset that you're you're hitting on it. You should stop flirting with. The mermaids. <laughs> That's a lot of sweat. Mm -hmm. but she was already... She was already wet. Oh, this is a quick romance here. <laughs> you put your tongue away, you fucking freak. And by the way, how are you standing? He has evil intentions. Hmm. <sighs> Sonic is gonna sink that yacht. He's gonna turn her into sushi. <laughs> is that we've talked about this before? But is that cannibalism? Uh. Only if you eat the top half. Uh. All right. Huh? Hey. Shadow was like, did you know that Flareon is the only fire-type Pokemon who can't learn Solar Flare? I can't not fuck mm. him. Mm. That's awesome. Why are the WoW so quiet? Sushi time. Please hit her. Oh, oh, that reminds me. I forgot to tell you guys. I went axe throwing in Florida. It's one of the things that we, we, we did. We went axe throwing one day. It was fine. I never did it before. How many dead or injured? Just two? I got fucking loaded before we went. I was I was shit-faced when I was throwing axes. It was bad. Only two. Surprisingly easy. I, I think that it's like the kind of wood that they use, like absorbs blades. Well, I wouldn't say it was that easy. I, um, they had a Batarang. I got a bullseye with the Batarang, guys. I'm Batman. It's a really soft wood that gets, shit gets stuck in it easily, yeah. Bullseye with the Batarang. I'm fucking officially Batman. Drunk Batman, but Batman nonetheless. That is fun. I would love to do that again. That shit was a lot of fun. My good friend is an axe throwing coach. It's super safe. Is it safe? I mean, like, they are axes. The, the axes I, are, are pretty dull, actually. Like, it, it's, just, it's just that the wood is, like, that soft. Yeah. <laughs> he said soft wood. Um... Actually, yeah. Yeah, they, it's like the, the, the wood has like a lot of like slits in it. So like the the axes just kind of slot into the wood. It's kind of, you, you got to see it to understand it. 
Um, it was like easier than I thought it was. It was gonna be. I'll put it to. I'll put it to you that way. Did you go to the one in Fort Walton? Yes, I. I I'm pretty sure that's where. I. Th I mean, I, I might have just saw signs for it, but I think so. I think that's. I think that's. Yeah, that's where I was. Fort Walton. The grain runs up and down. Yes, 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 it does. Uh, Dijon. Um, it's all good, Max. But yeah, it 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 was it was cool. It was cool. I would I would like to I would like to do it again. Um, I feel like I had more I wanted to say about this, but now I can't fucking remember it. They sometimes wet the wood to help the axe stick in it better. Yeah, yeah. I, I think there was some of that going on, but who cares? <laughs> I wish they would have targets that was just like like a soft pink hedgehog. I I I was just gonna say fucking black silhouette with red background. I was just gonna fuck. I was gonna say it, but I didn't have enough time to say it. I knew it was coming. The the sound. <laughs> I think that's that's him pushing her off the boat. That's not like a meat sound. Because, you know, can't show violence to the kids. That would be fucked. What, what she's a mermaid. Is she going to drown, guys? No blood. <laughs> and <laughs> Yo, by the way, what happened to Rouge the Bat? You almost got a bingo? Really? Abrupt ending. Yeah, definitely. Meme bait. <laughs> Meme bait. No. Uh, OCs? No. Elder abuse? No. Uh, porn model? No. I don't think those mermaids are poor. I mean, who knows? Kidnapping? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Fetish for kid? No. Diapers? No. Cancers? No. Cuckoldry? Yeah. Yeah, kinda. I think so. Buff Sonic. They had muscles. Stolen art. No fecal sound effect. My, uh, I maybe at one point. Uh, tombstone jerk off character. No, 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 no. That's it for me. Okay. Uh, so this one says crime doesn't pay. Where's the bingo card? You guys, you might need to relink the bingo card up there. <laughs> huh? Daddy? Want a Sonic? <gasps> See that? That's bad voice acting. You can tell the animators did it themselves. Right. We're rich now. <laughs> the most expensive necklace. All right, well, that's like in character, right? Like Rouge is doing rougey things, right? So beautiful. So her fucking tits are way bigger than they usually are here, huh? Oh, that's fuck. Yeah, that's porn. That's for porn. Why was she missing a tooth? What's going on with that tonight? So beautiful. Rouge got implants. Her tits weren't big enough. She went up to fucking like triple J's. Oh. Mm. 
<laughs> he farted? Dude, again, a fart came out of his armpit. Please don't go, Daddy! <laughs> <laughs> you are arrested. Holy shit, it was a sting operation. It was a honey pot. I surrender. The the the, the tits aren't even real. Daddy. Huh? Rouge the cop. Holy fuck. I'm sorry, my baby. Sonic gets five years in jail. <laughs> Rouge the pig. Oh, no. We got fucking... Judge Knuckles, too. Sonic gets five years in jail. You like... Yeah, you like his face? <laughs> the face. Ow. Rouge would never become a cop unless she was, like, a quadruple agent somehow, right? Oh, no! I'm late! I was thinking about this today, like... You know why I really, I really think that, that women are, like, vastly superior um, espionage agents to men? Is because, like, men get so fucking stupid when they're horny that you, you, you could get, like, any information out of any, anybody, any dude when he's horny. And they make so many mistakes when they're horny. Like, you know how many, like, careers have been fucking, like, amazing careers, like, are self-sabotaged because, like, that guy is horny? Like, the guy will be, like, I gotta watch. No, I'm I'm go I'm gonna fucking yeah. I'm I'm my life is amazing. I make fucking like like fucking three hundred million dollars a year, but I have to fucking like you know jerk off in front of these women. You know what I mean? It, it's it's like how does that happen? You know what I'm saying? Like like yeah, I, like, like like how the fuck. Men just get, they get so fucking stupid when they're horny. Like, you could take down a government. If you get, like, the right woman who, like, honestly, like, knows how to use her sexuality and, and, and like, and, like, fucking, on, they get be manipulative, like, no fucking dude is going to stand a chance against that. Like, unless he's mega gay, you know? Guys, can you please time out Matt Mellon for the spamming? It's quite annoying. His father is in jail. <gasps> Your dad is a criminal. Get out of here. <laughs> he is not a bad guy. He's getting bullied by the baby huggy wuggies. Oh. We've all been there, Sonic. Your know, dad is a criminal. Get out of here. He is not a bad guy. All right. People are, 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 are fucking copying and pasting about a hair on the screen. Guys, get a fucking rag and clean the dried cum off your fucking monitor for once in your fucking life, guys. Okay, like, like, just, like, like, it's getting out of control now, okay? Clean the dried cum off your fucking monitor. Get, like, like, you get, like, screen cleaner? Get screen cleaner, all right? Spray some fucking screen cleaner on the rag. Wipe it on the fucking monitor. You got fucking years of fucking dried cum caked up on your fucking monitor. There's probably fucking hairs and God knows what else stuck in there. You guys are telling on yourselves, okay?
God knows what else is fucked. Bacteria, germs, filth, all kinds of filth and shit. All fucking caked up in there, all right? I'm hungry. Hello? How can I help you? You know what's remarkable to me? His father got arrested. He now has no parents. He's, I guess, homeless or... There's no parents involved now. Why did he go to school? Like, if my fucking parents got arrested, it'd be like, yeah, right, I'm going to school. Okay. I'm never going to school again as a kid. Right? Like, I... I... One bread. Looks like it's fucking summer vacation forever now. Child Protective Services, yeah. Oh. Mm. You are his son. The face was different. Please, sir. Get out! Ah, oh, there's a lot of bingo potential in this one. Get a load of trash! What are you doing? I don't want a criminal to rent my house. I have no place to stay. Oh, who? Ro Robotnik Landlord Robotnik. <laughs> Place to stay. Who cares? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Runt punt. Shadow is wearing a JPEG for a hat. Not catch this! Oh my god! You are his. I did. I never saw. No, I didn't see it. I, I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't. Guys, I'm on drugs, okay, and I'm old. Holy fuck! It it, it it's like Shadow. Like okay, so like in universe, right? Shadow needed a like a baker's hat because he's a baker. So he like printed out a picture of one and fucking stapled it to his forehead. <laughs> it's his $70,000 chef hat NFT. I guess I have too much calm on my monitor. Done. Please, sir. <laughs> Fuck Get out. How did I blind this completely? What the fuck? Oh my god. <laughs> it's so good. I found you, Baker. What are you doing? I don't want a criminal to rent my house. I have no place to stay. Who cares? Five years later. I can come back to my baby now. Where could the baby be leaving? Was he not, like, allowed any contact with his fucking child? Is that... my baby? <laughs> what happened to you? I'm sorry. It's all my fault. My only regret is we didn't get to watch him die. Wait, did you hear that? My fault. Listen to the scream. Listen. <laughs> what is he fucking Bigfoot? What? What is that? <laughs> what is that? Help me, please. Help me. Son of criminal. Son of criminal. Stop it. Dude, this is how he died. I would like to point out to you. That he's dying with a load of shit in his pants. Those are like stink lines coming off the diaper. That's there's fucking shit in his in his in his diaper as he dies. Died of exposure, major L. Guys, there's ten seconds left. How do you <laughs> Daddy, I really miss you. <laughs> I 
That's it. Ah, oh, that's that was a banger. And the moral of the story is it's fuck you. That's the moral of the story. Uh, I all right, I guess the moral of the story was like don't do crime and go to jail. Uh, that's okay. That's a I, I I I guess that's an acceptable moral. Is that cancer? No, man. That that's ex that's exposure. He died of exposure. It was cold. He was hungry. He starved. And it wasn't a disease. Okay. Um. Visual error. Yeah, that the chef hat. Rich poor styled storyline. No honkers. Yes. Lore mipsum. No stolen art. No backwards hand. I don't know. I don't think so. Diapers. Uh, love wins. Certainly did not. Nightmare fuel, cross-dressing, alcoholism, bullshit ending. Nah, I'm fine with that ending. Wombo combo? Does does baby Sonic getting kicked count for wombo combo? No, you know what? No, that's child abuse. Can't say it's uh, backwards text. Random characters work. Random jobs. Cuckoldry? No. I got fucked again. All right, so I told you guys we were going to watch two more of these. Oh, the random... Oh, yeah, random job, sure. Um, I told you we were going to watch two more. That was two more. Uh, the moral of the story is to clean your screens, you filthy MCPs. All right, so that, well, that just happened. I'm going to move these to our watched folder. And we'll move on to Fabio's. We also have uh, some other stuff here, guys. Um, ETU, Animated Stories. We do have Fabio's, a go something called Gossip City. There's a video in here that says, help, I'm allergic to poison. Uh, here's my story. We have, we have bullshit that's like similar to Trouble Busters. Uh, MSA, my story, animated. Revenge films, okay. Uh, then there's a folder called the controversial ones, which is going to make, probably make like chat spicy. W O A my story. Okay, I'll tell you what, guys. I have to piss. I'm gonna be right back, and we're gonna watch these. Hold on. That's a lot of pog champs, guys. What's up with all those pog champs? That is so many pog champs, guys. Holy shit.
wrist bones. I saw what you just did, and I want you to know that is amazingly epic. Matt, I hope, uh, Matt, I need you, uh, have a sense of humor, buddy, okay? Matt, that's, that's, it's funny and you know it, bro. It's funny and you know it, you know it's funny. Um, yeah, so that was a good piss. I feel like I wanted to, uh, uh, say something, um, but I don't remember what it was. Um, what did I say we were, we were going to do in here? I don't remember. There is one in the controversial folder that has Sonic-esque antics, if you catch my drift. Oh, yikes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 All right. This is not Fabiosa. I said we were going to watch Fabiosa, but do you want to watch this, this thing first? There's a knockoff of Trouble Buster. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, it's made with the same uh, animation uh, program or whatever, right? Okay. Oh. Revenge films. Revenge films, guys. Ever since we got married, my mother-in-law, who lives an hour and a half away from us, has been visiting us a lot without calling first. She comes when my husband is at work and rummages our house. She says that the food in the fridge is rotten and throws them in the sink. Man, that's a real 180 from the uh, the in-laws that were forcing the, the kids to eat rotten food. Of course, I tried to resist, but I'm small and she's well built. Kylie put... She's well built, dude. Poison in it. She said about my husband's expensive wine and threw it away. That wasn't wine, though. That was clearly whiskey. Anyway. Then, after she goes away, the house is always a mess like a burglar came. You are depending on medicine. That's that's Drix. That's why you won't get well. She even said that and threw the medicine away. When my <laughs> husband what, was in sucks. junior high school and was pronounced with a disease, his mother was more eager than anyone else to question the doctor. And she even bought several books about the disease. But why did my husband lament? You Lem why did she? Lem why did he lament? In the fact that I was home, she put her clothes and shoes inside a paper bag. She went out of our house and shouted, "Kylie, please let me in!" The neighbors gossiped about what happened. My husband and my father-in-law are on my side, but she never listened. She did what? No matter what they said, my husband cut ties with her and promised me that he'll find a new job. My father-in-law agreed to cutting off the relationship. At that time, I discovered that I was pregnant. Ever since we got engaged... Did you see that burrito, guys? Look at that, look at that little bean burrito, guys. Pergnut. My mother-in-law kept saying, Hurry and give birth to a boy. Oh. Her attacks were horrific. My husband is the younger brother, but she said... Your older brother should just do whatever he wants as a couple while he's in his 20s. Just as she wanted, we found out early that our baby is a boy. Then, my mother-in-law suddenly became kind of a completely different person. I had bad morning sickness, so she asked. That's a lot of vomit. And not only that, but every drop of it is completely missing that toilet. What do you think you can- uh, She didn't get a single fucking drop of vomit in the fucking toilet! had bad morning sickness so she asked <laughs> what do you think you can <laughs> that's so good <laughs> there's just, there's just a, a slowly forming fucking puddle on the floor of that bathroom right holy shit eat and went to buy food for me and cooked for Fuck. my husband as well I was a bit suspicious, but my morning sickness was terrible, and I've become less cautious. I think it was really <laughs> stupid. That day, she came to our house, like always. The doorbell rang. I love her walk animation. It's very authoritative, right? So I opened the door, and... Bitch! 
My mother-in-law, with a devilish-looking face, jumped on me, <laughs> and I pushed myself down to the floor. Looking down at me as I crawl on the floor, she stomped on my lower belly. As a result, I miscarried. However, after that, she said, Holy I made you miscarry, baby. But do you have any complaints? My No. <laughs> no. The fuck? Guys. Holy shit. That was also happening in the in the in the Mario Finger family videos a lot too. Like how many times did pregnant Peach fucking have like 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 a, a miscarriage or like a fucking um like a premature birth because she fell or some shit that happened like eight times that happened way more times than it should have any complaints yeah cool brother-in-law and his wife were furious then she went over the top and uttered very abusive things like gotta go fast i love chili dogs so my husband father-in-law and brother-in-law totaled her then my mother-in-law said to my brother-in-law, They totaled her? They, they totaled her, guys? What does that mean, they totaled her? Father-in-law and brother-in-law totaled her. Totaled her? Like she's a fucking... A vehicle involved in, an act, in a car wreck? Like what the fuck do you mean she's to Damn, they had to write her off on the insurance. That's what I'm saying. What does that mean? To totaled her. Bad Google Translate? It's gotta be. Then my mother-in-law said to my brother-in-law's wife, who she treated like her own daughter. That's a fucking horrible sentence. This is like, this is really hard to follow. What the fuck? My mother-in-law said to my brother-in-law's wife, who she treated like her own daughter. Shut the fuck up. She's salvaged now. Everyone is bullying me. It's, 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 it's like I'm fucking hearing a random person telling me a story and not a professional YouTuber. She asked for help, but she was told, I will never... Your brother-in-law's wife is your sister? It was like, I'm my own grandpa type bullshit. Fucking tell the story. Let you meet my child after I give birth. She was driven away. Well, you're not giving birth now, are you? And is left stunned. The reason why my mother-in-law made me miscarry was that... After getting pregnant, before my brother-in-law, she said that I was a bitch for carrying a baby boy. So she's going to jail, right? This is, that, that's insane. I mean, obviously that's fucking insane. But what is the logic to that? What is this video player doing? Are you seeing that black bar up there? Bitch. Come here, you bitch. One way or another, that baby's not going to make it. She told them to have a boy. I'm very confused by her motivations and shit. She threatened me to give birth to a boy ever since the engagement. But she pretended she didn't hear. I wanted to finish her, but I didn't dare oh. do it. Let me put it to you this way, man. I, I mean, like, I don't, you know, I'm not, I don't have a uterus and stuff. But, like, if I was pregnant... If 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 you do that to me, I am going to stab you. Like, that, that, you're getting stabbed. You are getting stabbed. Yeah, you're getting stabbed. So I decided to finish her slowly and painfully. Her family has a diabetic history, so she's been very careful with what she puts in her mouth, but it was hereditary, so she became diabetic. With these numbers, it's not enough to take medication. So she's gonna like poison the bitch? Oh, that's epic. You don't need to come. It is, it's, it's revenge porn. Often. So she only needed to go see the doctor once every three months. I still don't understand her motivations for for, make, for assaulting her into a miscarriage. My husband, father-in-law, brother-in-law, and his wife, with their approval, the day after my mother-in-law went to the hospital. God, do you think shit like this actually happens? I immediately put the plan into action. She doesn't listen to me, but I'm a registered dietitian, so she trusts me when it comes to food. Your numbers are good, and the doctor... Why? Why would she? ...doctor always praises you, so it's a waste if you don't eat what you want. R right She loves sweet foods, so I used that to my advantage. Just like all... She killed her with diabetes, dude. ...ways she came to our house without telling us in advance. I made a rich gateau chocolate cake, her favorite. She flinched for a sec... Diabetes. And ...but immediately said... I made this with sweeteners that don't raise blood sugar levels that a dietitian friend of mine developed. 
So she ate a piece and her face lit up. Why would she always... Why, why, why would she not question any of this? I'll make it any time you ask me, so just contact me, I told her with a smile. Maybe it's because she's always been restraining herself all this time that she came almost every day for sweets. I thought she like she came whenever she ate the sweets. I made different kinds of sweets so she wouldn't get tired of them and lose interest in it. Every time... It's a lot of work to murder I'd her. Say, I used artificial sweeteners to make these as well so you can eat them. After she ate a lot... This, this gotta be some... This gotta be illegal what she's doing. I mean, like, yes, punching a pregnant woman is illegal, but, like... This is equivalent... This, this is murder. I asked her politely. I also baked cookies. Please eat this as dessert after dinner. Then, with a smile on her face, she went home. Maybe if I... What, what is her fucking walk animation, said man? Said a registered dietitian. I don't think she would have trusted me. Because I'm a dietitian, I told her she can eat the sweets... And also, because she loves sweets, she probably shut down her doubts. When she went to see the doctor, the numbers were already very high. Then, she was diagnosed with diabetic kidney disease and was hospitalized immediately. She fin Bitch. finally realized that the sweets I baked for her were the reason and raged. Then, Stupid. my father-in-law and husband came with green paper. My father-in-law asked for a divorce. <laughs> he, he, why did he wait so long? And my husband and his brother cut relations with her. That's when my mother-in-law finally <laughs> realized what she'd done. She wept with guilt. I said something horrible to Kylie. I want to apologize. Yeah, that was the problem. Of course, I didn't want to meet her or forgive her. Crying, she signed the... Yeah, that was the thing. That was the thing that upset everybody. Green paper. When she was Why are the people the who made the, the, the people who made this video are acting like that fucking miscarriage? They're acting like that assault and and subsequent miscarriage as a result were kind of not a big deal, right? Like, are you get, also getting that vibe where it's just like, oh well, here's just another fucked up thing she did among all these other fucked up things she did. It's like just kind of like, oh well, here you know, yeah, like NBD. It was, it was just, it was glossed over. Hospital, only her things were left in their house. They were living in her childhood house. It's rude to say, but it's small and old and dirty. Just like my penis. Even when sold as a vacant lot, it will be less than the market price, which is only about a few thousand dollars. Just when they were planning about making my father-in-law's childhood house a vacant lot and used his retirement money That's to build what they a new say house about there, my penis. I marked into their family and my mother-in-law acted like that, so that plan was no more. After the divorce, my father-in-law sold his property. D With this his is fucking... At, at this point, your dollars, brain just glasses over like there's nothing fucking... Wanted to live this is meaningless. He was young. Just around the, this, the same time, the video is basically over at this point. My brother-in-law had a job relocation and went there with his wife. Your brain As just shuts us, down. My like my, I feel my brain is shutting down now. Assignment request approved. Irrelevant so, word salad. we moved to a place near my childhood house, which is far from my mother-in-law. By the way, my father-in-law gave us a percentage of his retirement money to us. Even though we're already divorced. Yeah, who gives a fuck? What my wife did is unforgivable. And That's I know your that meds? It's not no, that it's, no, money, it's this, just, it's this video. Accept this. What he gave was a huge amount of money, despite being a percentage of his retirement money. We can't receive this much money. This money is a result of- What are the gold coins? Are they fucking Scrooge McDuck? Your what the fuck? hard work. That's why. Please use it for yourself. Please, think of this as money I used for my unborn grandchild. If he was born, I wanted to buy many things for him and take him to different places. She broke that dream into pieces with her selfish feelings. So if you want to help me out... How did she not get arrested? At no point did she get arrested. Please take this. Besides, I don't need that much money where I'll move to. If ever a new life will be born, please contact where, me. Why were the police I'll not involved? Me. Because they didn't call the police. My father-in-law said, and we decided to accept it. They were and like, because they were like, no, this is normal. This, this is fucking, this is run of the mill. I got pregnant with another child at the place where we moved to and gave birth to a cute baby boy. When I reported it to him, he cried tears of happiness. A month after the baby was born, he came to visit. I just want to do something real quick. He cried tears of ha happiness.
reported it to him, he cried tears of happiness. Fuck. A month after the baby was born, he came to visit. After being abandoned by his husband's mad children, my mother-in-law's neighbors gossiped about her and became isolated. We moved, but I was still in contact with her former neighbors, so I received information about her. Rumors say her prognosis is not good, but I don't regret it at all. Okay. How was today's video? Dog shit. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Stay tuned for more. Okay. Someone said I'm fucking predictable. Yeah, but in a good way, right? Teehee. All right, so that was um, <clears throat> one of the so-called controversial ones. Um, we've also got uh, Revenge Films. Okay, so that's this from the same channel we just watched. Um, my Story Animated. Here's My Story. TikTok Guide. Okay. Let's just hit some, uh, let's hit some Fabiosa because that's what um, you guys wanted to say. Um, in honor of Landlord Robotnik, I will watch this one that's just has something to do with Land Lady. It looks like, okay. Let's get mad, rage porn. It's Fabiosa. Land Lady mailed off my kids. One night, the flood I ran- Landlady mailed off my kids! And it got flooded. Your runts clawed the pipes. Your runts. Guys, I can't hear the word runt as what it actually means anymore. Now I can only hear it as a euphemism for- for- see- for- yeah, Scooby-Doo with tits. I- I- that's now Scoob- I hear runt, I think Scooby-Doo with tits. Yeah. Pay up. But it was Felicia's hair that blocked them. I didn't protest, afraid to end up on the street. She's gonna fuck but that guy. But the next guy. day, I lost my job. Company went bankrupt. Though this, Fabiosa also brought us that, that banger of, uh, what was it, rat, rat shelter, rat shelter. Leave them at the door. <laughs> Rat shelter. Our pension fund went bust along with the company. That's when Felicia decided to raise the rent. $498? Where's the other $2? I paid for the plumbing. Plus, I got kids. Have kids when you- Stop jiggling, you asshole. You see the way they're just jiggling? Have money to pay. I want the whole sum by morning or you're out. As a way out, I took a night job. I got home close to dawn. All I wanted was rest. Felicia took two dollars and interest for the delay. In the morning, my kids had a fever. It took me three minutes to run to the pharmacy. When I got back, That's it? the crib was empty. I freaked out when I saw them. She put them in a cab? No, because in the beginning of this video, you said she put them in a, you said she put them in a fucking cardboard box and mailed them off somewhere, dude. That's what happened. Did that not happen? Were you exaggerating? I'm gonna tell you something. These videos are so much more enjoyable when you imagine that they're all reliable narrator, unreliable narrator. Chad is saying it was a taxi to Abu Dhabi. Um, is that what it empty. said? It doesn't say Abu Dhabi, guys. You lied to me. Freaked out when I saw them. Where did you send my kids? Somewhere they'll be better off. A kid's home. That's not legal. You can't... They, they would say, like, okay, well, are you the mother? You know what? I need my kids back. I'll fix everything, I promise. You won't see them while your case is in court. They really didn't expect that voice to come out of his mouth. I checked all kids' homes before finding- What is that animation error with that red square? My boys, but I couldn't even hold them. I had no idea why Felicia hated me so much. Well, that's easy. It's because you're a rentoid 
and she's a superior like ubermensch land chad okay i took a job at a laundry by the kids home working double shifts to a land chad that's the word land chad or a lawyer kurt was the best custody lawyer around oh she's gonna fuck kurt I can't pay, but won't leave until you agree to help. I promise to work off every cent. A day of picketing and good coffee, and Kurt agreed. Good coffee? She you bribed him with coffee? Get the kids if she withdraws her testimony. I realized Felicia would never do it. I sneaked into the kids' home to see my boy. Snuck? Sneaked? Oh, when they said good coffee, they meant hot coffee, right? Sneaked is correct. I love you so much. We'll be together soon. That's when I learned why Felicia hated my guts. Good girl, found at a railway station 40 years ago. She waited for her mom who never showed up. I what the fuck does that have to do with her? I realized Felicia was deeply unhappy. I didn't want to punish her. I wanted to help her. I decided to melt her cold heart with kindness. Felicia, I found your mother. My mother? That have not who abandoned me? I didn't ask you to do that. And I don't care. Get the fuck out of my house. It's not true. She never stopped looking for you. <laughs> With my last money, I brought Felicia's mom to her. And then killed her in front of her. And she grabs her neck and snaps it like Green Beret style. And kept thinking how to get my kids back. <laughs> Felicia- Now this is happening, snap. <laughs> and drank her tears. Uh, was it easy to find her? Apparently. And how is she not dead? The woman looks old. Fatality. She stole her kids. It's the opposite of revenge porn. It's like... Porn. Drop the charges. The kids are yours. I'm sorry. And Thank you for finding my mom. Live here as long as you like. The flat's yours. Black Lodge porn. Please get. They're gonna get hit by a car. You think poor get a people load can be this. good parents? Guys, do you think poor people can be good parents? Post it below. <laughs> what if? What if you just go there? <laughs> And all, all the comments are just, just say no, right? No. Just, just, just no. <laughs> oh, Christ. No one should be a parent. Guys. Yeah, like, I hear a lot of stories from people who grew up, like, really poor, and it's, it's, it's fucking brutal. But you know what else I hear about a lot? Demented rich parents. Like absolutely fu like 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 fucking psychotic psychotic rich parents. Rich parents are almost universally bad. It, it it's like the, the rich people are insane, dude. They're just fucked. They get rich parents get rich because they're extremely possessive. Y yeah, man. Like, and and I, and I think that rich people have like they are compelled to hold standards to their kids. Like, whereas I I guess like they they're compelled to hold like I don't know. They 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 want their kids to be exactly what they want them to be. You know what I'm saying? Like some, I, I, I think there's some, I don't know what's going on there. I, I would like to know what the fuck is up with that. They think they own their children too. They act like they own their children and shit. I, I've, I've just, 
I feel like I've heard that a lot. I've heard or seen depictions of like wealthy parents being being sadistic to to their kids a lot of the time. Um, um, what about Sicilian parents? Well, those are the fucking worst, especially if they've been don donkey kicked. Forget about it, bro. Especially if they've been donkey kicked. Okay. Cat this says learn to throw your voice. Cheers, kids are treated last. Why is she fucking stacked, dude? Look at how her fuck the, her, her top can't contain her tit meat, like it's spilling out. My sister went to college. This is gonna be like another like 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 fat toid versus like you know it's gonna be one of those. I became a cashier. His daddy dumped you cause you're fat. Yep. His daddy dumped you cause you're fat. I worked doubles despite toxicosis. Toxicosis? I took care of my son, but he was born preterm. Despite toxicosis. I took despite toxicosis. Guys. Welcome to the Lorem Ipsum Cafe. I took care of my son, but he was born preterm. My sister went to college, but I went to cashier college. Needs costly surgery to survive. I wouldn't have enough even working triple shifts. There was no choice. I asked my sister for money. Give me your voice and I'll pay for the surgery. You sing while I lip sync on stage. My voiceless sister envied me since we were kids. A fat so like you will scare the judges off. Do you like how the fat is pulsating? Did you see that? Voiceless sister envied me since we were kids. A fat so like you will scare the judges off. Since then. The fuck? We watched this one? No, there's just. There's just. Like, the, the majority of them are like this. No, we didn't watch this. Started freezing in front of public. Cornered, I signed a 10-year contract. I'd record songs for my sister. This is similar to the video with the kid um, playing Minecraft while his brother streamed. And then hear them while behind the register. That's how- The, the fuck this? I managed to cure my boy. Felicia quickly became a star. Wouldn't that that would never no because there's other what about the people in the fucking recording studio and, and shit and when what about fucking no like You would have legal you could prove that you recorded that One day my son relapsed out of the stress. Fuck? I lost my voice before Felicia. He relapsed This big concert. She relapsed from the toxicosis Pathetic I canceled the gig because of you. As punishment, my sister didn't buy my son's meds. <laughs> I, I'm gonna allow a child to die because you got sick. All right? Holy fuck. By the way, whose reflection is this? Who's, whose fucking reflection is that? My sister didn't buy my son. Yeah, I love that face. It's not the kid's fault. It's meds. You broke the contract. It's your fault. I can't sing anymore. I have to treat my boy. Next morning, she canceled our health insurance. I turned to a children's fund. They'd help in a month. Time was running out. I had no clue my son's favorite story would save us. Facing my fear, I chose to tell everyone the truth. She's a fraud and can't sing. She's a phony! She's a big fat phony! Plumpy, we already- Plumpy. Had lunch, why are you here? The childhood memories- You realize that her being like overweight is totally irrelevant to the story, right? That they just snuck that in there because they, I guess they figure like- their demographic is like middle-aged, overweight women. 
plumpy, plumpy, delicious cocks. Big fat plumpies. Hurt like hell. Big juicy plumpies. Humiliate. Plumpy, please. Hated by my sister, I froze again. When my voice returned, the city was all in posters. A singing con. It's outrage, babe. Tess had a huge first place prize. But I knew I'd just freeze and embarrass myself. That's when I decided to hide from prying oh, eyes. She's in they the recognized panda the voice and thought it was my sis. Get lost, fraud. There's only one Felicia. I wanted to die of shame. The stage lights blinded me. I tripped over a cable, killing Felicia's recording. Everyone heard her creaky, out of tune singing. That could have been done years ago. And and by the way, why didn't this woman simply remove the fucking panda mask? Why didn't she re simply remove the helmet and prove and be like, look, it's not her? Like like that. Why did? They, how did they? Holy shit! Th these people are so incompetent. They can't even make like the most predictable fucking story. This is holy shit. Because she was scared. Even my son was scared of her voice. So I started singing to soothe him. This is bullshit. That, if you have fucking stage fright, you're not gonna be able to get on stage in the first place. It doesn't matter if you're in a fucking panda costume. Everyone realized who sang their favorite songs. The TV host helped me up and took my mask off. My son's dad <gasps> was in front of me. Wait, what, he what, what is he doing? Of, oh, what a twist. Explaining to do. My sister had lied to him I'd found someone else and skipped town with my new love. I My sister lied to him that I found- okay. Didn't even know I became a dad. You know, you, you, so she goes to him, right? And she's like, your wife left you because she found another man. And at no point does he try to go ask her if that's true. At no point does he say, maybe I should, maybe I should talk to my wife about that. He just leaves. He just leaves. He skipped leg day. No, he's a, uh, he's, he's a breath of the wild Zora. Is what's going on with him. Yeah, they don't do leg day. I cured my boy with the prize money. Prince fucking Sidon. Look, he's doing leg day right now. He's on the trampoline with the baby. That baby's Boy, brains the... are fucking mayonnaise now. And he didn't even drop the baby yet. Prize money. I also got royalties <laughs> for my songs. After such a blunder, Felicia now uses her voice to scare off crows on a farm. Yeah, I don't think that Has would... anyone taken credit for what you did? Yes. No, I guess not. I just wanted to fit in. So I said yes. My dentures bit my adulterous husband. <laughs> That's the fucking that that's uh the Goya painting, dude. <laughs> that's the Goya painting. <laughs> what the fuck is that? What is it called? The the Saturn eating his Saturn eating his son. Guys, I want you to watch the way she chews. Like look at her gums, bro. My dentures bit my adulterous husband. Her gums, dude. Like, she looks like a fucking xenomorph. What is that? Holy shit. Alterous husband. My dentures broke during a kiss and bit my husband's tongue. <laughs> well, that's not vor. As much as what you just showed us. I thought this was going to be a, vo a vor porn. After this, Mike wrote me a note that he was divorcing me. I can't handle a toothless wife. Bro. The sloppy. The gum jobs, bro. What are you talking about? He doesn't know. The gummies, bro. The gum, the, the GJs, dude. 
the GJs. I can't handle a toothless wife. He couldn't speak because his tongue hurt. Yet <laughs> he didn't think how much he was hurting. Like, I don't know anything about dentures, man. Do they just bite things on their own? Like, are they sentient? Like, is, is, is there a microchip in there and they, they just automated chewing? How, how is this possible? This could happen? No. It happened to my buddy Eric. You say that for fucking everything. I'm starting to think this Eric guy doesn't even exist. They're on a timer like saw traps. He, so he like didn't know basically that she didn't have teeth. When he left me five months pregnant, we were expecting two boys. Pregnant. I like the gravity defying tear. Five months pregnant. We were expecting two boys. Five months pre-gat. Mike left and I- More like post-gat. I locked myself in at home. I needed a new set of dentures, but I couldn't afford it. Plus, I was- So just sell one of the babies. Going to be a mom soon. I was crushed. I had to find a job. A remote job so I could work from home. How do you marry somebody and get them pregnant and all that? And not know they don't have teeth. Like, how do you not... Nobody tell him. What the fuck now? What does nobody tell him shit? Neil Druckmann wrote these. <laughs> or else I'd not make rent and get evicted. All my savings would go to childbirth. But something else worried me even more. In labor, I'd be screaming with a toothless mouth. I had vivid nightmares that I was giving birth and a gigantic set of dentures wanted to eat my babies. Yeah, that... The I wish we could watch that instead of this. Sounds epic. Contractions started on month eight. I took them silently for fear of exposing my toothless mouth. But soon, the circumstances made me forget about my teeth. There were complications during childbirth, and I had to stay in hospital for several months. Medical bills. A the kids were the, the kids were like jacking off. Look 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 at the, look at their hands. Look at birth, birth. There were complications. There were complications. Why are they doing that? Fear of exposing my toothless mouth. <laughs> but soon, the circumstances made me forget about my teeth. There were complications during childbirth, <laughs> and I had to stay in hospital for several months. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. <laughs> oh. oh, fuck. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's not even that funny. It's not even that funny. It's not even that funny, dude. It's not even... <sighs> it's fucking stupid. All right. Uh, uh. <laughs> I can still see them. I can still see it. I can still see it. I can still see it. Oh. Oh fuck, alright, no, no, wait, <laughs> fucking wait. It's the drugs, it's gotta be the, the drugs, it's gotta be the drugs. Oh my god, what the fuck, oh. Oh fuck, alright, it, it's, it's a, um, like, oh. A seven-day course of these pills, I'm gonna be like this, every, like, every night for the next seven days. Um...
You know what I think I'm going to do after this stream? I'm going to take more of these pills and I'm going to go watch Chupa. I'm going to watch Chupa like this. Oh, fuck. Record your live reaction. I, I mean, maybe I got to do like a, like a riff track type of a thing. The ideal Chupa experience. Yeah. Do not abuse medication. I... I am taking it as directed, guys. I have to take two of them before I go to sleep tonight. It's day one of the fucking, um, of, of the course of pills. We should play King of the Castle again while you're on the pills. No. When the fuck are they fixing that game? Are they, are they working on it? What's up with that? It's fixed? No, Bullshit. Bullshit, it's fixed. There's nothing to fix. There's a lot to fix, guys. You were just bad. It was rebalanced. When did they rebalance it? When were you good? Guys, the game is mega stacked against the fuck the fucking streamer. Okay, if you want to sit here and say, oh, oh well, oh well, Limes won, Vinny won. I don't give a fuck, okay? They fucking it, Yeah, it's not I didn't say it was impossible to win, did I? No, I said it's very stacked and and difficult. It's difficult for the fucking streamer to win. Okay? It's difficult. They haven't touched it since launch. Chat is lying. You are lying. They fixed it so the streamer has more of an advantage now. Are you then I'll fucking stream it tomorrow? You are the only streamer I've seen not win. Oh, okay, guys. All right. Well, did you watch the fucking streams? Did you watch what what happened to me? March fourteenth was the last update. Somebody is lying. They don't, I don't think they did the balance there. Okay, if the, tomorrow, I was thinking about doing some more Pokemon um, fusion, or, or the Jurassic Park game. I I feel like most of you want to see the. I, I will probably do the Pogies. I'm gonna, you know, I am gonna do the. I just this. I am gonna do the pogies, and those dinosaurs. I'll I'll slip that Jurassic Park game in like the during the week, like like Tuesday or something. Tuesday or Wednesday, I guess. Oh no no, no probably okay because I know what I'm gonna do Wednesday. I know what I'm gonna do Wednesday, actually. Northern Lion has been streaming. Like, all these, like, shitty, well, not shitty, but, like, browse, br browser games where, like, dude, he found a game that's, like, GeoGuessr, but they, they, they show you a picture, they show you a photograph, and you have to guess what year it was taken. Based on the con the the contents of the photograph, it's called Time Guesser. Look at this photograph, Time Guesser, and a bunch of other shit like that. Yeah, and I was like, I'm stealing this. Thanks, bold man. Again, I've stole I've stolen so many things from the from the bold the bold man. This is mine now. Chrono Guesser, yeah, that, yeah, I, I, I have a whole, I, I made a list of all the games he was streaming. I'm, I'm stealing all of that, the content ideas. This is fifty fifty for the Pokemon and and Jurassic Park. Does Northern Line have sex or segs? I'm not sure. Both are compelling.
Well, yeah, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do the Pokemon tomorrow. Hey, mess me. He said his wife is attractive. Tbh. Where is that? Did anybody who who was talking about the man's wife and whether or not she's attractive? <clears throat> where where was that? And and I, I like how the comment had TBH in it as if like that was in question in any way, shape, or form. Like the fuck? It, kind of weird kind of a kind of a weird thing to I probably shouldn't have read that, but I'm high. That's 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 my excuse. TBH equals to be horny. Kind of fucking weird weird thing to say to say, man. Um <clears throat> <clears throat> so yeah, Pokemon's tomorrow. Um, maybe I do. I'm thinking uh, I'm try to do something with Rev on Monday. Um, and then, and then, uh, yeah, this Jurassic Park thing. God, uh, Tuesday. And then Wednesday, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna do a stream of all these fucking games. I was these these this this shit I stole from Northern, Northern Lion. What's the self timeout commit? It, it's bonk. Exclamation point bonk. Medical bills ate up all my savings, and I was preparing to get evicted. They're not jer jerking off anymore. But it wasn't the landlord who kicked me out. It was a fire. It broke out. Started by the landlord strategically. Out while we were sleeping, I woke up and smelled smoke. I grabbed my boys and ran to the exit, but the roof. They're sleeping rather peacefully through the fire, right? Collapsed and blocked the exit. I thought it was the end, and I held my babies like it was the last time. But suddenly, he appeared. My neighbor, I barely knew. Mm-hmm. And he's got a kink for gummies. He cleared the exit and got us out of the flames. She's double fisting burrito static. He saved my and my children's lives. But I was ashamed of speaking to him because I didn't have any teeth. I just grabbed my kids and ran to the ambulance that had just arrived. I didn't even thank him. He's like, wow, if I had known she wasn't going to fuck me, I would have let her burn to death. Fuck this. We got placed in a shelter temporarily. I started death. Wow, what a bitch. I'm gonna let you burn next time, bitch. Fuck you. Mighty Rancho, thank you for the sub. Freak! That's a fresh freak, guys. Dump him up, please. Desperately looking for a job. Cle that was a lot of effort. I could have got hurt in there. Cleaner, dish. Fucking ungrateful bitch. Washer, anything. But no one would hire That's That's Dick the Cuck with like different hair. Hire me. My lack of teeth put everyone off. And then I saw an ad for a housekeeper opening. Posted by my neighbor. That neighbor who'd saved our lives. You know what this never got into, this video? How, why doesn't she have teeth? But he'd never hire a toothless, ugly housekeeper for sure. I decided to give it a shot. Meth addiction? Well, when, you know. Come what may. I had to thank him for saving her. Seems kind of an important chapter in her life. Lives, at least. Tom's jaw dropped when he saw me. Seeing his reaction, I wanted to run. But then he smiled. I've been waiting for you, he said. I wanted to pay you a visit, but didn't know where you lived. Tom hired me. His wife had passed. What if he's like, my teeth, they're also fake. And he takes out his dentures and he's like, he's all gummy. And she's like, ew, and runs away. <laughs> Rousedower says she will give him the primo gluck gluck. Gluck gluck. Loving this gluck gluck shit, right? I've been waiting for you, my toothless gummy angel. Uh, Gathnix, thanks for 14 months, man. I appreciate that. 
chest, and he was looking for someone to help him around the house. Plus, he had two kids. He needs the good gluck gluck. I fuck now, I'm not gonna be able to stop saying that. God damn it, Roused Hour. As chance would have it. Mayo chicken. Thanks for 16 months, man. Tom's a dentist. He agreed to give me teeth free of- That's a little convenient, don't you think? That pie looks banger. Charge. And what was that, like a lemon, like a lemon meringue type of a fucking deal? Soon, I was all smiles again in my house. You read it right. My house. Tom proposed. In the middle of our street. Now I have a big and happy family. But my ex wanted to ruin it. He found out where I lived and came looking for Look at this goober. Bro, that's, that's, what's his fucking name? The, the guy, that's Jonah Hill, dude. That's the fucking guy from uh, Megamind. What is that? What is that? Batons, thanks for two months. The guy, the bad guy from Megamind, who is it? But my boys accidentally knocked his teeth out with a baseball. Dude, they knocked out his entire fucking gum structure. Did you see that? He found out where I lived and came looking for a brawl. But my boys accidentally... <laughs> he's, he's got bigger problems than, than fucking his gums knocked out, dude. Holy shit. He knocked his teeth out with a baseball. He used to laugh at me, but then got a taste of his revenge porn. His own medicine, because he couldn't afford dentures. Life is a boomerang. You always get what you give. No. Never forget this. That's horseshit. Oh, it's one. It, it's 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 talking about karma that doesn't exist. That's so wrong. You always get what you give. You absolutely don't. For example, what about all the taxes I give and get fucking absolutely nothing in return? Where's my fucking health insurance, you cocksuckers? Can we see the thumbnail? I don't fucking... That, you know what? Actually, that was a that was brilliant in engagement bait. Because it was going to piss people off to be like, that's not true, fuck you. Right? Every mouth gets the dentures it deserves. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You're not giving taxes. They're being taken from you. Flesh of fatty! <laughs> Guys, let's throw throw some flesh fatty into the air to celebrate. Thank you so much, ma'am. Flesh fatty. I <laughs> love that name. I love that name. You get an $800 billion military. Well, when are they going to come here and fucking, like, suck me off? When are they When are they going to come here and give me health insurance, okay? Karma. There's no such thing as karma, bro. Nintendo, not thank you for the gift sub. Uh, you guys got a little hype train going. Thank you so much. Um, <clears throat> I pay my taxes and not a single marine stud has come over to deep dick me until I'm broken. SMH. You see what I'm talking about, guy? That's... Punished Fink. Thank you for the bits. Proving my point from earlier. And that might be a woman. I don't know. Um, the reason that hasn't happened for you is because you, you got to tie a yellow ribbon around the oak tree. Right. You, have, you t have you tried the ribbon? All right, so I don't know what the fuck is going on anymore. I'm fucking shot, dude. We're going to watch more of these, though. The chompers on her. Yeah, 
This, this was a good one. This was a good one. And don't forget how it opened. Oh, the opening was fucking bananas. My dentures bit my adulterous husband. And you notice how... My... That was irrelevant to the rest of the story, wasn't it? That was... By the way... The adultery was where? The adultery was, was where, guys? I went... Dentures broke Vor during baby. a hit. We got vor we got vor baby. my husband's tongue. After this, Mike wrote me a note. Uh, is this like leaving your wife because she's toothless considered adultery? Hey, Jam. Th thanks, bud. Thank you. Thank you, Jam. Appreciate it. I'm, uh, I'm pretty worried about it. But, um... That he was we'll divorcing me. He couldn't speak because his tongue hurt. Yet he didn't think how much he was hurting when he left me five months pregnant. We were expecting two boys. Mike was left, and I locked what myself in at home. What happened to the dentures, though? I needed a new <clears throat> set of dentures, but I couldn't... They broke when they it bit his tongue? Is that... Seems like low-quality dentures. <clears throat> Mike, why did you leave? That's so funny because my name is Mike and this guy in the story's name is also Mike. Well, no shit. What have we got here? A fucking comedian. You know what that reminds me of? There's a, a, a fuck... I think I've talked about this on stream before. There's... I don't know, a, a, a company that makes, like, school buses? Fe Fecal Juice 69. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the gift subs. Fecal Juice. Um, There's a bus, comp a bus company. It's, it says, it, and the buses say Vinny's Bus Service on the side. Or like Vinny's Bus Company or some shit. And like once every six months, somebody will like at Vinny on Twitter with a picture of the bus and be like, Hey Vinny, I found your bus. <laughs> <laughs> and it, he's like, what do you want from me? Um, somebody subbed for five months. Their name, is, I believe, is in Japanese. So I can't thank them because I don't know how to read that. But if you're hearing this right now, and you... Um, <clears throat> I just want you to know I, I appreciate the five months. Thank you for the five months. Um, and Jam, thanks for 14 months. Vapor Mermaid. They well, they spoke again, and then it's translated. But in the resub message, it's not the 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 English is not there for some reason. But thank you. Um, mermaid on your bingo card. Uh, Gamiac says that I there's a, a popular streamer reacting to your shadow emote. Oh, you did you use it in somebody's chat, and they they. Reacted to it. Vaporeon? Did you know? We're not supposed to do that. Well, you're not supposed to... Be annoying with it. I, I mean, you definitely don't like harass people about it you know i don't don't, don't be annoying i mean i'm, I'm kind of worried like if i if i do watch this on stream it's it's interpreted as like encouraging that i don't want to encourage that oh, oh maximilian dude so shadow it's maximilian dude bro 
the clip is fine. He was asking for weird emo. I I have watched this dude. Uh, enough. I I I'm very familiar with Maximilian, dude. He was okay. He was asking for weird emo. He's also oh he's playing. He's playing Sonic 06. Is it, is it, this is Sonic 06, right? <laughs> Somebody has an Eggman emo. Look at that laughing robotic there. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Give me your best Sonic emotes, chat. Yeah, we're, and I want to okay. see some weird shit. Oh no! <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> look at this room he's got with the arcade cap. My God! Look at all the shit in that room. Holy fuck! Yeah, don't just there. spam like arrows. Yeah. I want to see some weird stuff. The weirder the better. Yeah, come on, Chad. Check your ear. Yeah, that one's pretty good. That one, all right. <laughs> they got the kissing. Wow. They got the, the Shadow and Sonic. Sonic. Shadow and Sonic kissing, kissing is pretty good. Yeah. For some reason, Sonic dressed up as the chick from Family Guy. Did you see that one? No. Oh. That one is pretty He said Sonic, but he meant Shadow, right? He meant, he meant, oh, sh wait, he, no, that, he's, he's got to be a different emote. He's he's not talking about this one. It's Pretty good. What is that? What is that? What is that? I'm scrolling back to oh. cartoon robot. What is cartoon that one? Robot. This is a really popular thing to do, I guess, making like vile fucking vile fucking Sonic the Hedgehog emotes. It's that's Shrek and oh. Shadow Kissing. Oh, I thought it was Super Sonic and Shadow no, Kissing. No, I know it's Shrek. That's Shrek and Shadow Kissing. That one wins so far. Wow. <laughs> that one's really good. <laughs> it wins! It wins! Hen rub, that works. Okay. All right. This is random cheeks, fish tacos. All right. <laughs> that, oh. the, okay, the family guy. Love wins. <gasps> Oh shit! Let's hear it for love tonight, chat. Love is in the house, baby. Are you guys feeling the love? I'm feeling the love. Uh okay. Well, yeah. If he asked, if he asked for them, then that is a different story, guys. Oh, that's so best. And guys, thanks for the scam train. I'm feeling that love as well. You guys are so good. Thank you. Can you feel the calm tonight? It's in my ass. My dad's killer wore my shoes. My dad's killer wore my shoes? These shoes were made for killing. And that's just what they'll do. I was hauled to the police station at my son's birthday party. You killed Gramps. These are so far two non sequiturs. I'm scared of you. Dad was locked up in an apiary and they found my shoe prints. The apiary is the building that they built so that Jane Goodall could fuck the apes like in privacy. It was like a like a sex gymnasium but for apes. Honey you have to run. You're the sole suspect. Only two people knew which She's thick. shoes I'd be wearing to the party. Guys, I'm so fucking confused. What the fuck are they talking about? What the actual fuck are they talking about? What is any of this? I don't understand. Honey, you have to run. You're the sole suspect. Um. Okay, well... That's the correct word, though. It, it, it's... Yeah. It's still a pun because shoes. I know that, but it, it's, it's, it's fucking whatever. Only two people knew which shoes I'd Fuck. be wearing. Fuck, why did I lean my head back like that? Fuck. My dad's assistant it would feel good drove it didn't. me home from the shoe store. At the time of the crime... I was getting Botox. Um. What is happening? It's a double chicken tender. How that man just shrunk visibly. So am I meant to look 45 at 73? When choosing an outfit for the party... 
What the fuck am I watching? Okay, remember how I told you that there is a guy, one of the animators for Fabiosa is an actual fucking crackhead? Who, like, is a fucking straight-up fuck crack, crack fiend. Who fucking just writes random sentences and then strings them together. Yeah. She's confronting the two other people who knew the shoes she was wearing on the night of the crime to frame her. And he said, come on, man, keep up. Herrick, are you fucking kidding me right now? This is dumb, but I don't think it's that confusing. Am I just, am I just stupid? My dad's killer wore my shoes. I was hauled to the police station at my son's birthday party. Again, non sequiturs. You killed Gramps. I'm scared of you. Did this happen before or after she was arrested? No, this has nothing to do with me being on fucking drugs. This is fucking insane. This is the ramblings of a fucking psychotic crackhead. Dad was locked up in an apiary and they found my shoe prints. Okay, so he was killed by bees. Like fucking... Like Nicolas Cage. Right. Honey, you have to run. You're the sole suspect. Only What is an apiary? I just told you it's the pl it's the building where Jane Goodall fucks apes. Would he have a fucking listening comprehension issue? Clean the fucking cocks out of your ears and start try listening. All right? Two people knew which shoes I'd be wearing to the party. My dad's assistant drove me home from the shoe store. At the time of the crime, I was getting Botox. This, so this is who? Who is this man? One of the guys, people, one of the people who knew what shoes she was going to be wearing. Why the fuck did she, did, she, did she fucking, did this guy know what shoes she was going to be wearing? Like, why do you do that? What do you call people up and tell them what shoes you're going to be wearing to a party? Only two people knew which shoes I'd be wearing to the party. My dad's assistant drove me home from the shoe store. Okay, I'm gonna be real with you guys. I ignored that sentence every time I watched it. Now I'm gonna own that. I'm gonna own that one. She literally just said, I know that now. Shut the fuck up, okay? At the time of the crime, I was getting Botox. How else am I meant to look 45 at 73? When choosing an outfit for the- Is that supposed to be a joke? Party, I sent pics to my bestie. Your dad and I loved each other. I could never hurt the father of my child. God, please give me strength. I'm stuck. My son hates me. I didn't know yet I'd find life's meeting at the bottom of the toilet bowl. It's shit. <laughs> yep, it's shit. Sonic meal? I wanted to hide in Anthony's harm. Are you gonna fucking explain the toilet bowl? It's in our secret place. Darling, I missed you so much. What was in the toilet bowl? Open up, it's the police. What the fuck is the... Oh, my God. So she left... She, she got bailed out after getting arrested at the son's birthday party? And isn't being at the son's birthday party her fucking alibi? But didn't she have the shoes on at the party? Guys, what the fuck? This doesn't... <sighs> How did they find out about our country house? I found a receipt in the toilet that proved my innocence. I know who the killer is. I have proof. If you don't believe me, take me to the barn. Bags of plaster. Great. 
Now, check the receipt in my pocket. My husband made a mold of my shoes. The person who who made this story needs to be fucking committed to to a fucking institution today. They they I I, I you you guys still want to defend this video and insinuate I'm stupid for not understanding this? Are you do you still want to fucking die on the hill chat? You sure? Then he took them to the dry cleaners. Here's the service receipt. That's fucking meaningless. He took what the plaster mold shoes to the dry cleaner? This mad woman <laughs> He did pocket sand! <laughs> pocket sand! Don't prove a thing. The highway patrol caught <clears throat> my husband as he tried to flee on his son's bicycle. Why did he kill her father? Shortly before his oh, death. Okay, thank you. My dad made a will. According to it, in case he died, his inheritance would go to me. Not not him. Anthony made a mold of my shoes and killed my dad. All the evidence should have led to me. They would have then arrested me. Will, why is she saying Will Smith? My dad made a will. According he didn't say Smith. According to it, because he look because he looks like Will Smith. Is he died? His inheritance would go to me. It's fucking. Anthony made a mold of my. Get my fucking wife's name out out of your out of your fucking mouth. Shoes and killed my dad. All the evidence should have led to me. He's Will Smith. Oh, that is fucking they dumb. They would have then arrested me. My minor son would be the heir. Oh, so... Oh, he was gonna... Oh, that's why he framed her, because he wanted her... Oh. My cunning husband would be in charge of the money. I lost a part of my family, but I gained a new one. I shared my... Will you hear the music? It's pissing me off. My father's inheritance with my half-sister. What half sister? She's too cute for words. Oh, the friend's baby? Do you often share clothes with your husband? Yeah, that kid's gonna drown. The the engagement question was Do you share clothes with your husband? <laughs> That's not what happened in this video though, man. Clothes with your husband? What? The fuck? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Put this guy in a fucking padded room where he cannot have access to crack for fucking at least six months. Okay? He needs help. Why are you fucking letting him use animation software when you should be putting him in fucking rehab? Help him. Help this guy. Static says, I am waiting for FAP to say that they edited this video out of order on purpose. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. My husband cheated with a robot. Wait, uh, we all know he tried having sex with the Roomba first. My. The best part of these videos is always the first fucking two seconds. My husband cheated with a robot. She looks like one of the, actually, like the Will Smith robots, the AI robots. Where's her hair? He wanted the bald model specifically. My boss and husband fired me on my birthday. 
Get fucked, happy birthday. A cashier is no longer needed. We have a new self-checkout. <laughs> I wiped away the- They took her germs! See, the robot replaced her at the office, and now it's going to replace her in the bedroom. This is a uh, this is a Black Mirror episode, guys. Angman, what is Angman, guys? <clears throat> I don't know what that Ang Angman. What is Ang Angman, guys? The guy from Avatar, but as a man. Get Years, a load when of to piss. get my son from school. But due to hearing problems, Kevin didn't hear get the car. Get a, After get saving a, my son, I promised piss. him a new hearing aid. Alright. Self-checkouts are worthless... Um, hey, Aurelis, uh, I get no dick, no dick at all. Last week, I went to a gay club. When I walked into the bathroom, the guy on the other side of the glory hole saw me and put up an out of order sign. I get no dick at all. What are you doing? Are you trying out some fucking like gay Rodney Dangerfield stand up? Is that what that is? That is fucking brilliant. Is it your idea? Rodney Gangerfield. All right, take it easy. Cockney Dickerfield. Where did you get that from? No, oh, where did you get that from? Yeah, the out of order sign on the glory hole is hilarious. Yeah, I get no. It's just it's just, it's just dick instead of respect. Gay Cummerfield. Okay, guys, calm down. Calm down. Are you sure he didn't say that one? You think Rodney Dangerfield made the joke about the glory hole? Aurelis says, me and a co-worker at work. It's my mental illness. Aurelis. You and the co-worker are going to continue writing these jokes. And then you were going to make them into a YouTube video, okay? Do you want me to read them? I feel very passionate about this project. I get no dick. No dick at all. Now, I'll read them in the Rodney Dangerfield voice. I do a shitty one. But uh, I'll, I'll help out if you want. Unless you could do a better one, then do it yourself. All right, but you the fucking make this a video that people can just watch. and Like Gay Dangerfield. I get no dick. No dick at all. Too deep for... Okay, so shut the fuck. Okay, so get somebody else to fucking do it. The out of order sign. That's a very... That is an unironically very funny joke. That is a... That is very funny, dude. I pawned all my jewelry, but it wasn't enough. That evening... Kurt brought home a Roomba. He got a bonus at work. That the this Roomba has a dick hole in it, guys. Let's sell it. Then we can That's a cock hole. Well, Roombas don't normally have cock holes, guys. Okay. By the hearing aid. No way. This is more useful than you two messy slobs. What spilled? Before leaving for an interview, I asked Kurt to watch our son. Instead, he set up a speaker with a voice. The, yeah, he's watching hypnosis porn. Assistant. I can chat with her about something other than kids and money. That evening in a smart shower, the water became boiling hot. And when I got out, our Roomba attacked me. <laughs> Skynet! My Skynet! My son saved me while Kurt fumed over the broken devices. You can't trust them with everything. They can be dangerous. What's dangerous is being old and out of date at 40 like you. 
I'm gonna be 40 soon. Kurt said devices will be better than me as a wife and as a woman. He didn't come home or answer my calls. I left Kevin with a sitter and went to Kurt's job. But he'd been fired. Like, you, you see, this one wasn't written by the crackhead. Like, you can tell uh, it's, it's a narrative that fucking this happens and then this happens because of this. And then, the, like, it's got a fucking th a thread that you can follow. Right? Like. He's a robo fucker. There was no bonus. He bought that stuff on credit. By the way, she also works for her husband, apparently. He bought the Gluck Gluck 3000. Um, the problem is he bought it used. It's, uh, it's got a lot of Luigi's dick cheese all over it. My the Gooigi, if you will. Jaw dropped. In the papers, I was the borrower. It was two years worth of my salary. How had he planned to pay it back? Yo, shit happens. Deal with it. At home, the camera read. That's just the way she goes. Right? That's just the way she goes, man. The print on my dress instead of my face. I saw Kevin playing in the living room and a fire in the kitchen. <laughs> my son didn't hear me and the door was locked. The way she goes, boys. Terrified, I took off my dress, but the door ran out of attempts. I broke the window and despite my wounds, put out the fire. Look at the filth PNG. I'm sorry I didn't hear the explosion or the fire alarm. Kevin had been playing all day on the new console from his dad. Meanwhile, Kurt was in the bedroom with a robo maid. Look at the giant cum stain on the bed. She's better than you and she does everything I say. That's it. I'm filing for divorce today. I fought for my marriage. Robo now I'll fucking. fight for my son. I promise you'll regret it. I grabbed a letter addressed to Kurt on my way to court. Turns out, he got me life insurance, and all the pieces fell together. He's gonna kill her. The attacks weren't an accident. <laughs> Kurt was behind it. He tried to kill her with the Roomba, though? The least... F that it's, it's a fucking... Floor vacuum. How the fuck did dude did you really want to kill her? The Roomba came at me and there was a knife taped to it. He'd planned to repay the debt with the insurance money and live large. But I came up with a plan too, and I was going all in. In an unfamiliar area. Like just fucking choker. Like what the fuck is I trusted the navigator and turned left. Never thought a cliff would change my life. Did the G he got to the GPS too. I was buried in a closed coffin. Kurt barely held back his joy. Oh, she staged. She faked her death. Now she faked her death. She faked it. Right? Boy. The car burned to ash. All that was left was my wedding ring. My son held strong and didn't shed a tear. Once Kurt got the money, he sent Kevin to a group home. Kurt was already living his new lavish life when he got a man. So this woman, in order to get revenge on her murderous husband, allowed her son to believe that she died for months. Okay. And wh where was the body? Like, don't you need a body to fake a death? Like, who, like, who got buried? Fucking bananas, dude. If something happens to me, my husband did it. I exposed his attempts on my life, the life insurance, and his smart. Wait, she did die? So sh she's narrating from beyond the grave? Watch. I sent this message to the police, too. I jumped out before the cliff oh. and left my DNA yeah, inside they, yeah, the they, car. Okay. Later. But. But, but who did they bury? In disguise, In disguise I, swapped the bag I swapped the bag with the money. Oh my god. That's how I got all the cash from my own debt. Oh my god. Life only god. begins at 40, and we are making a fresh start. That's stupid. Also, um, I got bad news. Huggy Wuggy is flying this plane. I don't think you guys are going to get very far on this on this trip. 
That's fraud. She's a criminal. That's fraud. She's going to jail. Can't fucking fake your own death. The, the, the DNA on the ring? What, what, the, you know, she would have to, like, kill somebody and, like, swap teeth with the corpse. <laughs> you know? Like, that's what you have to do to fake your death. Literally Gone Girl. This is we just watched the fucking shitty rehash of Gone Girl. The moral: Crime is based if it's done in retaliation to crimes done to you. Yeah, you know why this got fucked up because he tried to kill her with like funny, funny little like gimmicks like GPSs and fucking Roombas. Okay. That was extremely silly. Like, obviously, a vacuum cleaner is not going to make a good mercenary. Okay? It's not going to make a good assassin. Like, just hire a guy. There's probably a billion better ways to kill her. Are you afraid to be replaced by someone younger or more modern? Yes. Yes. Yes, I am. Hold on. My husband locked me in the sewer for three years. My husband locked me in the sewer for three years. I lost my memory. It's pizza time. That has to mean something different now. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Three in a tornado. You're a hobo who lives in a manhole. I was wearing rags and didn't remember anything. So her memory was this crackhead. This this screams crackhead. You could tell, you could already tell the crackhead wrote this. You'll work for me as a maid in exchange for food. Ben let me live in the barn so I wouldn't smell like sewage anymore. Do you live alone with your daughter? Have you always lived like this? But he put her in the hole and she lost her mem- What the fuck? My wife's dead, but that's none of your business. He's Ash Ketchum. I felt grateful to Ben for taking me in. Free health checkups for everyone! Health check- Yeah, this has crap- major crack uh, energy. I was healthy, but the doctor's suggestion confused me. You can bring your child to the exam as well. I don't have- I think you have to be dissociating to have a chance of understanding this. Kids, I've never even been pregnant. You had a baby, honey. You can't hide anything from a doctor. Did my baby die? Is that why I lost my memory? The doctor said I had a baby. Do you know where it is? You don't have any family. You live in a manhole, remember? So she's not just, she doesn't just have amnesia. She's also profoundly fucking stupid. I'll go to the police and try to track down my child. If you do, you'll lose your job. No one can know I have a hobo in my house. I rushed to the police, but I couldn't get off Ben's property. You're staying here. Nobody needs you but me and my daughter. I'll find my child even if it costs me my life. Then a tornado ripped through town. Look at his I face. I barely had time to grab the girl. So if, if this is unreliable narrator, what's actually happening? She's fucking insane and he's trying to protect her because he loves her. But, you know, you're not going to get that side of the story from this video. Thank you for the the bits, uh, Duke. Terry Bogard is being a dick. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he is. At that moment, I remembered this had happened. Are you before. okay? Yes. Well, you. Well, I don't want you to be okay. I woke up in the ambulance next to Ben's daughter. Don't you remember your mom at all, Laura? No, she went away when I was a baby. Why the fuck does Terry B Bogard say, "Are you okay"? I feel like that's a fucked trans, like a fucked localization thing. That doesn't make any sense. Are you okay? Why would that be his catchphrase? Maybe. We're discharging the... It's like the energy of like chat when, when, when chat's like, is streamer okay? 
Shut the fuck up. Girl, but we're keeping- Because it's cool, but it's not cool. The woman for another week. It makes no sense. Why would he just randomly ask you if you're okay? No way. I'll give Martha better care than a hospital. It's one of his voice clips in King of Fighters. Yeah, and I'm telling you, I think it's a, it, it's a localization fuck-up of some kind. Terry says, are you okay? Because one of the developers had a rough log flume ride while visiting America, and a kid asked him that. He's supposed to be an American. So this guy was in America and he just took the like a, a thing that somebody said to him and randomly it, like, out of context completely and said, I'm going to make that the catchphrase. Okay, that went from being stupid to being amazing in, in like one sentence. You know? Japanese people love English words without knowing meaning. Yeah, too bad it, it, it wasn't something like your fly is unzipped. Or, you know? And he's just decided, like, well, I like the, the sound of that. Let's make that the guy's catchphrase. You know? Excuse me, sir. I can see your penis. Ben literally snatched me out of my room that night. Snatched. I'm not letting you or Laura out of the house again. It's not safe. I went back to cleaning and Ben went away on business. That was the day I discovered my identity. I remembered what my life was like before the tornado three years ago. He's got her uh, passport and all this shit that could jog her memory. Just, just laying around for her to find. Why, well, he did fucking... I, I, what was the key on the floor for? I told Laura we were going for a walk. Daddy won't let us out. It's locked. Ben had locked us in, so I called the cops. But fate was showing me salvation, and I didn't miss that opportunity. We were free, and my memory was completely restored. The truth is never late. It always wins. Okay. I've never been happier. Don't judge a book My by its cover. My baby girl is with me, and we got away from that tyrant. Today, I remembered I'm your mama. Unreliable narrator. She's fucking insane. These are all false memories. She kidnapped a child and is taking her across state lines. Amber alert. And I remembered the big tornado. So I already knew, mommy. Yeah, this is a kidnapping. God, that fucking sucked. But, um... I think we gotta wrap it up here, folks. Guys, one more time, thank you for being here, everybody. And thanks for watching and supporting the channel. I hope you had as much fun as I did tonight. I always have a blast doing these streams. This is my favorite type of stream to do. As a lot of you know. Thanks for being here. And, and my God, all the subage... Gift subs, resubs, you guys, you guys are so cool. Thank you for supporting. And um, one more time, if you are new to the channel, please check out the links I'm posting in chats, my social media, YouTube, Patreon, Coffee, and our Discord server. Get your buttholes in the Discord server. Get on in there. Get stream notifications and get some dick. The one that you get denied at the glory hole, you could... You can get it in that Discord server. You're not getting dick in the Discord server, okay? But just get, join the Discord server. Use that link, okay? Um, assassin Rapper when? Maybe next time. Maybe next time we do this. Am I going to stream tomorrow? Yes. Yeah, we're going to do some Pokemon uh, Fusion uh, tomorrow, I think. Uh, checking out that but the, the post game, which is really just the second half of the game. But right now, guys, I'm going to look at art. Don't fucking leave because you're missing hilarious shit.
All right, stay and look at the funnies. Like we will start. Okay, so we're gonna start with one that's not funny. I don't think. Uh, it appears to be. Uh, hold on. Something from Ghoulbug. It is a. I think it's some kind of penis ring in a pe on a on a penis. It says Esos. All right, I'm not really a hundred percent sure what I'm looking at. Maybe we'll find out um, in the next image. Uh, uh, hold on. Yep, there's it's it's illuminated. Uh, oh, okay, 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 okay. We, 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 we got context. Hold on, we got context. It says, I got into making rings. I had no what to put on the, uh, no idea what to put on this one. So here's this. And it's a video on Twitter here. Jabroni? Mike, why not? Why not? Why not? Jabroni Mike ring. Why not? That one will actually will fit on my small bad penis, right? Um, I gotta stop saying. Oh, and the other one that we looked at, it says vine sauce, um, which is cool. Thank you, uh, ghoul, uh, ghoul bug, for sharing this cool thing with us. Um, and here's one from Fefemigi, and it's uh. Hypothetically, I am the number one female in the Sonic universe. Ben Shapiro. Rouge. Ben Shapiro. Rouge. Why did you do this? Why did you do this? Why did you do this? It's uh, awesome, Fefamigi. Thank you. I will be masturbating to it later. The L clown made this. This is like the beginning of the stage when you see like the splash screen of the stage when you go into a pizza tower stage. Oh, they look fucking awesome. <laughs> look at her. Oh, they're, they're so, they're so good. L Clown, thank you for this. This is fucking awesome. Oh my God. Um, I fucking I I really hope I get to make this stage. I've been thinking about it so much. I love this L clown. Thank you. I'm and if if I get it again, we're talking about somebody. It looks like they're working on a mod. That's essentially like Mario Maker for Pizza Tower. I'm. I would stream making it, like I would stream the whole process of making that stage. Um, and I would make, I would make a CBT, like, yeah, fucking, like, a really hard fucking stage. Uh, Gastlin made a beautiful, uh, mask boy here. He looks great. Love him. Uh, hey, sickness. The level editor build is a modded version of Pizza Tower. Made by a Patreon supporter who is now a co-programmer of the game, known as Certif. So that mod is is being made by one of the actual developers of the fucking game, which is fucking bananas. That means it, it means it's, it's not going to be bullshit, right? Um, but thank you for the art, Gastlin. Very cool. We also got... 
of this. Get a load of this. There he is in his Nissan Sentra. Coming to mo like POV, you are a soft pink hedgehog about to be turned into a pink mist. <laughs> Get a load of this. Angman. I don't see Angman. I just see people saying Angman because 7 TV is fucking broke. So I don't even know what the fuck you're spamming right now. I don't even know what the fuck you're spamming. It's BTTV. Well, something is broken. Some one of these things Get is, a fucking, load of this. Is, is badly broken. Thank you, Robotnik. And thank you, Marco Pines, for this wonderful piece. Uh, here's one from Plague Beast. Baby smoothie. It's my second favorite drink. The first one is orange juice. Why were we talking about baby smoothies? Was it like whether or not I was going to put like put baby Hitler in a hydraulic press? Was that when we were talking about this? Yes. Well, it looks great. Plague Beast. Thank you. Mr. Plague Beast. What if we found out that, like, randomly, Mr. Beast is, is watches these streams regularly? Would that be fucked up or what? What if we just found that out randomly? That he just lurks in here. I know you're not Mr. Beast, Plague Beast. Um, here's something from... Uh, another another uh, piece from Mark Pines. It looks like I'm going to assume that it's me on the right and on the left, that's Fred Knudsen. And we're in a Tibetan monastery and I'm pouring him a cup of tea. Did I say, guys, I, I, I keep fucking changing where the monastery is. Like it's in Tibet or it's in Nepal, like alternatively. What type of tea is it? You know what type of tea it is. This is adorable. Yeah, and I, I love that it references one of my fucking most brutal gaslights of all time. It straddles the border of the Himalayas and Nepal. No, no. It, the, Nepal and... and, and uh, what did I just fucking say? Tibet. Jesus fucking Christ. Fred should be the one pouring the tea. Though. No, no, because I'm introducing him to a distinct new flavor that he's never had before. I'm, I'm, I'm showing him something this time, right? Thank you, Marco. Very cool. Um... I'm fucking totally tea pilled now. I did since they told me I have GERD, I don't drink coffee anymore. I only drink tea. And yeah, Fred um has recommended teas to me in the past, but I, I think it could be easily the other way around. This is fucking fantastic. From Primal Screen Guy. Oh, speed? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, come, come. This is, uh, fucking amazing, screen guy. <laughs> it's really good. Accurate. <laughs> oh my god. Um, this fucking rules. Holy shit. Um, we also have this epic art of Lil Fella from Street and Sodium. Feel like it's referencing something, but I don't know what it's referencing. They even drew your tits. They drew me tit. They drew. I have tits. Kind of. Not really. But yeah, does anyone know what this is referencing? This is. This looks great. Again, I just. I feel like it's referencing something. No zipper off Molly. He is supposed to have a zipper back there. That's true. Sodium, but I, I ain't I ain't splitting uh splitting hairs here. You know what I'm saying? Um I would never ever 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 do that. 
I like to keep my hairs intact. You know what I'm saying? But uh, thank you for this art. Um, it's the sodium. Very cool. Um, and finally, we have this beautiful piece from Vince Dots. Let's check it out. Ganondorf. What do you think of that? Mr. Pajama wearing, twink face, slipper wielding, vase bashing, clip dreep, botchel mid on air eating, flute playing, chicken holdering, Jesse, elf looking, stoner, nyaf, pluki, shen, milk drinking, soy faced, shilpit, fish smooching, sniveling, sequel breaking, yeah, screaming, Gerudo dressing, Cali, Breek, Tat, T? Okay, well, I'm really confused. Once again, I feel like something be is being referenced that I don't know. He doesn't get the reference. He doesn't get the reference. Samurai Jack reference. I did watch that when it was on the air. Like When, like, when new episodes were airing, I watched Samurai Jack. But I... Um, I really enjoy the art, uh, Vince Dots. I now see that that kind of the, the style of, of of Samurai Jack here, and that's it for the art. So I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. Okay, we will do um, Pokemon Fusion. I'm gonna put the hair tomorrow. I'm gonna put the hair on my face cam. And that'll be really, uh, yeah, that'll be fun for everybody, okay? Like, I'm gonna... Like, make people think there's, like, a really small hair, like, on... A camera, you know, like... How's that look? Can you see it? Add one hair each stream. It's there. It's there. You you you, you can't. You, you got to make it subtle, you know. Because they'll think there's a pube on my lens, you know. Perfect. You see? Yeah, yeah. Because it, it, it's, it's got to be subtle, too, to, like, fuck with people. When we... This is the, okay, we're not... This is the last time we talk about this, okay? Because, again, we got to keep that... I, I wish it didn't have such fucking... It, 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 it's got a lot of... Um... It's not a perfect PNG. You see what I'm saying? There's like there's like white shit in there. Like there's That's because Google never never gives you real PNGs anymore. I couldn't find the, I couldn't even fucking find a better one. All right guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night everybody. Thanks for the support. I'll see you soon guys. Thanks for being here. Oh. Engagement question? Uh Did you know that Roblox is the number one game development software? I feel like there was a fucking really good engagement question for I, I thought of it earlier tonight and I forgot. Do you have a pube on your screen? Okay, great. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Try this again.